Testing, testing, one, two, three. Can you hear me? Can you see me? Am I live? Am I audible? Matt, you there? Hey, folks. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Vintage Story. I'm so fucking ready to do this. I've been waiting for this all week. Now, without further ado... Ta-da! Into Homestead Ida as we go. Thank you for oh, joining yes. us on Memorial Day weekend. We know you do not have to fucking be here. <laughs> <laughs> You're probably missing out on a bar. Are there people or here? There are a few. There are a few. Hi, everybody. Oh, yeah. Hell, I see seven on the stream yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. Hey, and folks. quite frankly, I appreciate y'all being there. You, I know right now you're probably missing out on, like, an uncle who's been watching a shitload of, like, Guga Foods YouTube uh, YouTubes and just really wants to try out his new barbecue <laughs> technique on you. But, you know, that could be your life right now. But, no, you'd rather watch us play a video game, and we appreciate it. No one is staying home for us. <laughs> is, They're staying home and we happen to no, be that's there. Not, that's not happening. They're that's, staying home and we simply happen to be there. That's what I've yes. decided. That That is how things are. That's okay. Oh, we ain't doing let, shit. Let, let me know when I can log in here. Oh, so, oh, shit. I did it again. I did it again. I'm so sorry, Oh, everyone. did you start 1.18? Oh, I'm so sorry. I fucked up. I fucked up again. I started on 1.18 again. I don't there know why I do these things. dog sitting for a friend, waiting for their wife to get home. There we go. Trip. And trolling all alt-right Warhammer racists. Oh, no. <laughs> Always the best. Always the best. Uh, okay. Yeah, Sorry, folks. Now. I did it again. I keep <clears throat> doing it. Uh, let's see what we can do here. <laughs> Let me just close a few things down. You can see why really dumb fascists would be drawn to Warhammer and not understand. Oh God, yes! Being made fun oh my of. God, fascists are the fucking stupidest. Absolutely. Fascists are like at the end of the day, fascists are basically simpletons, and they like yeah, really they, simple no, answers to really complex questions. And, and it's meanwhile. A Warhammer is completely making fun of their whole worldview. Yeah, I mean... And they don't get it. It's literally... There are people who would be into that worldview. Yeah, it's literally all about not understanding the joke, is what fascism and war... Fascists who are into Warhammer, like, don't understand that everybody's supposed to be, sh like, shitty. Everybody's bad. There is no good guy. Mm -hmm. But because their hey, brains weird. are so simple, like, they can't really... They can't deal with anything too complex or nuanced or gray. So they're just easily like well you know it's the humans and they have to be good and look at these humans they are so superficially powerful so obviously they're the good guys and what everything they want is good it's like and meanwhile the world they are running is explicitly horrible yeah the thing that always like got me and like i noticed this when i was like a little teenager and i always felt so smart for fucking noticing blah 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 is everyone loves to like condemn women particularly as as emotional and like driven by their emotions and unreasonable mm -hmm. in that way have you seen how fucking emotional like fascist men get about everything everything they talk about is about feelings there is absolutely no rationality involved and it's like very mm -hmm. specifically fascist men have you ever seen a fucking hitler speech is that cool rationalism no that's somebody in their fucking feelings and it's the same with all fascists all they do is let emotion like control everything if it makes them feel good it must be right that's like fascism at its, it's core late. oh Politics i should let you in by. shouldn't i yeah 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 <laughs> there we it. go all right and with that sort of like <laughs> me, me gabbing about fascism Enough of that. Let's check out this world. Looks like rain's gonna come soon. I have a few things that I know I need to get. I know I need to take care of. For folks who weren't here yesterday, uh, rather last time, last week, I guess. Look, that's the hen house. I built the hen house. I finally fucking did it. Look at the hens. They're looking good. They're sitting on their eggs. They're doing what they should do. However, I'm about to destroy their peace because a thought occurred to me. <laughs> this week and it has been haunting the planter a thought occurred to me this week and now i have to i have to take care hey. of it or i'll go insane here um, we go where is it shoot okay 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 so Dicks, um okay but first Ooh, i have oh. some berries on me uh, i have i have beds on me for some reason uh i've got some ladders yeah I probably because you replaced our old beds it is uh, oh, 11 in the morning. Okay, Let's you know what? I am out. going to. This is this might be a bad idea. I'm gonna I'm gonna go grab a prospecting pick and head out to 
where some iron might be. I planted a quick oak. If I'm not mistaken now, oh no, this I I still can't get like right up in their face. I still can't get like right up in their face. So I'll have to be careful about that. But I can get closer to them than I used to be. Okay. Um now what was I doing? Oh right, 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 right. Um well, if I'm not mistaken, I have a whole lot of things I need to do. But on my to-do list um, right now, and yeah. I, I'm turning my head to take a look, I have to make bronze shears, a bronze chisel, and a new axe, because this axe has it's fallen just... apart. So that's three things that I need to make. And I might as well make it in uh, here. This fish poultry stew is going off. <laughs> is it? I mean, it's 37% spoiled. I'm eating oh, it. better eat it. Better eat it. Let's both eat it. Where is it? Fish poultry, is it here? I'm taking it with me. I'm... Wait, 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 wait. Cross pressure spray. Cross pressure spray. Is it? Where... 37... No, eat it. Eat it quickly. We must eat it. Do not allow it to spoil. We must eat the garbage. Um, the mostly bad stew. We must eat it. Now, let me just organize here. Oh, right. The thing I wanted 37% to 37% spoiled is still... Yeah. Uh, it's still... Wait, math. <laughs> you um, can do it. 63% good. Exactly. And now I let me, I just got to go do a thing real quick before I get started over here. Matter of fact, no, you know what? I'm going to get started over here. Let's just... There we go. And go put right. these back. Put the charcoal away. Grab one. Oh, two, folks, three. it is spreadsheet time. Uh oh, is it time? A spreadsheet okay. will tell me where to go. Oh, oh, I right. forgot. Um, I'm using my network of tunnels to get to where I'm prospecting these days. Yes. Matt and his oh, fucking Mole yeah, Man yeah. network of tunnels. Shit, yeah, and I have to expand it. Um, now that we've got bronze. We've got bro oh, I haven't got all that much nice bronze pick left. There we go. Mm. My thing right now, really quickly before I make the few things I need to make, is I'm gonna go over to the chickens. <gasps> Another pick. You fucker! You better not be an escapee. Come here. You don't. You don't need this bronze pick. I just took off the wall, right? No. Oh, okay. Uh, all right. Into the tunnel. There we go. Okay. I don't know your deal, but you're dead now. I don't think you're an escapee. Nope, you're wild. That's good. That's fine. I don't mind it. I guess you were simply attracted by how well I take care of my chickens. Oh, no room for bones, eh? Is there anything that can get tossed out? Anything at all? Mm, nope. Nope. Okay. Well, I'll come back for you later. Okay. Now, I have to do a thing because, like I said, I've been thinking about this since we stopped playing last week. And I was like, oh fuck, you know what I should have done? I should have used this very rarely seen design element. You very, uh -huh. very rarely see it in Vintage Store. Here, I'll show you. Get what rid of you these. talking about? Take out these. These layers of sticks. And then you just, come on. Can that place requires solid ground? It is solid, God damn it. What, are you serious? Here. Are you serious? Are you serious? I can't like fucking, oh, that's so obnoxious. I can't do it that way. Oh, I wanted to put like a cool like stick thing over the top and it won't let what me. What are I'm you so even offended. talking about? I'm trying to make like a nice little design for the top of the hen house. And it's all like, no, oh. you can't do that because it looks nice and we hate it when you're happy. Hmm. Dang it. Okay, well. I can't fucking Layer sit here and sticks. do this. Oh, that's I have to, to I, that's right, I have to duck to go through here. <laughs> chisel it, chisel it. You can do it with chisels, yeah. probably. Get out of the way, get out of the way, get out of the way, get out of the way. Chicken, get out of the way. Okay, because in here, my bronze is probably ready to go and I can't wait. Ugh, I'm so annoyed. I have to take care of that later. Okay, now, you go here. Uh, hammer, bronze hammer. Do we have a copper hammer anywhere? No, Do I? am I holding a copper hammer? No. So bronze hammer it is. Okay. Now, let's see. We'll just put away that that can chill out. Oh damn it. Tell you what. Oh, I should have unloaded so much stuff. Here. And then that can go there. Alright. Alright, so. And we're going to make a another axe. Where are the axe heads? I was trying to do such a cute little design on the hen house, and nature won't let me. Mm. I'm so disappointed. 
I was going to have instead of the glass roof, it was going to be a nice little stick roof. So it looked, you know, rustic and shit. Yeah, you could probably do and something like that. And now I like see why no one though. uses those blocks because you can't use them to make cute rustic accents. So what's the point of them if you can't do that? Um, what block is this? Is uh, this like the block that you... Like it's when, a block when that is simply, I believe, called layer of sticks. Which is normally for, like, building fires or something, or uh, what? No, I, I guess it's probably for the ground, although I never, ever see anyone use them to that effect. Oh, wait, like stacking sticks like firewood? The same thing with sty firewood um, storage makes, block? Like, stick... <laughs> it's hard to describe. Just, like, look look up layer of sticks in the, uh, yeah, no. in the thing, and it'll show you. Keeps animals in or out. Not so good against the rain or the cold. Allows some light. To... That sounds like it's intended for a roof. Yeah, you'd think that, but I couldn't put it up on the roof like I wanted. Well, maybe what you have to do is place it where you want it and then break the block underneath it. Maybe. Okay, so, all right. Uh, let's just... Oh, come on. There we go. There we go. All right. Ugh. I really should have unloaded myself before I did all this. Okay. And now I want... I think we already have shears, though. Let's you lock doors and chests of padlock. My goodness. Okay. Um. Let's see. What else? What else? Oh, chisel. That's what I wanted. I didn't know they had padlocks in this game. Padlocks, yeah, really? Yeah, padlocks. If you have tin bronze, you can make a padlock, and you can lock uh, your chests and doors, apparently. And uh, I guess that that's uh, people... multiplayer servers yeah, for that's you. Some real <laughs> multiplayer shit. <laughs> I like that exists, though. It's very interesting. Unfortunately, the chisel is very easy to make. So, yeah, I was looking up shoots. Yes, yes. Shoots this, are interesting. In case you folks couldn't have guessed, this game fucking consumes our lives, even when we're not playing it. And, like, the entire... Yeah, we week... literally play this. We play this once a week. Yeah. So the whole rest of the week, we're thinking about it. Yeah. And um, then Matt will be like, you know what we need to do next time? And we'll have, like, these 20-minute yeah. long conversations out throughout the week over the next thing we need to do and what it is. Yo. I'm going to have to fuck... I'm just going to put some shit away, because this that is just so game. annoying. Here. There and there. Hmm. Yeah, so shoots look fun and interesting, but annoyingly, it seems like you can't do half the shit with them that you would think you could. Mm -hmm. It's it's very sad. Like there, I had I, there doesn't seem to be a way to do like a good Minecraft style sorting system with them. Mm-hmm. You know what? And um. Two like tin bronze arrowheads, six and nine. There's strange cool. limitations on how you can even place them. I don't know. I think I am going to go with a tin bronze spearhead. I I would like to return to the time where I had tin bronze spears. Yeah, no, you you can definitely have a bronze spear. We can support that these I days. I remember those times, and I remember the heartbreak of losing my tin bronze spear. And so I've decided to bring that back around. You can afford a nice spear for you. Yeah, God knows. Like, we're just hoarding tin bronze oh. at this point. What? Oh, what? I just almost died falling off a damn mountain. Sounds like Matthew. Oh, holy. I fell into water, which mm -hmm. is probably the thing that saved me, but I still almost killed. Sounds like Matthew. Oh, it was very <laughs> foolish. I made the mistake of harvesting a horsetail on some dirt on top of a mountain. Uh -huh. Of course, the dirt block, block decided now is the time to pay attention to gravity. Slid off the mountain with me on it. See, the thing is, I can't even talk that much shit because that's exactly how I found our third translocator. My foot just touched <laughs> down on the muddy gravel of a lake bottom and the whole bottom of the lake was like, well, fuck me, I guess, and just fell out from underneath mm. me and made me squeal. Like, Ooh. I got magic flute voice, as I believe Brad Neely would oh, no. say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I really, I love prepared. the physics stuff. I was I not it. prepared. Okay, and we have shears, so I'm not going to make another one of those, but I will get rid of these so many fucking fence pieces now that I've organized things a little bit. Tell you what, just 
go over there. I'll be back in a second. Okay, and have an axe, have a chisel. I'm pretty sure we have a ton of everything else around, so let's just make another spearhead. Why not, right? There we go. And then I can just carry around two bronze and two copper spears. That'll be nice. Almost a complete return to form. By the way, for folks who don't know, we have pretty high hopes for this particular session because Matt knows where there is some meteoric iron. But the thing with meteoric iron is you can't pick it out with anything other than any other, anything lower, less powerful than another kind of iron specifically. So we have this long term plan where we are going to find enough nuggets to cast one single bronze ingot and then rather one single iron ingot and then use that single iron ingot to make a iron pickaxe and then use that iron pickaxe to pick out the meteoric iron yeah now there isn't i mean there seems to be like one block of meteoric iron so i don't know if how much i i don't know how good we that shall is see. Like, we is shall that see. even worthwhile i don't know yeah there go the bronze Spearheads, bronze axe head, and bronze chisel. Okay, well, let after those having done out. a header off a mountain for one piece of uh, of horsetail, I'm now thrilled to be picking up loads of horsetail down below <laughs> in the swampy area where I fell. Let all that cool down, and let's head back into chicken land. Hey, babies! I'm here for all the shit I dropped. Thank you. Okay, so how's it going in here? Two fertile eggs. So, you girls hungry? I think you girls are hungry. Let me get out of here. Eh. Eh. Okay. There. All right. And how about these? This one, five days incubation and two days incubation. That's fine. I believe in you. Get at it, girls. Okay. Now, let's just get rid of all my junk. Because even though I have the most, most storage possible here, I'm still loaded up with junk. Let's get rid of this stuff. Oh, maybe I should eat some more. Oh, no, not, no. Let's eat some more of this terrible stew that's going bad. Okay. And is this cabbage stew going bad? No, it's still fresh. Good. Okay. Wow. Just going, tearing through the entire pantry here. All right. And that's that. Okay, now need to get rid of some oh god i'm carrying chicken breast on me just letting it fucking rot in my pockets okay all right and new just pile with the rest okay and how much of what do i have anyway oh i have so much clay i could be putting away i have so many feathers i could be putting away let's take care of that and i left that fucking i left that fucking bird with its bones i have to go get its bones Okay, I do not need to be carrying this. And I do not need to be carrying this. Ooh, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, wow. Do we have, like, no space for it? Wow. Okay. Well, I suppose we can put it away up here. God, we have so many boxes. Stone stairs. Saltpeter. I know we have a shitload of... There it is. Blue clay. Okay. Oh, uh, why am I here in wolves? Oh, that's right. Okay. Now, what else have I got here? All right. Plain glass slab. I'm horizontal. Yeah, yeah. Okay, fine. Now, where are my belongings? There we go. And where are my sticks? Cool. So let's upgrade back. Bronze spears, happy to have you back, darling. And a fresh bronze axe. There we go. And yeah, I got a lot of stuff to put away here. I think you're the pine logs, right? Yeah, you're the pine logs. I have got to find some sheep to catch her. I'm I'm beginning to feel like mm, yeah. not the farmer I should be. I just I deserve sheep. I deserve so many sheep. Sheep would be good. Sheep would be a sensible thing to do. Yeah. 
You got to get dairy in our lives. I cannot freaking believe it won't let me do what I want to do. I'm so angry about it. Ugh. Okay, let's try it again. Let's see if I can't find some kind of happy compromise for the design I desire. Oh, are you not even, you're not even packed there. No wonder, okay. Okay, hello girls. I don't know why this isn't working, but let's see. I guess I have to just put you back. It's annoying. I don't want, ah! gross. Oh, you all right there? No, okay. Now, can I put these on top? Can I do that? Okay, so I can make it kind of okay. Still not happy about it. Still think it, it's not, it's not as God intended my coop to look, but I guess I don't have a choice. Okay. I guess that's fine hate you chickens oh hello here i am invading your personal space again hello girls move 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 or i'll kill you move or i'll kill you move or i'll kill you okay thank you now i've gotten that done and i've gotten the first thing on my to-do list to done now rather to-do list done not to done I guess I should go back and get all that stupid dirt away from the back of the hen house, though, shouldn't I? Let's do that. And then I can get started, or rather continue, my quest to replace the roof entirely. Because as I'm sure you folks can tell, uh, half, the, uh, half the roof is like slate and half of the roof isn't slate, and that needs fixing. Also, the house has been considerably lopsided for a very long time and i've been meaning to fix that and i'll show you what i mean when i finish Are you gonna up even it out is that the idea um the house is super lopsided and to be honest adding the windmill did not help things but it was bad already so hmm. <laughs> so i'm gonna show everyone what i mean hopefully before it gets too dark pick all these up i also have to put some feed in the hen house so they'll sit on the eggs i think but uh, let me just do this first. Basically, the part that's lopsided, though, is the part that is, I'm calling it our bedroom. It's where our beds are, obviously, and a few chests and display case, and a display case. And Yeah, even though we kind of don't sleep anymore. No, we don't sleep anymore. But here, so you'll notice that, like, it goes out a bit more. It shouldn't end where it does. You see that? There should be a whole thing there. But I messed it up. I messed it up, so I have to actually go up there and fix that. And I think how I'm going to fix it is I'm going to experiment a little bit. And that probably isn't a good idea, but it's what I plan on doing. Let's see. And actually, I kind of need the, the packed dirt, pack dirt path to the roof over here, don't I? Yeah, I do. Okay, let's see if we can't do it then. Will this... Come on. Cool. All right. Well, that was... Ooh, ooh. thought that would be enough. Oh, I guess it's not. All right. All right. So basically, I'm going to head up here. This is such like a goofy ass roof. I need to just... It's so bad. It's just... So... And look at this. Look at this satanic single... I need to take care of all of this. Oh, it's so bad. It's all so bad. It's all so bad. Okay. Oh, and I have like no fuck. Oh, I could shit. I could shit. Oh, it's so bad. Okay. But what we're going to do, I'm not going to torture myself. I'm just going to keep it simple, hopefully. And just let me get in here. If I just do this, I can get in. It is. Ooh, that's actually a good point. Hold on for a second. Okay. Rift activity is calm. This is the perfect time to fucking be doing this. Okay. Let me get in here. And let me just get a bunch of stone to build with. Granite cobblestone, exactly correct. Exactly what I need. And also we need some granite stairs. 
Or I think we might. I'm not sure. We may or we may not. Let's just let's just take them just to be safe. Put these here. And why am I like walking around with these crappy little spheres? Let's put these here. Okay. And yeah, let's get back up there and see what we can see here. Because this is like this is the problem. This is what caused it. So this you see the the thing that separates our beds and leads up into the ceiling. How when you go down here, it's like it's set out from the wall. But when you come up here, it's flush with the wall. It's because I'm stupid and I don't know what I'm doing. And that's how I fucked it up. So we're going to have to just tear this entire wall down and do it again properly. I'm very curious about what you're even calling a problem. I, it's it's I an actual real problem. At. I showed people. They, will, they agree it's a problem. It's horrible. Mm. I did it wrong and it has to be fixed. It's just stupid looking. The house looks lopsided as shit. It's a perfect way to spend the evening, getting pelted with mm -hmm. rocks by drifters. Oh, you're seeing drifters out there, huh? No, I'm not seeing any. I'm just assuming since it's nighttime, some will eventually spawn. Mm. And they'll throw rocks at me with their fucking impeccable aim, which, you know, I don't get, but they do. Mm. I'm no. not angry. I'm not angry. Be fair. That's all they've got. <laughs> there we go. And then, see, we go like... But I and ooh, like that there that's how we do it all right and then we can just yeah let's just do this let's just do this right here like that okay and now i can just get these without having to worry about them falling off the edge and becoming super inconvenient to collect again <sighs> And yes, this is very, very mild in the long... By the way, wherever you are, Matt, if you have slate blocks, bring them... Rather, slate stones, bring them home. No, I don't know where I can get those, that's for sure. Okay. I brought you a whole pile last time, though. I used them. They're the roof now. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. So, so we do know what we are doing. All right. Um, here we go. At least I hope we know what we're doing. Off a little, all right, and okay, okay. That should. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Try that shit again. No, oh, I guess I should do it all at once, huh? That was much easier. This will finally look halfway decent, and I won't be reminded every time I walk into the house how lopsided everything is. There we go. Oop. And okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna hope that's fine. <laughs> okay, and okay, and if we go over here, it's one, two, three. Okay. That's fine. One, two, three. Okay. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, cool. And of course, this is all, this is still somewhat temporary because at the end of the day, I'm still replacing all the hay over there. But for now, this will be good enough. Ooh, okay. But now the house, this is like such a simple fix and it took me forever to get around to. Okay. And, okay, okay, all right, see now, see, see how it's even with that one over there, see how much better that looks, this fucking one right here, I hate this, I hate it so much, I should destroy it right now, um, let's see, I think this is good for now, I really have to do something about the pigs, they need a barn, they need a barn so bad, they need a bigger barn, I gotta do something about that, but let's just go over here and do a quick inspection, Yes, the roof is now even. I feel less horrendously embarrassed. Except I am still mildly horrendously embarrassed. Let's just get rid of this. Make it even. Yeah. There we go. So it matches that one. Okay, and we're still trying to figure out what we're going to do about this, right? We're still trying to figure that out. 
because look at that everything's working i got it working you cannot deny that it is now a functioning apparatus but it cannot go through its life like this this is wrong it cannot do that so we're gonna have to figure this shit out right now um yeah so <laughs> oh i just did it like the worst possible way i have to fucking figure all of this out and i'm not sure how i'm gonna do it i really don't know how i'm gonna do this shit fuck you know a thing i could do is i could rip all of this out like all of it and then i could make it like elevated on on stilts or something that maybe i could do that i don't know it's hard everything i i make everything really hard for myself hmm but like that is that's some unacceptable shit <laughs> that's not good no. We are now at the point in the game where you can do stuff like that, though, you know? I'm gonna, you can take the time and spend the resources to make stuff nice. Yeah, it just it looks super gross. I'm going to have to, like, do something about that because I hate it. I hate it a lot. Okay, let's see. Where can I put these? This? There? All right, cool. And, see, this this planter doesn't need to be, like, right here. So let's figure out where the planter goes. Let's put the planter... Uh, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah. Uh, mm, yeah. No. I guess we could just put it here for now. A little lupine. There we go. It's not a great place for it, but it can live there for now. Uh, oh, look at me starving to death again. Get something else to eat. Oop. No. Mm. Okay. There we go. Might as well check the greenhouses before I get too into things. Hey kids, how are we? Oh, mature cabbage. Two mature cabbages. That's always nice. In case you're wondering, Matt is extra quiet right now because he is playing with his spreadsheet. Yeah, I'm doing more prospecting, filling out the map. Still trying to find the right place to dig for iron. Mature? Man, that's a lot of flax. Oh, you're all growing. You're not even mature. Never mind. Okay. Oh, I don't even know. I'm not even going to have room for all this. I'll have to be back. Let's just offload more crap. Seems like the more room I give myself, the less room I have sometimes. Okay. All right. Yeah, let's just put, put this shit away. Because we have to constantly be growing vegetables in that goddamn greenhouse because I refuse to spend another winter starving to death. Okay. Mm, yeah, on that topic, I'd really better come home. <laughs> well, there's food here. Good, good, good. There we go. And in here. We'll put these two away. Now the cabbages were nitrogen, and we also had parsnips, which were phosphorus. So anything but nitrogen and phosphorus really got to keep just carrying carrying ladders with me everywhere i guess K lots is. of ladders that's a good way to live let's get some k and we have some flax too don't we the flax is k so you know what let's just grow some uh some more parsnips where the flax used to be how about that okay back up finish doing these chores and okay now this is terra preta so let's see yeah no it wants a it wants a pea crop or a k crop so yeah so eh. you know what let's let's grow some more parsnips p for parsnip right maybe over here p crop and there we go Anybody else? You're mature, right? No, you're... Okay. Okay. And this wants what? P-crop or K-crop. So... Oh, no. Look at that. No, it wants a uh, K-crop. So that's... That'll have to be carrot. Okay. And... You, are you... No, you're not mature. Okay. It looks like everything's going good there. Mature flax and okay you do not want a cake wraps and no carrot 
Pea crop will be fine now. Okay. Okay, so you want pea crop, so that's fine. Parsnips for you. I hope I have. Do I have enough parsnips? Yeah, I do. Okay. okay. And mature turnips. Okay, you want pea crop, so I think we're going to get my last parsnip seed here. Okay. And you want... Huh. Oh, but you're stunted due to heat. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Cool. Didn't know that would be an issue. Let's just put some carrots in. I think the carrots will be good with the heat. The carrots will be good with the heat. Okay. How about you? Oh, look at all these stunted turnips. Learn all kinds of things trying to manage this shit in Vintage Story, don't you? That's fine, though. I'll get back and get those turnips in a second. Let me just unload a few things. Okay, let's just... Seeds, seeds, and seeds. And lots of flax for the stupid little birds. Because that's what they eat. They eat the flax because the flax is the least nutritious of the grains. Don't know how to true to life that is. But... Well, do we eat a lot of flax? Fair enough. But we do There's eat probably a lot of some things. reason it's not great. Yeah, we do eat a lot of things that are definitely not nutritious. Yeah, yeah. Actually, nutrition, <laughs> nutrition content is pro probably has nothing yeah. to do with how our diet works. Like, the egg roll is not a food group, but we treat it like one. Hmm. Alright. Okay. And... There we go. Boop, boop. Foods we eat are the ones that can be transported from Ohio to Chicago easily. Yes, basically. That is what determines what you eat. Not what is most nutritious, but what can survive eight hours in a truck. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, chickies. Yeah, that's right. Here I come to destroy you. Rawr. Rawr. How are these coming? It's five days and two days still. Fair enough. Okay. Well, here you go, kids. There you go. Eat up. Perhaps going overboard on the uh, horse tails. Perhaps. Hey, welcome home. Hey there. And that can go in there. Okay. <laughs> Just come in here to watch you stare at cabbage stew. Here, you you want some poultices? You give me poultices got, every time you see me. I've got so many poultices. You've got a ton of poultices. Um, I said I overdid it on the cattails. Let's see. I mean, uh, what did I want to put in here? Cattails. Oh, right, right, right. The flax fibers. Okay, we have so many flax fibers now. Oh, okay. Now, I think I am going to put... Oh, no! We have so many liters of rot. <laughs> I can't put this leader, these liters of rot in to turn into compost because we already have so much. I guess we should start a rot... A rot crate. So, I'm going oh, to go ahead. This, yeah. this crate is empty. I'm going to literally pack it full of rotten vegetables. There we go. So, we've got a rot crate now. Just to get it out of my face. We we really do have like, increasing storage issues. We do, we do. And this is like, I'm sorry, this, this is, I have, no. <laughs> I can't live with this any longer. This needs to go. I have to, I have to. It's not cool. It's not cool. This has got to go. Uh, it's just, it has to leave. It has to leave. It has to fucking leave. It just... I can't do this. As a matter of fact, I still can't do this. I need to I need to hurry up and let me just let me get a fucking We've got to have. Did you take every single goddamn You took every fucking pickaxe in the house, didn't you? Oh, I have one. Okay. We talked about this, but you, yes, you, you Every pick unbelievable. Hold on. This is my lifestyle. <laughs> you need to understand. I hate you. Okay. I dig, baby. I hate you. 
Um, I just, oh, okay. So I guess that, that is non-negotiable. That particular block is non-negotiable. So let's go ahead. <laughs> you want to pick up the, Oop. there you go. Okay. Oop. All right. That's non-negotiable. So that stuff has to stay. Okay. This, however, let's just figure out what we're doing here. Cause this is, this is not as God intended. This has to go. I don't even know what this is anymore. This has to go. Okay. Everybody, everybody move. I can't, I can't deal with the, it's fetid. It's just, it's not as God intended. It is not as fetid. God it, it is, it's fucking fetid. It is unsuitable for purpose. It's rotten. It will not do. I will not tolerate it and I will not be made to tolerate it. Okay, I wish you luck. I deserve better. We all deserve better than what I have built. <laughs> oh so bad it's just so bad it's just so bad it has to go it has to fucking go it just this this can't be cool this is not cool it's not cool it'll never be cool okay um let me just run inside make sure i'm not about to lose a brick here let me get it okay so it would have been like here right okay so it did not fall down okay now where was i right okay so this is unacceptable I thought I saw something alive in there. Okay, guess not. That's unacceptable. Um, packed earth? Yes. Okay, so let's just get this oh, get this going. And ooh. Ooh. Ugh. Okay. There we go. Climb the roof to the the sullied area and just take care of this now because look how bad look how bad look how like god doesn't want this i don't want this and god doesn't want this nobody wants this this is a crime i put so much work into this and it's so bad oh i just fucking built it like a uh demon demon terrible Remove it just from my sight, from the eyes of the Lord. Like, imagine thinking this is okay. Terrible. Like that Scottish mom. Disgusting! <laughs> that woman's a fucking immortal. Did you know that? She has contributed more to culture than either of us either will. I love that you reference her at least once a week. That's because she's so amazing. Like, she just, she's the voice of a generation. She is the siren <laughs> song of the age. Disgusting! <laughs> I think I posted that the first time I saw the Cybertruck. <laughs> <laughs> and I was right to do it! I love that you're reminiscing about your tweets about the Cybertruck. Well, come on. I think we all know where we were when we first saw the fucking Cybertruck. Definitely do not. We're like, it's oh one of those God. things where you have that, that moment where you're all like, I am the only sane person on earth. Hmm? Like, no, this can't be real. I'm being fucking gaslit like shit right now. Like, no, we're not seriously pretending that's okay, are we? Like, are we seriously as a civilization looking at the Cybertruck and going, yes, desirable. Desirable, laudable, just <laughs> acceptable. Like, we're really, we're really fucking doing this. Like, as a people, as a species. That's embarrassing. That shit's embarrassing. And there we go. I know this is going to shock a lot of you, but I don't care for Elon Musk. <laughs> Although, to be fair, I don't really care for fucking Jack either. I don't care for any of them. They're all fucking net negatives on society. And I say this as a person who fucking, like, I, I, I readily admit to the fact I kind of, I need Twitter. All right, here's the thing. Here's the thing. I've been over this before with folks, but I'm going to, I'm going to just say it again really quick. Like, okay, so I am a person who is very much outside the system in kind of every aspect of my professional life. I did not You are an S-tier Twitter degenerate. I am an S-tier Twitter degenerate, but the way I got to be an S-tier Twitter degenerate is... There were no traditional avenues available to me to do what I wanted with my life. All right. 
basically if I had tried to do it the proper way, what I was like constantly being told was the right way to make comics, I would not have survived five years, I don't think. Not definitely not ten. And I kind of like to do what I wanted to do in life, I kind of had to figure it out by myself on my own. Which is part of why I'm such a big fan of when people like ask me for advice, I always feel this need to preface it with like, just so you know, I don't think anything that happened to me is applicable to someone who's like 21 right now. Like I, I, yeah. I just, oh, yeah. no, no. I don't think I have world. what are now currently reproducible results. And I'm not saying that because... Largely, there are now better ways to get this Yeah, there are done. better ways to get I what think... you want than the way I was doing it right now. And uh, I just, I know how that sounds. It's not because I think I'm fucking special. It's because the... The internet changes at fucking blinding speed. So, mm -hmm. like, if you tr if I sat down and tried to, like, from zero, tried to redo Iron Circus today, don't think I could. Because I don't think that's, like, kind of where we are right now. You couldn't use the same method. I couldn't use the same methods. It might be more accurate, yes. But, um, yeah, it's like, I need Twitter because Twitter is a, a big deal for my self-promotion game. I use Twitter to promote a lot of my projects, to just talk to people. To frankly, I find a lot of artists on Twitter too. There are a lot of artists I've hired. Oh God, yeah. I like look through the whole. Oh, hey, it's this hashtag day or whatever. Here's my art, and I'm like, oh shit. And then they go on my secret Pinterest board called "Hire This Person." And then By when the way, time comes Goblin around, Reach. and we're all like, oh, it's time to do an anthology. Who should we have in this anthology? Because despite what it may look like, I do try to change it up from time to time when it comes to the anthologies. Mm -hmm. And I'm just like. Okay, well, let me check my Pinterest board and see who we want to do the cover, who we want to do this, who we want to do that. And so, like, Twitter has been very good. It's been very good. But it also came super close to aiding and embedding in the destruction of the democracy. And that's, mm -hmm. like, not hyperbole. That is a thing that happened. Because Jack, like a lot of rich white guys of his age, uh, kind of has this sort of free speech absolutionist approach that... Yeah feels that speech can never be harmful because air quotes it's just speech which mm. is actively not fucking true and also this sort of like fantasy that everyone when they are presented with fascism conceptually will have the intellectual rigor to be like oh well that's not a good idea because the thing is, fascism yeah, appeals to people because I, I actually, it's weird that this is like fascism. We, were, we started talking in the first yeah. place. But yeah. it's like fascism appeals to people because it's a simple answer to a complicated question. There's a lot of people out there right now who feel incredibly left behind by boomers and left behind by the American economy. And they have this sense that they got fucked. They got completely fucked. And, and they did. The trouble is, yeah. you know, they're just waiting for someone to tell them. But who yeah. buy? And, well, the and they are is, willing to believe the simplest answer. Yeah. The one, the one that is most emotionally comfortable for them. Yeah. The one that's emo emotional comfort is really important. And the idea that, you know, there is an identifiable villain behind uh -huh. everything is really comforting because all you have to do is kill that man and everything will be fine. Like, mm -hmm. it's this really simplistic way of approaching the world. But a lot of people like simple answers. That's why so many people are religious. Yeah, I fucking said it. Anyway, <laughs> that's the problem with fascism. Yeah. It, it yeah. taps into people's anger and impotence and helplessness. And it tells them, hey, you're not actually helpless. If you join us, you will feel strong and cool and powerful. And also, hey, you know who the bad guy is. You know why you're so sad? George Soros, black people, the Jews, women. You know, that's why... It's so popular because it's it's that simple, attractive answer for people who feel wronged. And and I, sh I should note this right here. Spend a lot of time, especially if they're as terminally online as I am, spend a lot of time being told they're privileged and they don't understand the context of that statement. Mm, yeah. So yeah. imagine you're like some fucking, I don't know, 22 year old, m like middle class white guy, heterosexual you know, maybe partially college, college educated because you're like 20 and you kind of don't see a path to home ownership. You don't see a path to, you know, lifetime employment. You feel like... And all the stuff that you thought you were expected to yeah. have by now. Yeah, you don't have... Yeah, you know, you thought you would have a girlfriend so by feel now. Like a loser for but, not having. You know, you, you cannot attract the kind of woman that you feel you deserve, that kind of thing. 
maybe that's who you are. And also maybe, you know, you're watching stuff on TV where people are going, we have it hard. We're queer. We have it hard. We're black. We have it hard. It's hard out here. It's rough out here. And you have a very kind of human response to that, which is, okay, but no one cares about me. What about me? And Where, where's my television special? Where's, where's my television uh, special? My yeah. hashtag or whatever. Yeah. And where's my hashtag? They're where's my television that, special? Like they're being, oh, God, it, they're thinking that they are being let down because of the very things that have made life easier for them. Exactly. They're not getting attention because of the very things yeah. that, you know, have, have made their very real problems go easier for them than they would be for another person. Yeah, and the thing that I've always been a big fan of is, I think John Scalzi is the one who said it, that, yeah, that very well. if you are white, middle class, heterosexual, and male, you are playing life on easy mode. It is still yeah. possible to lose on easy mode. You can still it get your ass kicked on easy that mode. You that that yeah. there ain't actual um, yeah. troubles that you face. Yeah, no one says you have no troubles. No one says you have zero problems. But the point is, yeah. if you if you had some addition, some so if you were playing on a different mode, those troubles would be worse. Exactly. Like I can be still additional hassles on top of this. Yeah, I can still walk out onto t into Tutorial Island on Warcraft and die. You know. <laughs> It's just that if I die on Tutorial Island in World of Warcraft, the penalties won't be nearly as serious. You know what I mean? Yes. And that's kind of like, I think that's something a lot of people can parse. Kind of the way that like, there are studies that talk about how you're just like fucked if you enter the criminal justice ha 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 system as, you know, a black man. And there are simply like you are simply punished more severely for the exact same shit than other people are and that's just a fact that's just you know provable yeah, shit statistics bear this out yeah and if anyone dares to study it and i think a lot of people don't want to look at the basilisk you know <laughs> yeah. immediately it is clear no that that's that's how she is yeah and you can prove that with fucking numbers. Yeah, and I just like have all these, and it's like, so I actually get it on a, in a lot of ways. I do fucking get it when the world is full of these dudes who are like, but what about me? And I, it's like, I have problems and no one cares about my problems. No one's hashtagging my problems. And the answer to them is someone showing up, you know what, you're right. And you know what else? Everyone else's problems are fake. Your problems are mm -hmm. real, but everyone else's problems are fake. And let me show you how they're fake. And they, they do feels things. real good to yeah. a certain kind of mind. Oh yeah, absolutely. Where it's like, just so you know, you know, your problems are real. And here's here's the thing. People like, living in this zero sum kind of mentality. Exactly. It can't be it's like that's why one of the things I kind of have grown fond of grown fond of saying is the like, patriarchy hurts everybody. Like literally fucking everybody. Patriarchy also hurts men. Patriarchy hurts everybody. And I remember that there was a period I call it the men are scum period of sort of like internet feminism where that oh, was yeah. like super popular and it was kind of like the thing to just like shit on dudes aggressively. Hey, what do you know? It feels good. It, it makes you feel like you've got an enemy yeah. and a, a solution to all your problems. Yeah. And it's just like, you know, people would just say men are, you know, kill all men. That was like a thing. People would fucking just like casually say that in, oh dear, I'm starving to death. We casually say that. <laughs> We'll say that in like polite company, just kill oh, all God, men. I'm halfway there myself. <laughs> halfway to kill all men? I'm uh, halfway to starving <laughs> to death. I'm starving to death as we speak. And that was like considered okay and cool. Oh, but like, food. you know, it sounds goofy and cheese bowl to say, but men have feelings too, bro. And it's like, it doesn't feel good, especially if you like kind of and consider None of this yourself. stuff was done in a vacuum because, yeah. you know, the internet is yeah. one big medium. And it's one of those things where it's like, you know, men have feelings too, and nobody wants to fucking hear that shit. Nobody wants to hear you saying all men are pigs, kill, our, kill all men, especially, once again, if they consider themselves allies, if they consider themselves aware, if they consider themselves, you know, they know what women go through. And it just, it's, it doesn't help. <laughs> or if there's somebody who's already aggrieved and feeling like they've got it bad. Yeah, exactly. And it just kind of, it's, it's rough. It's rough. And uh, maybe something that's telling you, oh, actually, you know, actually, uh, that makes you feel a little better than you might otherwise. 
but yeah, that's just a thing I think about sometimes. And that's the kind of person see who's the sad like, fallout of this there's shit a lot of days. vulnerable men out there and they aren't just vulnerable because of like the changes, changes that society is currently experiencing. They're also vulnerable because of the society that is being bequeathed to them by their parents. And like the, what I see a meme that circulates a lot. That's like, Oh, I'm such a fucking fool. I should have been buying a house in 2008 instead of being in ninth grade. <laughs> <laughs> like that and it's like haha it's funny because it's true and it's just some shit that you know people put up with and i like i want to like talk to those dudes and be like i absolutely understand your fucking pain i understand your bullshit i understand why you feel fucking deceived and done wrong a lot of people feel that way and we're trying to fix it right now and it's called fucking socialism the answer mm -hmm. is not sucking Elon Musk's dick. The answer is not like deciding you hate black people or women or it's the fault of George Soros that all your problems are the way they are. Like, no. Realizing that oppression exists, yeah. you should not just go and join the oppressors. Exactly. That's, that's the wrong move. Yeah, you don't like that. Yeah, no. And it's like, there's this thing that uh, black folks say from time to time that makes sense if you think about it for like three seconds. And it's skin folk and kin folk, which basically means mm. if you come across someone in a position of power who is uh, like you in terms of demographics, that does not automatically make them on your side. And you mm. should not assume they're on your side just because you share several demographic checkboxes. And there are a lot of folks out there who are so ready to use those connections to rip people off. Oh, absolutely. Remember how, how, many, how many different like, like scam stories we've heard of yeah. where they, the, the scam started in a church? Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, this person came along and they, 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 they talked like they believed the same things we did. Oh, yeah. And, you know, they seemed very good and moral. So when they said they had a great in uh, investment opportunity just yeah. for us, we believed them. We gave them all our money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, it's dude. just, it's fucking, it sucks. It sucks. Everything sucks right now. Everything sucks. And <laughs> it's fixable. It is. It Maybe not in one generation, but you can make sure your kids have it better than you have it right now. And it's possible. And like, join us. Like, don't fucking descend into bitter resentment. And also... Real quick, fucking accept that, you know, it's not going to be like your grandpa had it. That world is fucking gone on yes, every that's, level. Yes, that's, that's that, really Anyone who's promising you your grandpa's world, that will not happen. That will never happen for you. And we know if you are a white dude right now in 2022 compared to every previous generation for the past several hundred years, you are getting a raw deal. You are not getting the assumption of competence you are not getting the same advantages. You're just not. And nobody can get those back for you. It's just not going to happen. So maybe stop listening and to people who are promising. Also, we, we are all going to have to live in a different world yeah. because it is a different world. It is a different like, there world. There are yes. massive things that have changed yeah. socially, technology, technologically, environmentally. That, you know, are never going to be changed back. Yes. It's always going to be a different world every day. Yes. And that, as it always has been. And it's just, it's just, just one of those things. Just, uh, I'm days. like getting, I'm fucking get, like going off a little bit here, but it's because I can't help it. It's just, <laughs> I just think about this stuff all the time. It's like people who are like dudes who are like angry, like angry dudes. Yes. Yes. You should be angry. Things are shitty. Things are bad right now. Things are horrible right now. But guess what? <laughs> Being angry at some of the most disadvantaged people in society will not fix things and it is not their fault the same way it kind of boggles me when you see like older people who are like super angry at younger people about the economy and it's like 22 who year made olds it? who made this economy yeah, motherfucker 22 year olds are not the engines of commerce this is on you this is your fault why are you blaming the millennials they bought too many fucking avocado toasts yeah it's like it's so absurd to me that like this you don't stop for a second and be all like yeah maybe the 22 year old 
doesn't have like the 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 person pouring my macchiato at Starbucks who has like a degree in philosophy and is like two years out of college and has like sixty seven thousand dollars in student loans they'll be paying till they're fifty eight maybe they're not to blame for the issues in the economy maybe no, it's not no them. grandpa it's your fucking real estate investments exactly and it's just. It's uh, I, there's just a huge sense. I don't want to do this whole generational thing because there are boomers who are just as fucking mad about this shit as we are. But at the same time, it's just there's this huge sense of pulling the ladder up behind them when it comes to that generation. And yeah. it, it's like you can't you can't not think about it because like if you read about like a quarter of the shit Reagan put into motion. You will be just uh, sort of like yeah. unbelievably yeah. Yeah. red-eyed with outrage for the rest of the day and possibly the rest of your life. And there's like there's just no addressing that. There's just no addressing so that. So much, so much of this shit just can be boiled down. It was just Reagan. It was just Reagan. He, just the deregulation. It was Reagan looting the country and, lo- and just strip you know, mining the country the and fucking uh, just donors. raising it to the ground in the name of short-term profit and. Then every ensuing generation is just looking around trying to figure out whose fault it is. And it's just like, it was, it was fucking Reagan. It was Reagan. <laughs> Hi, I'm awful. Uh, Hi, I'm, I have not said hello to everyone so right. far tonight. I'm so sorry. I've been very, like, sitting here and thinking. We, we kind of got on a tangent. I don't even remember how. Oh, oh was, <laughs> you were mad at the design of your hen house. I was. And then you started talking about the Cybertruck. Yes. And it was just downhill from there. Yeah, well, we were I off fucking, to the, right. the thing that is like, it drives me fucking crazy about Elon Musk more than like most other people like him. I thought we were getting off this. No, I know. No, the, <laughs> I just, I'm sorry. It's just the thing that fucking like drives me up the wall is like, the it's fucking tar baby of Elon Musk. Where I don't think he has this, he enjoys nearly the same sort of like unassailability as he used to because he has you. like demonstrated himself every day to be an idiot. No, there's some YouTuber we used to watch. He used to like have his book prominently in the background of all his shots. Yeah. That ain't there no more. Yeah, it was actually really funny to watch because he was doing this thing where, you know, there's this big poster of Elon Musk like fucking getting high with Joe Rogan in the background. And it was just really, you could see it over his shoulder. Elon's head was just as big as his. And I remember when he'd pop up in my feed, the, the thumbnail would be something like that. And I should be like, fucking come on, man. And then, like, like, must you be so cringe? Yes, must you be Where's so cringe? Food? Oh God, Charlie, there's no food. There's no food. I'm gonna die. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Um, yeah. no, there's. Go in the basement. Is there any bread or pie? I, yeah, I'll just. I'll eat whatever. There's, there should be pie down there. <laughs> Thank you for pie. Oh, also, oh, shoot. Lucy also, has had I'm, enough. I'm trying of to make me. a beef stew, and I'm I guess too rowdy for the I dog. guess it burned out. Hold on. Oh no! Oh, well, that's a terrible tragedy. Here we go. No, it's all right. It can. It can uh, recook. Yeah. Oh no! Oh. oh no! The death honking begins. The death honking. Try bread. There should be bread. I'm I'm eating bread. Okay, good. I'm eating bread right now. Holy shit! Oh. Anyway, I have thoughts. Saved by bread. I have constant, constant thoughts. But anyway, uh, yeah, I just I I just remember I just remember that period, the fucking I hate all men period of like internet fem- feminism, and I understand where that comes from. It comes from the same area. Uh oh, Matt left. Yeah, I just have to deal with the dog. Okay. She wants out and probably yeah, needs to be It comes from changed. the same impulse where Ooh, it's like, dog. people will tweet things like, I should be allowed to kill at least one That's cis person. Bad. Like, people tweet shit like that. And everyone, in my opinion, fakes outrage over it. It's like, no, I, I absolutely understand where that shit comes from. And it's a joke, for starters. A lot of people deal with fucking abject misery through humor. It's not, like, unusual. It's kind of a known thing. And I think a lot of people who, like, pretend they took that seriously are fucking faking it and bullshitting and, and, and feigning outrage for the sake of, you know, feigning outrage because they think that, you know, oh, I, I can be offended too. Look, it gives me power. That's where I think that comes from. But that's where the sort of, like, I hate men stuff comes from too. It's just, like, when you are, like, an actively, actively oppressed, marginalized person, like a marginalized person who kind of on a daily basis needs to deal with bullshit you have to make jokes like that or you will go actually insane (laughs) i want some meat stew it's not oh god it's oh it's spoiling oh that's not good come on 
fuck? Why aren't you cooking faster? There. But yeah. Spike is bug is cyber trick. Ew, ew. Actually, uh, I can't even say like ew, ew, too bad because one of the things I joke about, but it's not really a joke on Twitter. Um, one of the things I've joked about is you'll know the exact day I have too much fucking money. You'll you'll be able to like mark it on a calendar. Like, dear diary, today I found out Spike has too much fucking money because I will have a Rivian. And if you do not know, a Rivian is like, what if the Cybertruck were good? That's that's the best way to put it. What if the Cybertruck were good? It's it's a car. It's an electric. It's an electric pickup, which I do not have room for or need for in my life. By the way, I do not need it. But I still look at it and I want it. And I have that like SpongeBob meme thing where it's like, I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. <laughs> but every time I see the Rivian, I don't know why this particular car does it for me, but it does. I just think about it. I'm like, oh, I'd love to fucking drive a Rivian. It's just an electric pickup truck. It looks fucking bomb as hell. It's attractive and it's cool and it's powerful. And it makes me want to die because it looks so good. And I just sit there and I just watch videos of it online like a lunatic. And I just kind of wish, like, there was a place in my life for it. And I just, I just like it. I just like it a lot. <laughs> yeah. Jokes about killing your oppressors go in consciousness raising spaces. Explanation about those jokes go in the second space. Yes. Barkwell, yes, camping truck. It has a camping package that comes along with it. And it just looks so fucking good, dude. And it just, every time I look at it, I just imagine overlanding in a fucking Rivian. And it's like, keep in mind, I have never overlanded in my fucking life. It's just a thing that, like, I've kind of had an interest in. Like, maybe one day I could go overlanding. Oh, dear, I'm dying. Are you done yet? Hurry. Oh, hurry up. You're spoiling. But yeah. Um, and in case you don't know what overlanding is, it's just like, you know... Mudding really hard and never going home, I guess, is the best way to put it. It's like camping, but you don't leave your truck. You you just, like, go off-roading, and then you pull off to the side of the road and you sleep. And then you go off-roading some more, and then you pull off to the side of the road again and sleep some more. And that's how you spend your vacation. That's what... Ah! That's what overlanding is. Okay, okay. Here, have some meat. Stop crying. And I've never done that, but I've, like, kind of, I've taken a fancy to the idea of it, you know? Like, who fucking knows, seriously? Like, how, if I'd even like it? Pickaxe, pickaxe, so, you're a pickaxe mold. Let's just make some more bronze pickaxes, what do you say? And the Rivian is kind of like the perfect overlanding truck. And I just see it, and I just, like, I have, I have this whole thing I do when I think about it, which is, like, you know, I just say twuck with a W, because... I am, I absolutely understand how stupid it is to think about getting a Rivian. I have no reason to get one. There's literally no, no justifiable reason for me to have one. I get that. But all the same, twuck. <laughs> Do I have a place to park it? No. Do I have some place to go with it? No. But all the same, twuck. <laughs> if you saw one, maybe you'd understand. Okay, let's see what we're doing here. Um, this is probably the last we'll see of this copper chisel. Oh, wow. Oh, it survived. Didn't expect that. Oh, shit. No. Okay. And that'll be 200 units of bronze ingots. And let's just get some coal. <laughs> let's do four. I don't think we need you around. Let's just put you in. You know, let's let's do two. Let's do two. Okay. 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 How's Lucy? I was just talking about how much I want to overland in a Rivian, Matthew. Oh, he hasn't got his headphones on. He is running around back and forth. Lucy requires a lot of care. Oh, no. Okay, back for real. Welcome. Uh, hmm. I was just telling people about the concept of overlanding, and I was explaining mm -hmm. Rivians, but I bet you still can't hear me, huh? Mm -hmm. You there? No. 
I heard you the whole time you were talking about uh, Rivians. Are you kidding? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're just so used to it. You I know of your love for the Rivian and I, how you will look at it. Uh, you'll watch YouTube videos about it and you will get ideas about camping and things. Yeah, and you're all like, no. Hey there. It, just, it seems like something that we would never actually do. I fucking, oh my God. I haven't been camping since I was a Girl Scout. Aww. Okay, I, I think I've told folks that but, about this in the past, but here's the thing. Um, so my life has changed in, in size and shape considerably recently. And one of the things that we've been talking about is going to be a thing that we might have to do is go to the Vegas licensing show at some point, which is yeah, a thing they have in Vegas, which is believe, more it, relevant. believe it or not, it's about licensing. And it's like a thing that, you know, maybe we should do. As in properties. Uh, yeah, as in properties. And hey, maybe it's a thing we should do. You never know. Let's just do it. Anyway, one of the things I noticed is if you go to Vegas and you go to the licensing show, like, yes, you get to do all the fun, goofy Vegas things. We're not really gamblers and we're not really floor show types. So what we would end up doing no. is we would end up going to see, like, all the cool buffets, <laughs> frankly. <laughs> we're going to see the buffets. We're going to go to the buffets is what we're going to do. It's like the one thing. We're going to do in Vegas. But um, another thing, one, two. So glad three, you're making picks. Four. <laughs> yeah, we need them. The one thing that I think we also need to think about is uh, did you know that if you wanted to camp in the Grand Canyon, they have buses that'll just like from Vegas, they'll just take you to the Grand Canyon from Vegas. And then you can just like go camp at the Grand Canyon for a few days before going home. And it's all like, I've had this recurring thought that it's like, it's kind of fucked up. I live in America and I haven't seen the Grand Canyon, you know? It's kind of fucked up. Like, how stupid would that be if I was like 90 in the nursing home? I was like, I never saw the fucking Grand Canyon. That's stupid as shit. Like, that's dumb. Like, who does that? Who lives in America their whole life and doesn't see the Grand Canyon? It's stupid. So I'm like, maybe we should do that. Maybe we should go see the Grand Canyon. And we could do it when we go to the licensing show. Oh, the other thing I wanted to see. That's, yeah, the other thing I wanted to do in Vegas is... uh. Basically, I'd want to go see the uh, the Meow Wolf display. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Omega totally. Mart. I want to see the Meow Wolf Omega Mart in Vegas. That's like a big thing I want to see. But yeah, I, I think a lot about, you know, basically, please, Mr. IRS Mans, I had to go to Vegas. It's, I, I'm writing <laughs> it off. I'm writing it off on my taxes. It, it would be extremely legit. Yeah, please, Mr. IRS Mans. Yeah, actually, see? you'll have me. Yeah. Yeah, I just, for a long time I didn't, because, you know, keep in mind I'm old, and quite frankly, Vegas has changed character significantly in my lifetime. So, uh, it, it just kind of wasn't a thing I even thought about until the last, like, five or ten years or so. But now, you know, why not, right? Hmm. Be a bad idea now. And yes, I'm, I'm just, like, gonna take this entire goddamn thing and just move it back here. This is so stupid, but I have to. I have to. I can't have it how it is. It's too hideous. It's too hideous. Mm. I'm just gonna... Yeah. It's just... It's too stupid and hideous. Okay, so... One, two, three... One, two, three, and then four. So I need at least, at least four back here. And it's gonna come down here. One, two... So I'm like... One, two, three. Uh-oh. What are you? Yeah, that's what I thought. Crap. <laughs> I really fucked this one up. Oh, don't even understand myself sometimes. Okay. We will fix this, though. It's okay. We'll fix it. It's just, it's going to be arduous and annoying, but we'll fix it. I am making new bronze pickaxe as we speak. Yes. Thrilled by that, by the way. Yeah. One for me and one for you, okay? Don't take both. We, we always need more of those. Yeah. Just endless supply. By the way, how goes the search for iron on your end? Um, I'm finding lots and lots of chunks of high iron. Good. I am not finding very high or ultra high, but um, like these these would be okay to search. They're just Good. you know they're not they're not what I'm hoping for. <gasps> Oh, I'm just now looking in the, just taking a peek into the glowworm cavern. Oh. We should glass this off so we that should. we can and I see should it go, I, I don't mean to go over there and just go, like, check it out and see what's going on. Yep, it's very easy to check out. We've got a safe route towards it. 
But, you know, I have to take care of this shit first. Because I'm just. I've, I've completely destroyed <laughs> everything back here. But now, you see how it looks nice and even up there, everybody? You see how much better that looks? Yeah. Um, God, I. The last thing we need now is for. Right, what? How's the deal? Okay, rift activity is still calm, so I can still sit here with our base wide the fuck open like an idiot. Hmm. Because this needs to go at one, two, three, four. I'm gonna make it go back a little more. I'm gonna make it completely take up this spot so we can walk into it and it's a separate building. Ah, I guess we could do that. Because this was like a horrible compromise and I should not have put up with it. This, can, this should all go. This should all go. This is all unacceptable. And I was fooling myself to think it was. Hmm. We're going to have so many little rocks when this is over with. Ah. Uh. You sound disappointed. What's going on? I'm just, I'm just having to make another shovel. Mm-hmm. You know what? No, go back outside. Uh, bronze shovels might be worthwhile. I'm really going to just might. store all of these little rocks here. Because why not? There we go. Oh, I did not take enough food with me. Oh, <laughs> Whose fault is that? Yeah. So, all right, and is there any other, that's not great. Okay, so one, two, three, four, and then, all right, maybe one more, one more, I think. Yeah, okay, one more. We'll just go back one more on each side. Yeah, yeah, okay, cool, all right. Well, I found it. ultra high spalerite, but um, okay. still just high hematite. I believe in you. We'll figure it out. Go. And this is just. Has anybody even uh, checked out the uh, the spreadsheet, the public version that I made a little while ago? That's a good question. Uh, I did post that publicly. I don't know if anybody looked. Yeah, it's. Uh... I say, I'm having a good time with it. It's very handy. Okay, low fertility soil. Let's just do this for now. And cover this up. Make it look a little more. Like, I realize that there are mods that do the same kind of thing, uh -huh. but they don't do all the stuff that this does. And You're very more importantly, proud. You're, it's okay. I made this myself. Yeah, and I, I get, you know, I can change it if I want to. Yeah. If there's an awful scam attraction, I love to see it for the culture. <laughs> I love it when a construction project in any game like this goes wildly out of control. Yes, that's, that's my life. Mm. Uh, I just, I, I didn't plan ahead. I did it poorly and now I am paying the price and I, <laughs> I accept that I am paying the price. I accept that this was a horrible, stupid thing to do. I just, uh, I'm just, I, I didn't do it right. I just didn't do it fucking right. Hmm. Yeah. Oh God, what a mess, what a mess. Let me get that shovel back out. I will, gotta take this whole thing apart, but I don't, yeah! I gotta take this whole thing apart, but I don't want to take it apart without like knowing exactly how to put it back together again, you know? Because I just like I just fucking know. <laughs> fuck this up. I will absolutely fuck this up. It's like one of the Professor Brothers. Okay, I'll do it. I uh, do the same bit. Just so you know, <laughs> I will fuck this up. <laughs> That's me. Okay. Uh, I don't need glass right now. Okay. Just, I want something serviceable. I, I want something that doesn't look like hot ass, and then I'll be happy. There, we're just going to close this up for now, because I just I just need it to not be here. And so, all right, so over here, the space we need is one, two, three, four. We need at least four blocks of space coming from this. 
So one, two, three, four. Uh, one, two, three, four. Now let's do let's let's just dig back one more, one more, and then I'll be happy. Just one more, man, and I'll be happy. I swear. Okay. Let me just get this out of the way. All right. Just one more all around, and then we can we can think about making it something we can live with. Oh. What? Okay. What? Uh, prospected my way into a cave. Careful. Holy shit, one single block of stone, and I'm now emptying a goddamn lake into a cavern full of drifters. This is what you oh, deserve. Oh my goodness. You deserve Oh, this. hello, sir. That's what you um, get. This is how God punishes you. Funny mistake. <laughs> Did not mean to do this to your home. <laughs> You're dying. Wow. You're dying. Wow, no, I'm not dying. You're dying. But I have uh, <laughs> ruined the property values down there. You're gonna die. Apparently you can just swim back up a waterfall, that's fine. Oh, Minecraft rules! Yeah, yeah, I had been thinking you couldn't get away with that in this game. Yeah, but, this doesn't um, seem like the kind of game that be, lets you do that. I'm gonna use yeah, a shovel yeah. to get it down, because I don't care. God, this is so stupid that I ever did this. Some strange currents around here in general. It's so stupid I ever did this, it's so stupid I ever did this. Okay. And by the way, I'm not going to apologize for getting political because that's what life is. <laughs> <laughs> no one is asking you to. I know, you know this it. isn't that kind of group. It's just I think all the times about like everybody, everybody on like Twitter will be like, oh man, I don't come here to listen to politics. Not that I'm not And I understand escapism, by the way. I understand, like, oh, man, can we, like, not fucking talk about that? Like, that's okay. No. I think it's we, we, we cannot live 24-7 in the discourse. Yeah, we no. cannot live. God, that's Definitely so not. fucking exhausting. No one is People asking who are, like, about the discourse 24-7, whatever the discourse of that day may be. You know, it's just like, oh, my God, can, like, I for five seconds, you know, can I talk about WWE or whatever? You know, it's like, not everything has to be about the discourse. But there are, you know... There's a thing I saw not so long ago, which is kind of my opinion of all of that writ large, which is you may not do politics, but I guarantee at the first opportunity, politics will do you. Yeah, I like that. That's good. And it's just like, yeah, I mean, do politics or they'll do you. That's just kind of how it is. That's the world we live in. I'm not calling it fair. I'm just saying that's what it is. Now, what do I want to do about this? What do I want to do about this? Oh, God, I, I could... I could die here. Okay. <laughs> wow. Okay. That was almost ugly. Um, I guess I could just. You know. How much room do I have? I have a few. I have some room. I guess I could. Let me go put this coal away and I'll be back. I'm really shocked drifters haven't, like, been munching on my ass this entire time, by the way. Um, mm. Let's see. Yeah. yeah, I'm getting away with some bullshit myself. Really surprised. I feel like they're just, like, just getting ready to heap punishment upon me. But I'd... for now, everything seems fine. Yeah. I saved that stew from going bad. Oh, speaking of stuff that's going bad, though, let me get down here. Because, unless I'm mistaken, we had a lot of shit that was going bad. Okay, so the chicken is fresh for 12 hours. So oh, let's just get so this. so much rotten food right now. I'm really going to get hungry. We have a ton of food that's not rotten, and you can come eat it very quickly. Mmm. There we go. Gotta get home first. And I'm so glad we have this torch right here now in this brass torch holder. Makes things so much easier. Okay. Now. Oh, okay. And now where are my sticks? Stick, stick, sticks. And that and boom. Okay. <coughs> Put that there. And so when you get back, there will be a fresh tin, tin bronze pickaxe waiting for you in the in the tool rack. Oh, that's wonderful. I've barely used this one. Cool. 
That is very great. Now, back to me trying to figure out how to, like, unfuck our house. Um, Believe in you. You shouldn't, but okay. Uh, I always have, and it's always proven right. You're such a fucking liar. Um, it's the truth. Okay, uh... Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let me just get over here and look at this. Okay, so this is angled gears and this is angled gears. So angled gears, angled gears, and then the wooden gear, and then we just knock it into another angled gear, which goes into a transmission. Okay, 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 okay. Sure, fine, good, fine, good, fine, good, sure, okay. Um, okay, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to... Go get a few more ladders. I know we've got some. I know we've got some. Do not lie to me. They are um, extant and in this world. Don't count on having ladders. Why? What happened? I've got the ladders. Matthew! I have to climb mountains out here. I cannot believe you. Okay. Well, we... Remember when I was talking about how, yeah, carrying ladders on you is a good idea. It's because it was carrying ladders on me. You're the worst husband I've ever had. Um... <laughs> Can you be surprised that I have ladders? <laughs> Take ladders for yourself. None of this is my fault, says Matthew. <laughs> just saying, you just left them in that box there. They've been taking up space for a long time. God damn it. Getting in everyone's way. They're not getting, getting every, everyone's oh, way Oh, in everyone's now. way. That's in everyone's problem. way, huh? Yep, yep. I hate you. Now I fix the problem. Oh, I hate you so much. Put them to use. <laughs> I just need some logs now. Where are the logs? Do not bullshit me like this. What the fuck? Wait. I can never find any goddamn buckets. What are you doing in here? Anyway. No, not pine. Let's see. I want some... buckets now. Okay, so there we go. Maple. That's what I like. Ugly. Let's use you. Bam. There we are. Get rid of that goddamn thing. Now, if I'm not mistaken. What? Are you serious? Okay, is it like this? Yes, it is. Okay. Six more ladders. All right. Let's figure this shit out, everybody. I think I know what I'm going to do. All right. I think I know what I'm going to do. I think I know. Oh, okay. How are we doing, pumpkins? Oh, well, fuck me, huh? No pumpkins. Fine. No one likes you anyway. Uh, let's go with... Is it like this? Really? Oh, it's just, you're doing that thing, aren't you? You're doing the thing. Or is it over here? How, how do you make pack dirt? That is so dumb. Okay, six at the bottom, fine. There, that's all I need. And then you can go here. I'm so amazed we've gotten through two nights without anything trying to bite our asses. Mm. Well, I guess they're trying to bite your it. ass. No, I'm fine. Oh, okay. Okay. Wow. Look at that. Look at that. Nice view. Okay. No sheep, though. Okay. Um, Where's my goddamn axe? It should be fresh and new. I should have a brand new axe in here. There we go. All right. So, bye. Bye. Let's just fuck you up. Six, negative four, eight. Okay. And... Oh, okay. And... Okay. All right. 
The important thing is we know how this works now. So we won't be able to be all like, wait, how come it's not working? Because we know. All right. Throw you away. Throw you away. Okay, okay. Everything will go in here. There. Oh, God, what am I doing? I have got to go home. I have said that many times. Uh, let's see. Goodbye, rocks. And anything else need to go? Okay. So. All right. Let's just see what we can see over here. All right. Um, let's put some things away. That can go in there, and that can go in there, and that can go in there, and that can go in there. And let's just make sure we pick up everything. All right. So this is where the old thing was. And I think what's going to happen is I am going to move it here, I think. I think. I think I am going to move it here. I believe that is the thing to do. I think RIP wind No, it's coming back, I promise. The windmill is coming back. It's not dead yet. Um let's just do this. Okay. And yeah, I think I'm gonna put it here. Okay. I think I'm gonna put it here. And Okay. Oops. There we go. Okay. Shit. Well, that doesn't seem right. I'm sure it was taller than that. Did I put some away? That doesn't seem right at all. I'm sure I didn't. I'm sure I have more than that. I'm sure it was way taller than that. I must have put some of the pine ones away. That's weird. Okay. Anyway. And, okay, all right. Okay, um, that's really weird. What is this? Wooden axle, okay. Very weird how much shorter. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so that's fine. 16. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. Okay. That's super weird. That's super fucking weird. I definitely must have just like dropped some or put some away without notice noticing or realizing. Should I raid the basement or come upstairs? I need food. Uh, come upstairs. There should be meat in the pot. Hey. Oh, excellent. Thank you. Okay. Oh, hell yes. That was wonderful. <laughs> That's very filling. That's exactly yeah, what meat I need. stew will do that. Mm-hmm. 
know there's like one piece of compost in the plant products box. Yeah. Should that be somewhere else? I can't think of a place to put it, so. <laughs> All right, I'm going to put it somewhere else. Okay. I'm going to put it in um, a random box of random shit, isn't there? Perhaps. Yeah, that's kind of... Yeah, with the slate stones that you said you'd used up. Okay. All right. And... You have got, like, over a stack left there. Sand and gravel can go down here. Oh, I should do some sifting. Yeah. This muddy gravel could just get thrown out because it has no use yeah. that I'm aware of. Fine. Where's my axe? You, sir. Oh, holy shit. What? Whoa. What? What? Where what? is the windmill? Oh, I tore it down. Holy fuck, dude. There's no. Oh, I see what you're up to here. Do you? Oh, my goodness. Okay. Ow. Oh. <laughs> Don't die. Oh. I'll try my best, but. You tell me oh. that all the time. Yeah, my best is, I mean, like, I'm, I'm not I'm making no promises here, believe me. Okay. So, oh, hey, no, yeah, no see. deaths this session so far. Not yet. An hour mean, and a half in. The night's still young. Yeah. That's... But, um, yeah, we had a no death session last time. I we did. We did. Good. Very impressed with us. Okay. Go gear. Oh, no. Ah. Ooh, these red currants are going bad. I'm taking them with yeah, me. Yeah, eat them. And the black currants, too. Yeah, just eat them. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so... All right, now. I think I'll come in and eat, though. Since you're talking about stuff going bad, I might as well eat. Mm. Oh, the berries, the berries. They demand so much attention. <laughs> okay, come on, berries. Where are you? 60. Wow, okay. Here, I'll have 15 of you. Oh, so I'm really missing chat this time because I've been oh. looking at my spreadsheet the whole time. Let's, oh, hi, uh, Kaze Neko. Yeah, pop it out I've been window. babbling and working okay. really hard, so I have not been paying a ton of attention either. And apologies for that, chat. See, there we go. I'm going to try and have everything on screen at the same time there now. We go. Charlie, I just need more monitors. I know. More monitors I forever. know, I know. I just saw, I've that, seen That fucking Lane's dad lifestyle, you know? Yeah. We used to make fun of that, and now I realize, no, that's the way to live. Yeah. I used to, it's like, I used to, like, kind of, like, giggle at the thought of, like, you know, boomer moms coupon clipping. And now my big thing these days is I am constantly checking, like, woot.com just to see if there's anything I need on sale. <laughs> like a grandma, like, oh, well, you never know. They have some very good deals. I'm like, oh, God, this is who I am now. Okay, so this needs hmm. to go. I think the anvil will fall. Yep. Yeah, we, we definitely will need um, at least one more monitor for that new machine. Yeah. Uh, okay. The Badger computer. <laughs> the gift, yeah. Okay. Uh, shoot. Okay. And this is a transmission. So we are going to grab the transmission. We're going to do that. And I think we learned I have to do it like that, right? Yeah. And then I have to do that. And then we have to, all right, okay. We have to like grab the quern, put it so there. On the topic of having too many monitors, yes. you know, and lately getting into modded Skyrim. Uh -huh. and modded Skyrim is a fucking trip. I yes, go into is. the craziness of that for a bit. Um, but like in, when installing one of these mods, it gives me like, and, and really they have a lot of these things have their own whole installation process. They're mods with an installation process. Yep. It's not something I'm used to from like Minecraft land. But yeah. one of them, the, like the first step is like choose this option if you have a multi monitor setup. Like, if you play Skyrim, spaced across three fucking monitors, that is how some people are living. Holy shit. <laughs> and, you know, I, I am I am not telling them not to live that way. It's a beautiful choice. Yes. Uh, but holy fuck. That is that is some graphical horsepower required to pull that shit off. Hmm. Okay, so if I just do this. And like that. Okay, and I can, like, come in and it can... All right. Okay, I think I... Hmm. Okay, I think I, I think I'm satisfied. I think I, although I could switch you around and then one, two, and then it'd be there. 
and I could just walk in that way. We'll have to figure this out later. Um, could do that. Of course, what would the sense in that be, though? What would the sense in that be? I don't think there'd be any sense in that. I don't think there'd be any sense in that. Well, in my experience, there's no sense in anything, so don't worry about it. Thank you, dear. Okay, so you're the toggle, which means you go there. And you're that, which means you... Ah. Oh, come on. Okay. There. And... <coughs> there. Alright. And... Let's see if I can... Like that. Okay. And then you are the anvil, and you are the helve hammer. So the anvil can go at a nice little angle right there, and the helve hammer can go there. Okay, and I can just like walk in like that and just put it right there. Or even, or even, or even. Okay. Yeah, okay, and over here we have that and that, and okay, 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 okay. okay. Um, so there needs to be a angle gear here. Or do I need to put it closer? I think I might need to put it closer. Okay, so that's one space. And you're right on top of it. Because Yeah, look at this. This is up here. So yeah, I have to put it actually one closer. I have to put it one closer. Okay, let's do that. Let's put it one closer. figure this out in the end, I think. I mean, I already figured it out once, so it's not like it's beyond me or something. There we go. Let's try smart. We do that. Did we do that? Oh, wait. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I messed up. No. No, I messed up. I messed up. I messed up. I keep messing up. I'm so sorry. I keep messing up. I'm so sorry. Okay. Put these away. I see. I gotta do the transmission. I forgot the transmission and the clutch. That's a thing. That is a thing. I'm so sorry. Let's try that for the third time now. Come here. And you. Okay. And let's just. All right. Okay. Um. There. And there. Okay. Now. So here it can't be. That's that. And then that's there. And then that's there. Okay. Okay. And then that's there. And then take this. Only took me three times, everybody. And I'll take this, put that there. Take this. Put it here. And now we just find our pieces for like the umpteenth time. Like that. But hey, at least now I know for sure I can do this <laughs> as many times as it needs doing. I can't okay. believe how much you're rebuilding that thing. I have to. I can't so live with it like it was. Well, this is relevant, though. Have you given any thought to shoots? I have, and I think that's something we can definitely talk about in the future. Shoots seem like a really good thing to, like, build your auto corn around. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it stops things from falling on the ground, so... Yeah, yeah. The idea is that you set it up with the intention that stuff will fall on the ground. Like, you oh, stick a rock or something, and... Oh, okay. I understand shoots. 
I have only just started looking this stuff up. It looks real fun. But it doesn't, it's not able to, like, it, you can't do it for the kind of sorting shit that, that people figured out how to use hoppers for in Minecraft. Yeah. It's, too bad. it's not quite there yet. At least as far as I know, I don't think anyone's figured that stuff out. Okay. Also, that you can't do horizontal elbow bends. That makes no sense. I don't understand what they're thinking. <laughs> Maybe they are acquiescing to the power of gravity. You'd, you'd think that, but you can like get the same effect by using a three-way bend. All right, so that's what we got there. And let's just get you hooked up proper. That's what we got there. Okay, so these are the platforms. I think I'll just... Do I have? Yes, I do. Fantastic. Okay. Just there. Two, three, four. Perfect. So now it feels a little more accessible. A little more. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And we can figure this out, I think. We can figure this out. We can. We can do it. I'm going to go eat berries. We can do it. No, you know what? I need, so, some, I need some grain. Hold are on. you aware of whether or not we can get sick by eating rotten food yet? Um, I don't think we can. I'm not sure, though. Really? Maybe I'm, don't I'm trust me. I'm kind of shocked at that. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm going to just keep eating rotten food because I'm well, going to get very spirit. hungry. And all I've got is these old-ass berries. <laughs> that's the spirit. So I'm just going to keep I will be the guinea pig in this. I'm proud of you. One has to. Okay, I'm going to eat more stew, I think. Eat more spoiled meat stew. Put that there. How much is in this? 1.3 servings? Perfect. And there we go. Now, we'll just take the cooked red meat. Six we'll go downstairs. We'll get the rotting, <laughs> the rotting chicken meat. <laughs> this is this is thrift here. This is how you do it. Eight you know percent what? spoiled. Not on my watch. So let's make a nice chicken and onion stew. What do you folks say? Hmm. Six. There. Yeah. Chicken and onion stew. I think it's what we deserve. Because otherwise the chicken's going to go bad. Yeah. Okay, so I guess what I have to do is temporarily put this somewhere. God, there's no place to put anything temporarily. Okay, fine. Here, just hold this. We need more crates. We just we seriously just need more chests and crates and all that shit. There we go. Poultry stew with boiled onion incoming. Yeah, good point by Sage of the West there. What was that? Kind of. I mean, stew is for rotted meat. <laughs> really? Yeah, pretty much. There we go. All right. Now, give me these back. All right. Now, let's just find. Oh, wait. Is this granite cobble? Granite cobble. Okay, cool. All right. Now, let's see what if we can make this remotely bearable. Uh oh, okay. Let's see, if we can just build it into the side of the mountain like that. Okay. And. Carol knows what's up. What, what's happening? <laughs> Ad is committed to science and hit this playthrough, and I'm here for it. <laughs> Making spreadsheets, testing hypotheses. This is how you spend weekend nights. <laughs> okay, so, and this is how, all right, all right. And this is how we'll get in. Okay, cool, cool. 
Do I still have those ladders? For now, this is temporary. We can just, all right, okay. And, okay. Yeah, we can use this like that and then, okay. I think, I think I've got a plan here. I think I've got a plan here. It's a little tight, but I think it'll work. And it's a good jumping off point if we decide to do something different. come in here at night time like that all right and then say we just have to make this high enough mm. because I do not want it this all the way around you see head down here surely I have some I don't okay that's fine we will figure it out and in the meantime this can go here how are you doing chicken soup come on come on you do not need any more wood you are fine cook cook you bastard there you go Chicken and onion stew, finished, ready to go. But that's not what I am most interested in in this moment. Let's see, there we are, hello. I want you, I guess some of you too. But, okay, so 36, that's fine. Stone log, horse hail poultice, maple log. Go back up here. And Look at this. Look how fucked up this looks now that I fixed it. Um, <laughs> let's see. Saltpeter, stone path stairs. Do we have any blue cave, basalt stone, basalt stone? God, we got a lot of basalt stone. Do we have any? Wow, that's a lot of basalt. Birch log and rot. Okay, no, so we don't have any. Oh, hey, found a new trader. Oh, cool. See what he sells. Okay. Now back here. And let's see. Oh wait, no, this isn't new. Oh uh, well. Oh. stuck down here. Ah, fine. Okay. Now. Okay. Two, three, four. at least acceptable for the near future. 
Yeah, I think I... I think I might. Okay. Okay. Looks a little goofy that close to the house, but... Speaking of, do I have any more ladders? I do. Here, let's put that there. Hmm, a little goofy, a little goofy, kind of goofy, sort of goofy. Keep falling into the pumpkin patch looking at it. Oh no, are you dead? Oh, you're dead. I died. Oh, my pumpkin plant, I'll have to plant a new one. Oh. Uh, it's fine. Okay. Yeah, better than it being like one of the pigs or the fruit trees. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Hmm. Okay. Oof. Mess that up. Yeah, this is not ideal. I think I can figure something out that will make it moderately more acceptable. But it's better than it was. It was super fucking gross how it was. And then this can just... Yeah, okay. Yeah, I got it now. I think I got it now. This will work. But, foist. Let's see what we can see here. Um... Really? Nothing? Oh, okay. That'll do. Let's try you. Yeah, let's try you. Hmm. Okay, I'm starting to think that we are not going to get a higher, um, higher hematite reading here than yeah. high. Okay. High is probably not bad. Um... I was really hoping for ultra high, but uh, maybe maybe might have to just actually. stand for high. Yeah, yeah, might have to. Hmm. Okay. Oops. Oops, I did it again. Oh no. Oh, I keep falling in here. Oh no, the berries rotted in my inventory. That's what you Got get some for rot not to bring eating home. your berries. Oh yeah, I, I just haven't been hungry this whole trip. I think it was that, uh, that like meat stew. Just You're all filled up. up by the rotten meat stew. No, no room left for the <laughs> rotten berries. Yeah. Ah, okay. All right. I know some of you are probably like, oh God, she barely fucking changed it. I, I, I assure you I changed it. I changed it a lot. <laughs> and I look forward to seeing it when I come home. Oh God. It's different every time. It just, it was too fucking ugly for me to like, oh, ow. I was abused by the, by the dirt. Uh, <laughs> it was too fucking it's... ugly for me to persist with. Any much longer. I just, I couldn't, I couldn't bear it. I couldn't. I just, no. It's like, no, no one deserves that. God made me for better things. Come here. Oh, come on. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And then. Okay, so. Yeah, yeah. All right. There we go. All right, cool. Yeah, okay, 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 yes, mm hmm all right, got it, got it. Okay. Mm 
it. There we go. Oh. So what's the difference between rot and compost? Compost is when you let the rot rot all the way down, and now it is oh, great for rot. the garden. Yes. Okay. It's like when you have a compost heap and you put like rotten vegetables in it. There are rotten vegetables, and then there's compost. I say this to you like you garden. You're supposed to be like, oh, yes, of course. <laughs> I just, you know, I kind of figured that a thing is rotten and it's rotten. That's the, that's the same no, thing. No, rotten and compost, and compost are two right? very different things. And compost, a lot of the chemical processes have taken place. Of rot have taken place. Ah! Uh, I can't. Okay, where's my pickaxe? I can't get down here. Can I go like that? Yes, okay, cool. I have to get rid of you too. For symmetry. Okay. But yeah. All right. And okay, so this is like this is actually coming along. I'm actually I'm actually getting pretty happy about this. This is good. I mean, it's So it's, the good news is I found an absolute par like um paradise of sphalerite. That's like good. if you want zinc, we can supply the whole of the vintage story community with zinc. That's good. Um just like wow, so much zinc. Good. Now I am going to just plant products. Is it in here? No. Okay. Is it? Let's not sit with the door wide open. Um. No. No. I know we've got more than that. Okay. So there's some. I'll take that. I know we've got more roof pieces than that. At least I think that we do. I don't suppose I have any in there. I don't suppose I have any in the, I know I don't have any up there. Let me just check everything and make sure. Oop. Didn't mean to do that. Here, we'll just put that there. Six, five, six. Oh, there we go. Okay. I don't suppose there's any in here. No. And I don't suppose I threw any in here because it was simply in the way. No, but speaking of stuff thrown away. Okay, so five prepared hide. That's fine. Okay. Um, let's see. Go back up here. Ah. Yeah, okay, I might have to make a make some more roof pieces here. Not a ton more though. Not a ton more. Let's just go get ourselves a little hay, like that. Okay, fine, I give up. Oh, that's right, I can make a straw hat. I should do that at some point. Slanted thatch roof. That's what I'm looking for. Okay, so two like that. All right. Come on. Oh, fine. There. Happy? Now. All right. One, two, three, four. Six, five, six, seven, six, two. Um, okay. Uh, four. All right. All right, I think that should do it. And yeah, but I have some packed dirt, low fertility soil. Let's just get fucking rid of that. Let's just throw this away. This is in the way now. I don't need you anymore, low fertility soil. There. All right, now, where was I? So how's this looking? Yeah, this is looking kind of, See, I have some plans. I have some plans for this. So I'm going to take care of that later. But let's get back in here. Up here, rather. Let's see what we're doing. And, okay. Ooh, okay. That's not what I wanted. Let's get you back here. And... All right. Okay. Ah. Okay, so just 
like a, a, a few more, just a few more. Geronimo. Okay. Now, where'd I drop him? Where'd I drop him? Are you down here? You are. Okay, so that's two. Let's get that grass back. Okay, where are you? There you are. Okay, so one, two. We're going to need two of those. So we're going to need Bama. Let's just get them all. Okay. Okay, let's try that again. One, two. Well, uh, fine. There we go. Five. That can go live there. And then four. Okay, all right. Let's just see if that'll do it. Let's just see. Ooh, I'm about to starve to death again. Here, just take that. Take that. Don't want it. Don't eat it. And I guess I could have some more meat stew. There we go. Okay. Back out into the wilderness. Or rather, back out into the backyard. <laughs> Let's see what we can see here. Um, shit. I almost fell to my death again. Okay. Uh, put you here. Okay. And... Oh, that's right. I'm going to have to fucking... Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, annoying. Ah. Uh. Okay, well, whatever. Let's see what we can do. Ah! Okay, and... And then we need one more. Okay. All right, bearable. Yeah, yeah. Oh, found a cavern. Don't it's die. Not what I wanted to find right now. Do not mm. die. Hmm. Okay. And then we would just go over here. Okay. And. So now what we need... Iron ore! Whoa! Shit! Found it in the cavern. Didn't even have to prospect for it. Nice. Holy shit. Nice. Oh, I mean, I got here by prospecting, obviously. Oh, wow. I just had this urge to save the game. <laughs> <laughs> That's me being back to playing Skyrim. Um, okay, shit, dude. Um, what I mean to do is mark it on my map. Holy fuck. Okay. I'm going to harvest a lot of iron now. This is very good. Oh. Now, where's that pack dirt? There we go. There we go. Shit, dude. This is big. Iron Age, here we come. Indeed. Now, one, two, three. Where is that? One, two. Oh, dang it. Okay, fine. Quality bountiful. Good. Now we just have to figure out how to bloom it. Oh, God, yeah. Do you need a whole different kind of bloomery? We need a whole different kind of thing. Does that involve olivine bricks? I feel like that was like I a I do thing. not know. I'm sure it would tell us if we look it up, though. Oh, my goodness. Well, um, I leave that to you because I'm just digging a hole here. Go for it. I am almost finished with rehabilitating, oh I guess, the the windmill. The windmill is the, almost rehabilitated. The good vein. I, I, I'm very curious about what you're up to there. Oh, it's just, you know, making it not hideous. Um, I, I don't... So, like, it seems like you tore it down completely rather than just, you know, 
Yes. Building a windmill around the windmill. No. It's okay to tear it down. I put it back together. Very Almost. curious. Very curious. Oh. Oh, dear. oh. I almost died again. Oh. Okay, now. Seems I think I am going to run out of pick before I run out of iron ore. I think that's how good this is. Nice. It's, oh, it's really good. Okay. Really fucking good. Now. Let's see. There and there. All right. And you, you get to be something interesting, don't you? All right. Anyway, let's just see about... Okay, so it's even... All right, so yeah, this is all... Right. Okay. Do we have any pine? I don't think we do. I think that's all down here. Pine blocks? Anyone? Oh, look. Oh, God. I just went and did all that, and that was right there. Obnoxious. Okay. But... Pine, that's what we need, pine, because this is a pine-themed home. Let's get some pine. Okay. Pine. Eh. Yeah, okay. I mean, that's not enough. Let's find some pine logs. Bookshelves. Oh, hello. Pine logs. Perfect. Let's see. I think that those rotten berries that I ate earlier uh -huh. must have given me some kind of disease that keeps me from ever wanting to eat again. Matthew. No, I'm serious. Like, my hunger meter has not moved. It's very strange. <laughs> so very, very full. The berries gave me a disease. <laughs> <laughs> you did. <laughs> You don't know that. Hmm, well, the evidence does tell me that. Okay, so put that there and put that there. I have no reason to be carrying you around. Um, okay. Now, what was I doing? I'm legitimately going to run out of pick before I run out of iron ore. That's this nice. This is insane. That's nice. We'll have to figure out what to do about all that. Okay. Okay, 60. Now. Jesus Christ. Our long national nightmare is over. Mm hmm. Okay. So now what I want to do is. Okay. Ah, oh, goddamn you! Ah! Now, if I do it like I think that. I've actually run into like two separate overlapping iron nodes. That's pretty this cool. Is, this is uh, I, I I could not have hoped for more if, if if I had found an ultra high junk. This is industrial levels of iron here. Not bad. Holy fuck. Okay, I'm just going to get this shit out of my inventory. Hold on. Where are you? There you are. Let's just get you out of my I'm inventory. Hungry. What do you say? Put these two like that. One, two. Hmm. Okay, so 
too. So it's just going to be like doing this to me the whole time, basically. Okay. I'm right now really wishing I had a chest on me that I could put this stuff in instead of leaving it in my body in case something happens to me. <laughs> well, don't do anything stupid. I'll try. <laughs> I'm actually very close to my tunnel home, so oh, this is a pretty safe area. Good. so completely caught up in trying to Ooh, I'm hearing drifters all of a sudden. Oh, that's not great. Oh, especially since I am just making myself an ever larger dark tunnel winding all over the place. <laughs> these are mis these are choices you are making. Yeah, yeah. Um if I wasn't in such a rush to get this stuff as fast as I can, I'd be putting rocks on the floor to prevent things from spawning. So I should probably start doing that. I didn't want to do that. I'm not even sure how I managed that. Okay. Oh, hmm. oh Garrulous Monolith is saying earlier, same bloomery, just fire clay. Same bloomery, just fire clay steel you need a whole new thing for i think okay yeah okay so that's cool um I'm curious about steel we need uh what, like bauxite or something for that or borax i think we need some borax. kind of flow I, I, I always confuse those two mm. yeah <laughs> so we need <laughs> okay yeah uh just you know I'll almost fell to my dad not... for what must be the umpteenth things... time we're doing the kind of work you're doing. That's not a surprise. So, Robot Lorekeeper was saying, can things not spawn if there's small rocks in the block? That's clever. Yeah, that is exactly what is up. Um, it's kind of like, uh, you know, building with uh, a half block, like the lower half of a half block in Minecraft. It, it makes it not a, val a viable spawning place. Of course, now... That, this is one of those things that I just learned watching somebody else play. I noticed that you know, throughout their minds, everywhere they went, they placed one rock on every tile. And I kind of immediately, it made, made, made sense immediately, because, um, you know, see. Minecraft type spawning mechanics. Let's see. The same reason that things aren't um, spawning in uh, the tunnels that I've been making all over the place. Uh, they're full of path blocks. And path blocks. Oops. Oh, hey, shit. That, I just used up my pick. Oh, well, there's one waiting for you. Wow, there. wow, wow, wow. There's one I, waiting for you right here. I'm coming home with more than three stacks of bountiful chunks of hematite. Holy shit, we are in the Iron Age. Big time. I have never seen a vein of anything like this. Okay, all right. Oh, God. Okay, Um. pine, 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 pine. And now I am definitely not alone down here. I am hearing drifters all around me. Oh my goodness. How will I find my way out without a pick? <laughs> oh, fun, fun, fun. Okay. Okay. 
so what we will do is yeah okay all right i think i got it okay i think i got it we will do this like that go like that we will go into blocks and we will put you away and this is packed dirt wait do i have any medium fertility soil okay um no we'll take this put that away pick that up come up here pick this up go back outside come back oh do i have any room no i don't okay come back look at this we will Oop. okay we will climb up 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 find that ladder put it there okay then one and i think That's not what I meant to do at all. Okay. Okay, now, I believe, I believe what happens now is angled gears, maybe? Do I have angled gears? I have one angled gear. Let's see. Let me just head over this way. Oh, no, no, no. Is that a deep drifter? Don't die. Yep. Don't die. Do not die. Okay. okay. I don't hear any others. That's clearly not correct. Oh. Where did I even come into this cavern? Whoop! Ooh. That was painful. Okay, now. Ow. Angle gear? I'm pretty sure there's got to be one more around here somewhere. There's got to be one more around here somewhere. Unless it, like, despawned because I didn't pick it up. But, like, I pick up everything. Didn't go down here. Huh. I guess I can make another angle gear. Windmill rotor. I didn't, like, neglect it or something, did I? Let's see. Do not need to get rocks thrown at me right now. Oh boy. Okay. So. All right. I think I. Smell you later. <laughs> I think I must. Just I do not even feel like fighting that thing. Okay. I think I just need to make another angled gear. One appears to have disappeared. Okay, oh, coming home. Check and see if it fell in here. No. Oh, Charlie, the bounty I bring now. Good. No? All right. Okay, so. Angled gear. Okay. Log, fat, resin, hammer, saw, chisel, sticks. Do I have all that? Hammer, saw, no chisel. As a matter of fact, let me get some fat. Let me get some resin. You know, that can sit in here for now. Let me need a chisel. Okay, and I have a log, fat, 
resin, chisel, saw, hammer, sticks. Oh, that chisel's too busted, isn't it? Okay. Oh, okay. I Hello? am home. I'm home at last. And Charlie. Yes. Charlie. Don't I'm throw anything at me. Victorious. I can't hold anything. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just, just, just behold, behold this. this I can't see anything because I'm working. Bountiful crystallized chunk of hematite. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but it sounds really good. It's got to be, hmm. gotta be good for something. Um, I need, I need a new crate. I need a new crate just for the iron ore. It won't even fit. Is it? Okay, it's like that then. I presume it won't. All oh, right. I'm about to start honking. Um, well, there's plenty of food. Oh, Charlie, seriously. How many how many sessions have I been working on finding this iron? I do not know. Many. Many sessions, Charlie. And finally, finally, I have so much iron. Good. I've got all the iron in the goddamn It'll world. It'll be the next thing we do, entering the I iron I feel age. like celebrating I would get ice cream if we had ice cream. In <laughs> uh, do you want my rot? I have some rot as well. I'm sure you do. Hold on. Where does rot I've been live? very single-minded this entire time, so you'll have to excuse me. I'm just trying my I best understand. to to do this thing I'm doing over here. Okay. I'm going to... Um, oh, that's check. right. I jumped to my death. Okay, hold on. <laughs> okay, now. All right. Angled gear. There you are. Hmm. Okay. How about if I go over here and do this? And then I can take this, put it here. Oh, I guess I don't need another angled gear. Okay, that's fine. Um, and then, yeah, okay. Okay. One. And then, okay, okay, fine. There, now. All right. Happy, now. And where's the rotor? Okay, now, let's just go ahead and get rid of you. All right, and now, let's just get you all lined up. Get everything back online. Because something tells me we're going to need some wind power pretty soon. Okay, wind speed 34, that won't do. I want, there we go, 60, 80, 100 kilonewtons. There we go. Wind speed 35, 42, 35. Okay, well, I can come up here and check on it. 67, there we go, 71. Okay, where is my axe? All right, hmm. we are not done up here. We still have to beautify. So much beautification needs to happen. But it's okay. Let's see. Ooh, okay. All right. And yeah, okay, so everything's working. Everything's doing what they should be. Good to know, good to know. Okay, so let's take a look at this hematite. Oh, that's Yeah, it. I'm trying to figure out where to put it. Um, wow. I'm, you know what? I'm going to break the uh, the stones chest. Okay. They're going to go everywhere. It's going to be a mess. I'll deal with it. Oh, let me tell uh, you about making a mess tonight. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. This is going to be second ore chest, which is just going to have hematite. And, uh, yeah, we've got three stacks and plus a little more. And now, just... Now, 
Where are all my there they random are. shit okay. chest? Also a random shit chest. Alright. That. You know that you can open two chests at once? Yes. And have them both visible in your I, I, I saw somebody do that <laughs> on a tutorial and it's like, wow. <laughs> yes, I often have multiple chests open. It's one of those simple quality of life things that you don't realize. Yeah. Like, oh, the game is now unplayable. Any game that no longer yeah. that does not have this, yeah. I now consider unplayable. It's a really Ooh. basic Minecraft should have done it kind of thing. Yep. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Or maybe it should be. This uh, one. Are you keeping flax grain by the door for a reason? Is that it's for chicken, chicken feed? food? Okay, that makes sense. Never mind. So I will leave it there instead of putting it in the basement. Oh, we've got two saws. Yep, we have the copper saw and the bronze saw. Okay. I messed up. Now. Need help? No. I got it. I just made a design error. I need. I think I need charcoal. But right on a sign. That's what we need for that one. Okay. And all right. Okay. And then that is that. And then this has to go. And we will simply do this. Cool. All right. I am trying to have a cohesiveness of aesthetic. Okay. Glad we've planted so many pine trees around here. Hmm. Uh, hmm. Okay, so now that that's done, I feel like the next project that is kind of glaringly obvious is improving our storage situation. Yes, definitely. I would love it if you um, did that. Yeah, it's this is a little out of hand. We have so much um, junk! I'm realizing also that something that needs to be done is um, we need charcoal to label things with. Yeah, well, we have tons. Annoyingly, annoyingly um, you can make labeled chests and you can make trunks, which are double chests, but you cannot make labeled trunks. Yeah. So if you want to use trunks for things, you're just going to have to put the label somewhere else. I mean, to like put signs next to them or something. Hmm. Okay. Oh, that looks so bad. Uh, well, let me let me come see what you've been up to this whole time. Oh, that looks so bad. <laughs> oh, well, it's naked, clearly. It's uneven. Wow, look at this. Oh, wow. You've got... Oh, it's like a whole ass building. <laughs> yes! It is It is no longer an extension. It is its own special building. Yeah. Okay. My own original character. Shut Blank. up. Shut up about my fucking building. <laughs> I'll never forget that. Uh, God, and now, what am I doing? Okay, so bring me this pine board. This doesn't deserve to be here. Um, now, what is this? Oh, it's, oh, right, my sandstone cobble skulls. Um, oh, but it joins via the tannery. Interesting. Uh, it doesn't. 
Join that's via still anything there. right now. I'm it, trying to. Then, well, it does. Yeah, yeah I can go through the tannery. I'm trying to figure some shit out right now. And then get trapped underneath. So it's. I'm trying to yeah, figure some shit out. I don't know yet. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Let me just fucking take care of this real quick. Um. Okay. So, basically, get in here and now. Where are you? There you are. Okay. I, I don't know. Oh, okay. I guess it will work. And then... Okay. So that's how you get in. That's how you get in. Okay. I hate it. I hate it because it's not even, but I hate, I hate it. I hate it so much. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. This is why symmetry is a trap. I hate it. You commit yourself to symmetry, and you commit yourself to heartbreak. I hate it so fucking much. Okay, anyway. Time Ooh, to... Ooh, more berries. Oh, no. More berries forever. The berries will never leave us be. Really, the berries run this settlement. I know, right? It's oh, God. Berries. Now, let me just go back here. Okay, so everyone, y'all can figure out what I'm trying to do, right? Oh, I hate it. So take much. care of the berries now. They'll take care of us throughout the winter. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't do this. I can't do it. I'm sorry. I can't. I have to... Ugh, I'm going to vomit. <laughs> I have to fix it. I have to fix it. I need another door. Okay. You're coming with me. Can't do it. Can't do it. Can't, can't just do it. Can't just do that. Can't do it. Cannot, cannot fucking do it. Will not permit it. I thought I could power through. I'm not strong enough. I'm sorry, everyone. Oh. Why are you losing your mind today? <laughs> Shut up! Right, that's, that's the latest reason. <laughs> Shut up your fucking mouth! It's an honest question. There we go. All right, so, uh, oh my god. No! Why? Oh! Oh God! Uh, uh, okay. All right. Let's try it again. Uh, what? The fuck? Are you doing? No. Okay. Let's try this again. All right. So. All right. I'm expanding our basements. We need more room. Uh, we need more room for storage. Careful! Don't don't make it ugly. Okay, look, it's a basement. Why? Why is this happening to me? <laughs> <laughs> because you're a mental. I'm obviously. not a mental. I just want doors that look okay. Why would you do that? I. I can't fucking bear it. I can't bear it. Okay. This is all you. Oh my god, I'm going to go insane. I'm going to go insane. Sure. Oh my god, I'm going to go Brian. insane. I can't believe this is happening to me. This is the worst day of my entire life. I, <laughs> what is happening? What is it? Okay, what actually is happening? <gasps> oh. Okay. Okay, good news. I fixed it. <laughs> oh, I was about to become the Joker. Okay. <laughs> All right. I fixed it. Good news, everyone. I fucking fixed it. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, God. It's still terrible. Uh, All right. Good news. Good news. No one has to fucking die today. <laughs> Okay. All right. 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 Okay. Okay. Ooh, ow. Uh, you need help over there. No, I don't. I've been doing all this without you. 
Man, you sound like you're having a great time. Shut up. Shut your mouth. Sounds like things are going shut perfectly. Shut your mouth. You come home and you have a beautiful <laughs> palatial estate, and then you're like, mm. so I don't want to fucking hear it from you. I only hear you losing your mind. I'm not. I fixed it. It's fine. <laughs> I'm not. I fixed it in ways you could never, mm. so I don't want to fucking hear mm. it. How about that? Oh, maybe you fixed it in ways I would never. <laughs> it's okay to be jealous. A lot of people are. I'm, I'm truly curious about what you're actually doing there. I am making history. There we go. Alright. Now, before I continue, let's just really quickly... Alright, now. Okay. Oh, it doesn't have to go up that high at all. It doesn't have to go up that high at all. Matter of fact. Oh no. Oh what? So to make these granite stone bricks that you've been making the basement out of. Yeah. It appears that you need, I shit you not, specifically uh -huh. a meteoric iron chisel. <laughs> really? Yeah, Are you it's sure? not. It does not cycle through all the various different types of chisels. When I look at the recipe, it only says meteoric iron chisel. I'm not sure I believe Oh, wait, it. never mind. Yeah. No, 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 it just changed. It just yeah, changed. Yeah, it changes. It, it's oh, not okay, picky no, no, like no, no, no. that. I, re I legitimately thought that we had run into some kind of ridiculous prestige material. Okay, and so... If... All right, so here it is. And then... Let me just see what I'm doing here. Okay, so it's the one right next to it. Okay. Okay, so you need a hammer and a chisel, and you go after polished. Okay. Huh. Oh wow, this is a pain in the ass, dude. Yeah, that's why I always okay. tell you to bring it home when you when you find it. It's way easier yeah, to just no, no, loot no, no. it. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Well, we can do cobble until then. There we go. This is um, this is our fucking basement. It is not <laughs> Temple of Athena. Yes. It will be fine. Okay, this is coming along though. Okay. All right. Oh god. Ugh, I'm close to doors here. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be bearable before we log off tonight. I'm pleased to report. This is good. Cool. Oh, it's going to be well, bearable. That's two major goals achieved. <laughs> Okay, let me just put away the resin. We will not need any more of that. And I have a lot of basalt stones. Ores. More ores. Good lord, look at all that bountiful. Bountiful crystal ice. That's a special one. Yeah, I'm aware that it's special. Not really aware of what we're supposed to do with it. Like, is that I am going to pulverize it at all. I'm just, I'm just going to leave or... it. It's special. I... The thing that I care about, though... Hmm. Let me see this. Okay. Can I just do this? Will you let me? Apparently crystallized things are supposed to be fit with a hammer. Oops. <laughs> Maybe. Alright. So, do you have a compost box someplace? Should I put this rock in it? Okay, that's the thing though. Um, our compost box kind of doesn't exist right now because we have four of them and they're all full and making compost as we speak. Okay, so should I just throw out three liters of rot? Um, no. There okay, should be should a go? rot crate near the entrance of the attic. Oh, okay. Careful now. Let's see. Uh, rot, 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 rot. I know we have some ugly ass boards. Might as well use you. There we go. This is sad. Wow, you are knocking all kinds of things over over there. Um, you heard a can fall. I yeah. Think. Okay. Do I have any more? Yes, I do. I just need you. Let's just put this over here, and get ourselves this again and here we are let's just get yeah let's get 60. let's get into that point you know what? i won't even put it away i'll carry it 
Okay. And now we can just all right. Cool. Okay. I'll figure out something a little better than this, but okay. Now back out here. This is coming along nicely. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Not coming along so bad at all. And don't I have like a yes, I do. Okay. Whoa! Let's not throw you, buddy. Now I need my axe. Okay. Okay. And wow, going through so many planks. Mm. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Uh oh. Oh, it's fine. Now, okay, yeah, okay, this is this is working out a little bit here. There, okay, let's just take another look at it here. Okay. Yeah, okay. Sure. Mm. Oh, that's right. I did have you, didn't I? Yeah. Now. Yeah, I'm getting up there now. So this is, yeah. The, the the there's light at the end of the tunnel everybody. This is this is almost over. There we go. And Yeah. See, and then what I got to do is I got to Hmm. Yeah, like a, yeah. And sticks. There, six. More than I'll need, but there. Okay. And now, That should take care of the lighting needs in here. Yeah. Okay. Let's get this out of the way. Let's 
feels like I'm just tripping over it a lot. It ain't perfect, but yeah, okay. So we're getting to the point now. We're getting to the point now where it's like usable and habitable. In my opinion. Let's just, oh, and that was, that was it for that. And oh, there we go. Now, let's see if we start off here. What do we get? Oh, okay. Now. Where was I? Hmm. What if we took you and did this? So we can't do that. However, I'm pretty sure we could. gotta go anyway, so a little testing couldn't hurt. Hmm. Have to go a little farther than that, I think. I'm going to figure out a way to make this aesthetically pleasing. It is a worthy goal. Honestly, in this kind of game, I always think of that as the ultimate purpose of everything you're doing. I always think of myself as like those pictures of those cats that people use to represent themselves going, nobody helps me in this fucking house. <laughs> <laughs> I have not seen that. I love that though. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just let's just see. Let's just see. All right. So this will go here and there. Here. Oh, son of a bitch. Here. Come on now. Okay, sure. Yeah! Yeah! That's bearable. Hmm. That's bearable. That's totally bearable. Oh, I think I might have done it here. So we just save a space there. And then it's up and there. There. And there, there, okay. And then there and here, yeah. Okay. Huh, 
Too bad it's slightly off. God, this is enraging. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, so that's too much. So yeah, it's it's off. It's oh so slightly off. It's oh so slightly I'm going to have a heart attack. It's oh so slightly off. Um Okay, so, huh? Okay, and now I have. I'm to looking up how to make parchment now. Wall, because if I don't, I'll actually pull my own eyes out. Good news! We're getting a larger pool. Um. Oh. Okay. Cool. Because <laughs> if we don't, I'll fucking die. Oh, I see. What... Okay. Shut yep, up. Yep, yep. <laughs> Don't even I fucking am... say it like that. How dare you? You committed yourself to symmetry, didn't I you? I have. I have. And you These know... are the laments of someone who committed herself to symmetry. Well, what is wrong with symmetry? Well, <laughs> there are all the problems you're having now. For these example. are not problems. <laughs> it doesn't sound like these, these are, not, are problems. not problems. You've been losing your mind this whole time. No, I haven't. I've have been back making something house. beautiful, which is something you wouldn't know anything about. Check out the basement. <laughs> the basement is going to be beautiful. It's, it's going to be. It I'm is. It is, actually. It is going to be beautiful, actually. And then you'll be all like, oh, it looks so nice. And I'll be all like, I know, get out. You understand that I'm the one making the basement right now, right? Um, what am I doing, then? What do you call this? This is like some kind of mezzanine. No, this is not a mezzanine. This is the leather works. You this know, the thing that like made the backpack you're wearing place. right fucking now. This is this is not a basement. You just walk down some stairs to go in here, and there's not even a wall between this and the living room. This is a conversation pit. Oh, I'm so sorry that you have such wildly outdated ideas about what constitutes a basement. Basement is down here. No, you don't know anything about basements. I'm sorry to be. I wish, I wish you would come see sorry, the basement. Sorry, you know what? Sorry, it had to be me. The like, I had to be the one to let you know. You don't know anything about basements. <laughs> that's that's a shame. That's a goddamn shame. I I cannot. I'm believe so sorry. You to, think I'm sorry. It had to be me. That part of the same floor. I wish it could have come from someone like who gave a fuck. Three but it has feet to be lower me, okay? is a basement. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry about your lack of taste. Oh, so sorry about being raised in a barn. So wrong. By about hyenas. So I'm so sorry about all, all of the time. it. It's really hampered you seriously, though. it really shows in moments Early. like this. I'm so sorry. Early. Early. Seriously. Come see the basement. Hold on. Come see what I'm doing before I continue any further with it. Ugh. Fine. I have to I have to fix so much down here now. Over here in the actual basement. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did I make it worse? One, two. One, two. I just I think you are kind of setting yourself up to keep making these one block no. changes. No. Shut up. What am I doing? Just take me. Take me. Just take me. Just take me. Let me give you something new to be mad about. Come here. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Look, 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 look. So this is not necessarily how this is going to go. Okay. But I'm kind of thinking ranks of trunks, which will all be accessible. You better put some lights here. in here, bro. Oh, God, obviously. However, look below you. Yeah. Not really that big a problem right now. There ain't nothing spawning on this stuff. However, things will spawn up here unless I put some trunks yes. here. Yes, so these, are, these do look holes. nice. But I'm not sure if that's how I want to do it. Um, Everything is Because also, we've got a shit ton of crates. Some kind of crate special. Crate didn't specific you say you were bringing home idea. lead at one point and then you just didn't and disappointed me? Oh, if you want. if you, Well, my inventory filled up, filled up or I ran out of pick or something like that. Mm -hmm. But I can definitely get lead. Lead is very available. I have to what would we do with lead? Oh. I have to fix everything. Um, oh, okay. So over oh. here is like that. And then, so this needs to come down, basically. This, this has to go. And that means that this has to go. And that means that this has to go. And that means that this has to uh, Ooh, medium rift activity. That's why oh, I mean, wow. That's no just what I need to deal with right now. <laughs> How wonderful. That's exactly what I wanted to be dealing with. I'm, oh, are you uh, doing stuff outside? 
no i'm just like okay. trying my fucking damnedest to not go insane and i'm just i i like everyone is seems to content seems content to live in like the ugliest place ever but not me and somehow that makes me wrong oh god now i have to move this <laughs> this is what i was fucking saying No, it's right it's good and it's right Oh, shit. Okay. This is why you were better off making it separate building. I don't want to hear it from you. Not from oh, anyone but dude. you. You understand? You know, another one of the many benefits of having a network of tunnels? Shut up about You can't see shit in I'll... one room that's connected by a tunnel I will actually from another room that's connected by a tunnel. One more word it doesn't matter if tunnels. they line up. I it's will fine. absolutely They're murder separate you. separate places. I'll murder you. I'll kill you. I'll kill myself. <laughs> I'll do it on Christmas. Do not fuck with me. <laughs> So much better. Okay, okay, okay. Where uh, <laughs> where are the logs we don't care about? Uh, just don't use um, oak maple. or pine. Yeah, we don't care about maple. We've got loads of maple. Okay. All right. All right. I think I think we're getting somewhere now. Okay. All right. Okay. Now. So many boards. How do I keep running out? Where are they? Ah, oh, here's some. Okay. Oh, I saw something outside. Yeah. Little shit's crawling towards out. me as we speak. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. <sighs> what? What's going on? What was that? What was that gasp? What's it? What's up? Murder happens. Oh. That's all. Oh, okay. A little murder. <sighs> okay. I think I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. Oh, it's so much better now. Uh, like I said last okay. week, I have found... So many horse tails, so many cat tails, that I fear nothing. Okay. They cannot defeat my supply of poultices. Oh. oh, do you all see how much better it is now? Oh, oh I'm a genius. Okay. Now. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. Just perfect. Just fucking perfect. Perfect, perfect. Like, literally perfect. I did it perfectly. Okay. And now... Here's a here's a here's a little bit that uh let's just get these back a little a little bit that I didn't anticipate. Now that this place is even, it will only need one of these that we can hang in the middle, which will be like here. There we go. See, just come down like that, and oh no, I guess it'll be over here. Those, these will be over here. No, it'll be here. Okay. Mm. Yeah, that's correct. Okay. Okay. And no, everything's <laughs> They're fighting. <laughs> 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 oh, it's okay. We love each other. <laughs> oh god. No, you know what? Mm. I should I should be keeping a bucket down here. Uh, there we go. You can go there. Let's get you pushed back in the corner. All right. And you are going to have to stay there for now. Okay. But let's do this. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Shit. Um, wait. So we have oh, a bucket of job. honey there. Do we have no other buckets? Because I could swear we had other buckets. I thought we had three buckets. I do not have a bucket in my inventory. I'll tell you that. I could swear we had three buckets. So we have a bucket full of honey. We have a bucket over there. Do we have a bucket just like chilling in the basement? Is that what we have? No, you know what we have? It's under the fruit press. Oh, of course. Yeah, I'll get it. Hold on. Oh, hello there, bucket. Empty. And then we'll do this. Yeah, we'll do this. And yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, and then we'll take, and we'll go, and then we'll go. There we go. So now it's smooth again. It's smooth. And we'll do this. Pick up these rocks. And we will quite simply put some decent dirt down. No, you know what? 
This is... Oh, I hear something. I hear something. Something growled. Mm -hmm. I know it can't be up here because it's too well lit for that shit. So where is it? Outside. Hi, isn't it? Heard something growl out here. Mm. I think it's too light for that, but what time is it? 4 a.m. Heard something. Anyway. I fixed it. I fixed it. Okay. Oh. I fixed it. I fixed it. I'm going to go get some muddy gravel. Muddy gravel? You want muddy gravel I for something? Muddy gravel. Oh, for the bottom of the pool. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I guess I need a shovel. Yes, I do. All right, come here. Cool. All right. Because the little sifting pool has got to look like, you know, a pool. Yeah, no, that's good. Oh, it's already, it's looking better already. It's not quite done. Don't get me wrong. Not quite done at all. But looking better. Okay. Okay. Now, muddy gravel. I hear something. Yeah, definitely. It could be underneath me. Huh. It's weird. Oh, it's now light out. Oh. Jesus Christ, that sounded like a goddamn earthquake. Whoa! <laughs> I just walked into the room and the ceiling falls in on me. <laughs> I'm trying to kill you because I don't love you anymore. Oh, clearly. Um, but yeah, actually, as you always these suspected, it's daylight. There he is. There is the motherfucker. There we go. That's better. Now, where's my shovel? Oh no 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 no! You come back here. <laughs> Okay. Don't really like this anymore, though. Do I have any? Yes, I do. Now we can just take this, put this here. There we are. That's better. There we go. There we go. That looks a little more intentional. There we go. Huh. That'll do it. Now, how many? Seven. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, I forgot I found bookshelves. We haven't yeah. figured out how to use those yet. One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven. Do we have the, that little rock thing still? Yeah, we do. Okay. Boop, boop, boop. Oof. Guess we're gonna have to go upstairs. Put, oh. I heard him. 
I think yeah, he, yeah, there is still something out there. He might be on the roof or something. Is he up here? Maybe to the west of the building. That's weird. Okay, anyway, let's put these throwables. In the Maybe in the pumpkin patch, actually. Maybe. Oh, you know what? I bet you you're right. It's falling down. Yeah. Mm. Okay. I not seen anything around here. Now, let's go ahead and find. That's granite hmm. gravel. No, I'm not even hearing it from the surface. Huh. Oh, wait, it's maybe over. Is it in here? Yes, it hmm. is. Sometimes I think the hill next to the house is hollow. Maybe. I mean, it's had a whole bunch of rock slides. All kinds of stuff could be going on in there. Hmm, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I'm hearing it more from in the house than outside it. Yeah. That's troubling. Okay. Hello. Hello. There you are, you fucker. Oh. You found it? Yeah. Good. One of them, anyway. So that's lit. Not hearing anything else right now. This is lit. Okay. Oh, this trunk full of all the stuff you were using to do this work. Wow. <laughs> That's a good idea. I had to. Yeah, clearly. Okay, and this can go here, and this can go here. All right. <clears throat> Let's celebrate with chicken and onions. More chicken and onions, please. More chicken and onions, please. All right, now, where was I? Right, 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 right. I know what I was doing. Um, you, you have something, don't you? Or did I put it up here? I did put it up here. Let's get you. Oh, come on. Oh, really? Oh, I can't. Of course. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Now, do I have any? No, I don't. Hmm. Let's see. Let's try that. Okay. Oop. Okay, let's try this again. Let's just, there we go. Ugh. Oh my god. Ooh, placing this glass is always such a huge pain in the butt. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, now. Alright. 
so do I have any more pine blocks? Now I have to go get some more. Okay. <coughs> Knew that would hurt. Okay. Okay. So, pine. Pine. All right, that should do it, I think. Boop. You know what? Boop. There we go. That should do it. And there we go. Now let's try that again. I will finish this tower. It has been it has stood uncompleted, incomplete for too long. Okay. refuse to log off well ever but i refuse to log off <laughs> without this being finished i just self-awareness oh my god <laughs> crushed by it log off. okay um i'm realizing now that i need to go and get just a lot of granite cobble just making it myself is a waste of time i there are loads of ruins to harvest it from uh-huh in the style of the the Iron Age uh, British person. Are you are you doing and the uh, the whole steal? I'm doing. From... Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna. I'm stealing from a ruin. I'm gonna head north and dig up a ruin. Sounds like yeah. a plan. Ow. Be careful. No. <laughs> I guess not. <laughs> Sound of things. <laughs> Okay. Um, shit, I should eat more food before I go. No. Where we go? Probably going to use up this pick okay, gathering this stuff. And... Okay, that won't do, though. Let's try that again. Okay. Holy shit, are you serious? Are you serious? On on. It's just like, uh, it's just, it's painful. Like, it's weird how the glass behaves sometimes. Hmm. Are you? Okay. Oh my god. Okay, I give up. That's it. We're doing it ugly style. I wanted to avoid this, but fine. Hmm. Oh, no, we are... All right, there. No. Okay. I suppose swimming used up, uses up more satiety than walking. It would make sense for this game. I feel like, I feel like it must. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that is not correct. All right. So we are just going to... Oh, for God's sake. Oh, the agony of building this. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. There we are. Okay, now. Oh, finally. Oh. Finally. Okay. Now watch me go look at it and it like doesn't even look good. Like that 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 would be the absolute topper if I don't like how it looks. Hmm. Okay. And no, I like it. I like seeing. I like that. Good. Okay. And it's August and there are still blocks of ice in this water. <laughs> that is insanity. Yeah. Okay, so gotta plug this hole. Gotta climb up here. So, by the way, it is fucking August. Damn. Yeah. It was like just a few sessions ago, we were waiting for spring to come. Yep. 
Hmm. Do I have, yes I do, okay. Okay. All right. Okay, let's just change it up a little then. Where's my X? Resisting my urges to gather horsetails. You do not need any more. We really don't. We we are now at the um, crate point of story. Yeah, we are at the crate full of uh, poultices point. Okay. I'm not sure how I feel about that, but I think I can tolerate it. And I need. Okay. Now. Oh. Okay. And I do not believe this will get in the light. Perfect. Okay. And. And. Nice. All right. Hear it spinning in my ear. Okay. Ah. Okay. Of course, now build it up maybe one or two more and then put a roof on it and then it'll actually be fucking done that's exciting yes indeed it'll actually be done i won't have to think for think about it for a while won't that be nice <laughs> okay mm. now let's just get a distance look at it shall we hey bony soil you knew there had to be more here let's just zip back here and take a look Oh my god, a lot. Barely any difference from this. <laughs> but let's just see. Oh, that looks way better, but now it just makes the house look really nasty. <laughs> oh god, look at Lifestyle inflation. Look how fucking bad the house looks, y'all. Look at that. Oh my god. I mean, it's such a pretty windmill that the house now has to be fixed up. Oh, it looks so ugly. Are there piglets yet? No. Whoa, what was that? Wow, okay, didn't like that much. What's on? Oh, uh, just some dirt fell in the pig pen, and I'm not a fan. Mm. Make sure these 
guys are okay. Yeah, they're fine. Okay. I think I'll go check on the chickens. Hello, darlings. Oh, hey, eggies. Eggies. I'll take that eggy. One day and three days. Ooh, another eggy. And over here we have two for the legs, three for the legs, one for the leg. Okay. Okay. Move it, girls. Come on, Hortense, move. No, Hortense, go. Thank you. All right. Put these eggs in the basement. Fish and turnip. Let's see what fish and turnips do. Because why not, right? Mm. Yeah, that reminds me. I've got to get more fish on the way home. Because <laughs> I got one, and as I learned last session, fish need to be uh, cooked in multiples of four, right? Yes. Yeah, so I gotta get more fish. Multiples of two, actually, but yeah. Well, two? Okay, well, that's better. There we go. Now. Oh, God, I didn't mean to do that. Ugh. Sometimes I just want to, like, actually excavate these ruins instead of tearing them apart and see what kind of shape they actually are uh -huh. underneath the dirt. I mean, you're welcome to. It's uh, something to consider another time, maybe. And we don't desperately need cobble. I need pine. Not pine, don't we? No, we got tons. Don't worry. Okay. There we go. Just for fun. It's just sixteen. And boop. There we go. That should take care of all our pine needs for the foreseeable future. Is this stew done yet? Hurry up. I'm literally starving. Okay. Let's get back on job over here. Okay. Now. Good lord, this game is pretty sometimes. 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 Mostly when you stop and actually look at it. No. <laughs> I have to finish this. Honest. I don't care that I've like sat here and destroyed and fucking monopolized everyone's time this evening fucking building a windmill. I don't care. It needed to be done and I don't <laughs> regret it. And I'll do it again. No, 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 no. You're right to do this. I am right to do this. This is the correct choice. This is I a big part of the point of the game. I have made the correct choices this evening. Screaming about Elon Musk. The more you Musk. try to convince yourself, the less you convince yourself. <laughs> All the same. Um, good work. I'm starving to death as I build a windmill, and you know what? I regret nothing. <laughs> I regret nothing. The windmill is more important. If I die, I die. 
That's a thing. I've been meaning to get that for because that feels like it would be useful on Twitter. Like you know, if I the, die, I die. No, no, no. That's a meme. <laughs> Remember, everyone here who's like old remembers like that that Rocky where it was like there was a Russian dude, like oh sorry, a Soviet dude because that was like the thing back in the day. Like it was oh, a yeah. Soviet was the bad guy. Definitely, a and Soviet it was like an, it was like uh, I almost said an episode. Uh, installment a sequel of rocky and the whole bit was like that soviet dude ended up killing apollo creed and like he was being interviewed by the press just to show how like awful like russian people were and his whole bit was like oh my goodness you hit apollo creed so hard he might die you know he went to the hospital you put a man in the hospital and just to, like show what pieces of shit like you know like soviet people were he just says this like incredibly aryan motherfucker with his fucking buzz cut and his like cheekbones to slay and he was all like sweaty and like completely emotional and he was like if he dies he dies and it's like, ooh, edgelord. You know, like, that was the whole thing. <laughs> like, oh, my God, I can't believe he'd say that. He's such a terrible person. Oh, you know, like, ah! I get fell and hurt myself. But, yeah. Okay, like, do you want some mutton? Always. Okay. But, yeah. <laughs> I just still fucking think if he dies, he dies. <laughs> okay. Let me see. Uh... Stairs. How does one make them out of... No, not clay stuff. Here, just... Oh, like that. Okay. That's fine. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's try that for now. Also, I remember that during movie Creed, they kept talking about how his dad died in the ring, but they avoid talking about him during... Ooh, hold on. They avoid talking about him dying in Rocky IV. Yeah, was that the one where where the Soviet man beat him to death? <laughs> oh my god. See, the thing oh, is, no. like, that was... I'm a naturally a very contrarian person, and I think part of my interest in kind of, like, the Soviet Union began because of all the, like, really cartoon... Like, fucking clown-ass American propaganda that was anti-Soviet. Mm. And I'm all like, okay, well, you hate it, so that means I'm going to check it out now. Like, that that's, like, my attitude about everything. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and I, I fucking get that. And it's <laughs> like, you know, you're trying too hard. Why, why do you want me to hate them so bad? It was kind of like my attitude, because I am a contrarian person. And usually, like, that could be very obnoxious. And I know people who are, like, very, like, that it's stupid to be contrarian for, like, no reason. But I think it's been, it's been a pretty useful impulse in my life. <laughs> and um, <laughs> in this case, it was just like, because you have to understand, when I was growing up, when I was a little kid, um, like the Soviets were the big bads in everything. There were two bad guys in 80s media, drug dealers and Russians. That's it. <laughs> That's how it was growing. And you, you're laughing because it's true. You They're, know I'm right. And yeah, it did start, like, I think there were some more categories added later on. But it was, no, seriously. After the Iran-Contra affair, for example. It was Rocky, uh, no, it was Rocky Some four. additional flavors It was added. Rocky Four. Or it was fucking Miami Vice. Like, that's what it was. Ran hostage situation. It's just, point. it was just, and it's one of those things when you start looking at it, you're like, hmm. <laughs> if yeah. you're like me anyway, you're like, hmm. You start going like, wow, you really want me to hate this? It's these a little people. obvious what's going on. Yeah, it's just, hmm, I see the, I see the seams. <laughs> I'm going to, I'm going to grab this thread and see what goes on. And like, when I say like this, like, okay, so. It was really common, for example, like, uh, I remember, I remember this so clearly, because even as a child, I was all like, laying it on a little thick, aren't we? And I wasn't like, you know, a super, like, aware child or anything. It was just that poorly done that I was like, hmm. And this was back when the wrestling that everyone watched was WWF, okay? And there was like, they had their like, I am the bad guy, I am the heel characters. And the I am the heel characters for this were either Iron Sheik, who to this day seems to really enjoy doing that shit. And um, there was a guy. I was so shocked. I was so absolutely shocked when I realized, when I, when I found out he wasn't actually just like Ooh. Italian or something. Yeah, he was he actually, actually was Iranian. He was a real I was deal. blown away. But yeah, um, and then there was a guy named Nikolai Volkov. Okay, like that was the Russian wrestler guy. And I already liked the bad guys because, again, contrarian. 
So Nikolai Volkov was like the really bullshit, transparent kind of heel character. And I remember when I was watching TV once, they had Nikolai Volkov come out and he was ra- waving the Soviet Union flag, you know, just like a gigantic flag, like almost as big as he was. So obviously like, OK, so we're setting the stage. And the crowd booed boo, furiously, I imagine. Boo, boo, you know, the crowd was going crazy. And then boo. he came in and because he's the heel, he like snatches the microphone away from the um, from the uh, person in the ring. And he says something in Russian. And of course, no one understands what he says. But at some point, someone goes, oh, I think I know what he's saying. And it's like, we just made sure he said it in Russian for maximum offense. Uh, He is saying he would like to sing the Soviet national anthem. They didn't say the international. They said he would like to sing the Soviet national anthem. And what do you think, everybody? Should, should Should we let him sing the Soviet national anthem? This was not announced before. This is not decided. Oh, we don't know what to do. Oh, goodness. And he just starts singing, right? And everyone's just boo, boo, while he's singing the international. And then, you know, you get absolutely no fucking extra points for guessing what happened next. Because that is when Hulk Hogan came out. I knew it was Hulk Hogan. <laughs> Hulk Hogan came out. And he came out like somebody had told him, hey, man, hey, man somebody's out there kicking your dog. Like, that's how he came running out with this fucking look on his face. <laughs> and he's like, he just like grabbed the Soviet flag and ripped it off of Nikolai Volkov's flagpole while he was singing the Russian anthem. And of course, Nikolai Volkov was like, I could have never guessed this was going to happen. How dare you? Oh, I will defeat you in the name of the motherland. It was, it was just like that fucking like, come on, dude. You know, and even as a child, I was like, hmm. It's like you're 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 working overtime here to try and get me to think a certain way, and if a fucking like nine year old is calling you on this, you're not good at it. You know, I'm not really prepared to be this fucking stupid today. <laughs> and like, I honestly think it was that moment where I'm like, I'm gonna check this whole Soviet Union thing out and see what, see what it's really about, because this is some fucking bullshit right here. <laughs> so it didn't work. It didn't fucking work. But yeah, oh shit, oh, I'm gonna die. <laughs> but yeah, that, that is a thing I think about sometimes. That's what... Oh God, you know what? Actually, um, in the United States, and this is kind of probably odd to hear, but uh, I do not recall a ton of anti-South African sentiment for most of my childhood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was very unaware of what was going on. Yeah, it's like, I didn't, I don't recall, ooh, I'm going to kill myself if I keep doing that. Basically, until they let Mandela out of jail, I had, I I did not even know what was going on. It's only like once, like, because I was a kid and wasn't reading Newsweek articles until around that time, I guess. Yeah, I I don't recall a ton of anti-South African, I honestly didn't, it's like, basically, the only time I remember a whole ton of anti-South African sentiment was there was this there was this thing that was done in the U.S. Uh, where a whole bunch of a whole bunch of American like musicians. It was easy money to go to South Africa and play this resort. The resort was called Sun City, and you would just like go there and you would play for like all white audiences. And if you were black, it was okay because you know how racism actually fucking functions. It doesn't actually mean anything. It's literally just about the preservation of power by the powerful. They'll make all kinds of ex- accessions and shit like that that make no sense if they actually really b- truly believe in their bullshit racial sciences. But they'll do it because they don't actually believe in it. It's just about maintaining power. But whatever. Um, they, You could go there and you could play Sun City and you could, you could make a shitload of money. That was basically it. And there, Jesus. Oh, yeah. Fuck! Oh. Don't die. Oh. You okay? Fucking wolf. Ah, oh, fucker. Are you dead? No, the oh. wolf is dead. Okay, that's good. Okay, but yeah, there was a pop song. There's this like movement pop song thing where like at some point someone's like, this is kind of fucked up actually. And they began this, they began this movement or this song and it was called I Won't Play Sun City because that was the name of the place. And there was like a whole song going along with it. And it was kind of one of those moments where people were backed into a corner where it's like, 
if you continued to play Sun City after this, you were now publicly cool with apartheid, you know? And because now people can no longer say, well, they didn't know. They didn't know. Exactly. It's like, oh, well, I thought it would be fine. Like, you could no longer say that. Because there was a whole song. It was like, will you participate in our thing about I won't play Sun City? And you had to say yes. <laughs> You had to. Like, the 80s were bullshit when it came to race relations, but, like, you could not just openly be all like, actually, I'm cool with apartheid and I want money. You couldn't do that. But, yeah, I remember there was that whole thing on the news where it's like all the pop stars are getting together and they're doing, they were singing the song, I Won't Play Sun City. And I remember that South Africa did not like that because South Africa was very... <laughs> I bet they fucking didn't. No, South Africa back then was very into... Um, I. Optics. They were they they were tone policing. I guess is the term we would they, use. They now. wanted to be respectable, despite yeah, they what they were like, fucking doing. There was a lot of like we could talk about this reasonably, but this is not the way to go about it. You know, tone policing. Mm -hmm. Like, oh well, you didn't say it. I, how you didn't say it in a way I approve. Therefore, I now reserve the right to completely ignore you. Uh -huh. Like it was just so fucking by the numbers, you know. But yeah, I that is kind of the most aware I was of a lot of South African stuff. When I was a when I was a little kid. Oop. Can I not jump? Yes, I can. Okay. There we go. Now, maybe if I. Oh no. What if I? Cool. And cool. All right. Now, do I have any? Yes, I do. Anyway, what I'm saying is I'm old. Um, fucking wolves. By the way, this is all reminding me. There is a YouTuber I very much enjoy, and I'm going to actually die, aren't I? I think I'm going to die. Uh, there's a YouTuber I enjoy a lot, and his name is Hoser. Like, you know, like, oh, yeah. goofy name, Hoser. And he does a lot of sort of discussions of countries. And one of the things that he talks about is like why certain countries are the way they are. And okay. particularly why they're so fucked up. That's, that's usually no, what it's, it's more like why certain countries are fucked up and why other certain countries aren't fucked up. Like, hmm. and one of the things oop, he goes into a lot that I don't see a lot of other people go into a lot that I really appreciate is he talks about geography and he talks about how some countries just kind of like don't have a fucking chance. Like it's just kind of over for them. Like they, they don't, there's no way it would have ever worked out for them because they just don't have the geographical wherewithal to survive. And what is this? Whether it's like a lack of resources or just the place is too damn huge mm -hmm. and full of too, too much unpopulated space to really be ruled in a centralized way. Yeah. Or they've got like no coastline. So they're at the mercy of their neighbors when it comes to trade. Yeah. Or they all, they depend on this river. Which starts in somebody that else's was, country. That was actually so exactly where I was going. One of the things that it talks about a lot is uh, they one of the one of the countries that it talks about that was really an eye opening uh, discussion was they're like, look, here's the deal: like Iraq will never be a stable country, like literally never. And here's I'm going to explain to you why. And he talks about how Iraq doesn't control any of its origin, uh, any of its water sources. So it's mm, like it yeah. has a it has rivers running through it, but none of those rivers are actually in its territory. So what that basically means is everything that they have when it comes to agriculture and water supply, it's kind of up to how how Turkey fucking feels that day. <laughs> and that can that that can be pretty bad. Turkey can feel pretty bad that day. And there's kind of nothing they can do about it. And the knock on effect of like this total instability with regards to their water supply is just sort of a really good de demonstration. Because like Iraq, like a lot of countries, like a lot of post-colonial countries, it's kind of like a fake country in the sense that the borders established were literally established with an eye towards instability. Like that was the plan. They they wanted the place unstable, the, the, the colonizing powers, because that meant that the people could not unite and, and fight them off with any kind of effectiveness. And when they left those countries, they didn't redraw the borders ever. So it was still full of people who kind of like they had never ancestrally lived the way that they were kind of being expected to live now. And it, it's fascinating. It's, it's kind of an interesting thing. But yeah, I recommend Hoser. And this is all coming up because I think he did one recently 
uh, comparing uh, various African countries, but he also did one, I think, about basically why is South Africa still poor? Because the thing is, now that, you know, it's been air quotes, our apartheid has been air quotes over for so long, you'd think things would be fine. You know, uh, there's been like a generation, there should have been time to catch up. And so what what's going wrong over there? And he talks about like what's going wrong. It's interesting. Yeah. Okay, I think... They're very well-presented videos, too. Like, I... they make stuff very clear, and they get into nitty-gritty stuff, but they also have a really great humorous style. Yeah. I want to know what everybody thinks of my gorgeous, amazing, perfect... Oh, look what I did. Isn't it amazing, everyone? I did it. Oh, I fucking did it. see it. I feel like I've been getting off really easily today. I I have not died. I've been doing dumb shit. Yeah. Oh, man. Okay, let's see what you did here. Okay, okay. This is good. This is good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Like, you know, if, if the perversion for symmetry wasn't worth it, at <laughs> least it did give us more open space. It did. That's very nice. This is good. This is good. This is good. I will be sifting in here very soon. That's I've got more fine. bone meal. I mean, more bony soil. Um, oh, also, shit, I've got a bunch of hides. In there as well. Yeah. We have a oh, lot of hides good. now. A ton of hides. Um, got some coal. Black coal goes... Good Lord. Where even? Black coal goes in this right here, basket right? right here. Yeah. By the way, I need coal to make signs. And I don't want to use up a bunch of the coal that we... Uh, Mm -hmm. Use for, um, you know, actual smelting. Uh, so should we maybe do a bunch of charcoal? Um, you want to sure. show me how to do charcoal? I did sometime. show you how to do charcoal. Yeah. Yeah. Um. I. I. I it's been quite a while. Okay. Um. That's well. So much cobble now. Hell you need yes. an axe, and you need some logs, and then you cut a full stack of logs. You dig a hole in the ground, and you make full cubes of logs and you bury them and then you put a uh fireplace on top and then you cover okay, the so just like the same kind of regular fire pit like this yes okay and there's no like layer of grass on top of the logs it'll it'll eventually grow i mean you put no 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 layer of, layer of dry grass for kindling Is that no part no, of no 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 okay. layer of dry gra grass or kindling you just put the fire okay hit on top of the logs and then you cover everything up um oh this is asking about hoser oh h zero s e r yeah okay because he's canadian hoser okay uh let's see let's see let's see what is that doing in here okay so there is like no wind right now that's the problem my thing works it's proper it's how it should be there is simply no wind yeah, i can live with that you'll get wind Don't yeah worry. i'm just mostly wind making sure it's not me i'm making sure it's that um let's see Okay, I'm going to let that spin. And I'm going to plant. Now I have to catch up on all my other chores. I spent so much time building that. I have to catch up on all my other chores. Oh, no. Oh, look at all the wine. Did... Cranberry wine, cranberry oh, wine. Did you put a record on? Yeah. Oh, cool. I can't hear anything, though. Really? Yeah. Oh, weird. I'm going to drink some wine. I'm putting meat away in this one here. Um, mm hmm it doesn't really matter but yeah know that we have plenty of meat now good wow you weren't kidding a lot of puff balls too oh i'm a little drunk i'm wobbling see me wobble folks mm. Oof. yeah i fell off the roof like 15 times so i've hurt myself terribly but the important thing is i finished i finished hmm and you, you don't hear the music right now huh no i don't that's interesting. It's annoying. It's I wish I could hear it. 
remember that happened to me last time yeah. i couldn't hear the like sophisticated tavern or whatever it was yeah. and like i heard the quirky tavern but not the sophisticated one that's weird culture tavern I, yeah. uh anyway until i went back and like listened to the the audio from your recording that's odd might it have something to do with like where you're standing when it starts maybe i, I was right next to it though Oh, weird. Anyway, I'm going to make... Well, stop it and restart it so that you can get it. But first, I'm going to make three beehives. Kind of Don't you understand? I need to make three beehives. We have more bees. I'm assuming we do at this point. We must. Oh, I've left them alone for so long. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, fucking rabbits trying to get in my goddamn thing. Running away. You better run. Oh, Okay. That pink apple tree decided to die. Oh, darn. But that's okay, because literally every other one has decided to live. We've got we have... more cuttings, too. Yeah, we do. Let me go check um, on the bees here. You don't should... want to do the ceiling and cobble. Honey, We've got to do honey. something else there. Honey, honey, all four of them. Look at that. God damn. Okay. Well, mm. damn. Let, me put, let me put all this junk away first. Before I harvest all that honey. Because I have so much junk. Okay, are these the... Yeah, here's a place where I can dump junk. There we are. There. Okay. Plant products, go there. And mineral products, take my clay. And now I'm happy. Now I'm willing to do it. Let's get this shit going. Let's get some honey so we can make some goddamn jam. Hmm. Let's do it. I ain't scared of you, bees. Nobody's scared of you. I'm half dead, but that's fine. Don't hurt me. Okay. I'm not scared of you. Don't hurt me. <laughs> okay. And just to confirm, you're both large, large. Okay. Oh, you can smelt clay to make clay blocks. Huh. That might look nice. Okay, now. And there. Three empty skips for you. And I have... Good. Nine honeycomb, just like I should. Now. Head on over and get to making jam. Where are those? Ah, here we go. Just keeping the honey in a bucket. Mm -hmm. It's the most efficient. So now we have 1.8. I believe 1.6 is enough for a, a full helping of jam. Three liters, not bad. Okay, and we got some beeswax. So let's go ahead and throw that in animal products. And this is 3.2 liters of honey. Let's go ahead and just put that away. Mm, I can go up there, get an empty bowl. Okay, now jam time. Check the think, berry uh, supply. Oh, and you gotta go first, so. So I think that's. Hmm. Grain, grain, pies, pies. Uh, the red currants are probably. Let's see what this does. There we go. Now. Let's see. I think it's six. Six is the most, okay. Yeah. Two, four, one, two, three, four. Oh. Okay. Six. Hmm. Okay, so. Um, whoa, I just now noticed. All of the uh, slate roofing visible mm -hmm. from here. Oh, that's interesting. That's cool. Um, okay, so I'm gonna do um, 
charcoal burning. And how many of those can I, how many blocks of firewood can I put down to do that? Huh. I think I might have done this wrong. Or not, huh? Weird. I think I might have done this wrong. Oh. Hmm. Okay, so how does one make it? I thought I knew. For sure. Oh wow, you can make fire pits ridiculously huge. Yeah. Oh, that's I Okay. Oh. Let's see the survival guide then. No. Okay, how about guides then? Food preservation. Uh, crocs, wax, fat, storage room. Okay, so I'm not quite sure what I did wrong here. Huh. That's weird. Okay, I'm going to assume that I am fucking up somehow. So let's just go ahead and come on. And you can go here. And then you, oops, no, you can go here. Can I get this one, please? All right, no. Um, maybe the problem is me. Three, and then four. Is that how you do it? Eight. Okay, I guess that is how you do it, huh? So it's eight and then four. All right, cool. Um, weird, but fine. And all right, I'm just doing so that's 0 0.8, 0 0.8, so that's 1.6, and that's 1.2, and 1.6. Okay, so I have enough for another serving. Good to know because I have enough on me to make one more thing a jam. Cool. Oh, it's nice and bright out. Ah, I just forgot. Oh, let's go and fucking. Plant another pumpkin before it gets too late. Pumpkin. Pumpkin? Don't do this to me. Huh, okay. Let's find a pumpkin then. Okay. And let's do it. All right. There we go. Growth speed 97. You're over here and not producing shit, not doing shit, disappointing me, disappointing your mother. That's fine. Are you, is the wind speed still at zero? It's getting kind of absurd up there. I know nothing's blocking it. I know it's not doing, not doing stuff it shouldn't be doing. I know you're fine. I know you're fine. God, this is so ugly. <laughs> Fix that. Okay. Oh, hey, good. Now. Boop. And into the cellar you go. Oh, look at that. Blueberry red currant jelly, blueberry jam, and white currant jam. Oh, I have a whole shelf. Oh, of jam. hell yeah. I have a whole shelf of jam. Holy fuck, did you hear that? What happened? Oh, just, I heard a massive crack of thunder. Oh, is that what that was? Yeah. Huh. Four. Our coal pit is not lighting. I will be out there in a moment to help. It's smoking, but it still says unlit. Hold on. we 
go. Yeah, don't starve in one hour, one life are appropriate comparisons. Oh, I think it's... Oh, here we go. Okay, it's going. Oh, okay. Now I just bury it, right? Cool, yes. Yeah, so you put a, a, a piece of dirt right on top of it. Okay. All right. Okay. Now. Are you still not turning? Where's the wind? Come on now. I guess there is none. Oh, well. Oh, well. How do I know when this fucking thing's done? Um, it stops smoking. All right, cool. Where are you? Um, next to the berry patch. Oh, okay. I think now I will check on the greenhouse because winter is coming. So let's just see how things are going over there. Hello. Wow. Things are going pretty good over here. Mature flax. Tons of it. The carrots. Whatever, man. As long as we don't starve. You know what I mean? Weed. Dead mature rye. Oh, well. That was a lot of rye. Mature carrots. Watch your carrots. Yeah, yeah, you're stunted. Whatever. Okay. And wow, that's a lot of flax. We're going to get a new crop of berries soon. Oh my god, don't say that. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy about it. Oh god. forever, Charlie. Stop. Mature parsnips. Dead mature parsnips. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Okay, well, let me just put all this away. Come on. Get down there. All right. Now, let's see. Parsnips, parsnips, parsnips. 38 parsnips. Okay, and carrots. More carrots. And wow, wow, wow. Is that a lot of rye grain and a lot of flax? Now, the rye will not grow particularly well in August, so we'll just put that away. We won't replant you. We do have a ton of flax, but I think we're good for flax right now. Mm. Carrots. Maybe plant a few more parsnips. Maybe a few more cabbage seeds. Unless... 19... I think the cabbage will be fine. Okay. Now let's get all this stuff picked up. Mm. Good lord. There we go. Wow. Alright. Now this is all. It can take everything except a K crop, which is perfect. Because I brought parsnips and turnips. Okay. And cabbage? Perfect. Let's put some cabbage in. No, cabbage takes too long. Let's do parsnip. Oh, we have to soak a hide in order to... Okay, how do... Hmm. Mm. Okay. Oh, and now this is, so is a end crop, 35. What's temperature? Yeah. Let's try it. Okay. Let's go get some more parsnips, I think. This belt's coming along, I guess. Okay. Oh, mature carrots. Okay. 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 Woof! Let's just 
just get everything taken care of again down here. So, so freaking many, so many. Oh wow, so many. That's a lot of vegetables. More flax, more berries. We might have to just eat flax just to get it out of the way. <clears throat> okay, where are all my parsnip seeds? Let's get you down here. Uh, okay, let's get some turnips then. Let's just plant some turnips. Okay, so this is... Yeah, you're good with everything. Screw it. You're Terra Preta. get more crops in. You never know. You never freaking know. Indeed, indeed. Okay. Now. Oh, that's right. I gotta replant something in here. Okay. Get an open space in the, um... Yeah, um, yeah. I'm not ready to throw in the towel quite yet on getting a fruit tree to grow in the greenhouse. Oh, not yeah, no, I don't quite think you ready. Should. Every cutting we've put in there has died, but we have other cuttings still. And I'm going to cut down this pink apple tree, and I'm going to retry it in the orchard. By the way, you should go check on that pear tree. Um, pear tree. Yeah. Um. You, is, you mean one in our territory or one that we found out in the wilderness? The one we found out in the wilderness. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Um, that. Right now, contemplating storage for crates that will be like, you know, mm -hmm. usable. Pear tree, go for right it. now, the attic situation is not, it's not good enough. <laughs> That's fine. You can do organization. We've, I've been doing nothing but homebody bullshit this entire stream because I just couldn't stand to live with that fucking windmill like that for any longer. You, still, you went all out there. I still, it's still not great, but it's better than it was. It's not like embarrassing anymore. Good, gotta say. Okay. I can't believe more berries are coming in like two days. I'm going to die. <laughs> That's horrifying. All right. And give me a crock. Boop. That's more. And let's get you down here and on a shelf. Ta-da. Look at that. For years, the jam will be good. For years. And I need to eat some fruit. So perfect. Oh, what? Blueberries? Yeah, the blueberries are... They want to go bad, so let's just eat these. Watch my fruit satiety go up, shall we? There we go. There we go. Perfect. Now all I need to worry about is grain. I guess I should cook some porridge. So maybe some spelt. Some spelt and cranberry porridge. That sounds good. See, flax is such garbage, but rye is good. Oh, that's we have some rice. I'll make some. Oh, rice that's the pudding. end of that pick. I'll make some rice pudding. I'll make some rice pudding, and I'll make, I'll make it with some cranberries. Rice pudding with cranberries. That doesn't sound like wholly nauseating. That sounds like something a person might eat. Eat. I wish we had some rice, like, you know, some actual rice seeds. There we go. Oh, come on. There we go. 
Ugh. There we go. God, I love that brass torch holder. I never have to worry about where one is again. And there we go. The rice can go there too. Okay. Now, that can go back. And wow. I'm going to actually, we have so much flax, I'm going to repair your snowsuit. Yeah, yeah but that's definitely something that needs to happen at some point. Yeah, we you. just have so much right now. 16, 4. Let's try that. Just do that again. 16, 4. That should be enough to repair everything. Now, if I'm not mistaken, we are keeping yours up here. Mine are fully repaired, and yours are in terrible condition. So let me go ahead and yep. put them on, because I think I need to wear them to repair them. Sure. And, okay, now, where's the, ah, there we go. And then we go, check this out. So it goes from terrible to worn to good. Terrible, worn, good. Good, good, there we go. And, oh, wow, my, my clothes are in terrible shape. Oh, I thought they were better than that. There. Good and good, there we are. So, now, we will be ready for winter both of our fur coats knee-high fur boots and fur gloves are completely repaired so that's nice wow look at this place okay matthew what what the rib cage deer that has been there for like two months now i hate it i can't believe you're only just addressing the uh, rib cage now there <laughs> that's what i think of your rib cage i was waiting for you to do that i, I cannot it. believe that it took you that i long thought it meant it. something to you oh no absolutely not okay good i've destroyed it then oh the, the whole reason i put it there is so that you can say why are there bones next to our beds and pop the rib cage <laughs> okay i am going to go up here and close this door because it seems like a terrible idea to have this door open Where's the door? There it is. Okay. Oh, God, no wind whatsoever. I'm so annoyed. But yeah, Um. so hey, iron. Iron. Iron, right over iron. here. So much iron. In ores? And more or ore. In more, more ores. Ore. Okay, oh my God. Look at all the hematite. Okay. Well, seriously. I'm it's going to go ahead and I'm going to grab. Oh, I have my hammer. Okay. So. Hello there, Bountiful Chunk. That was my nickname in high school. Um, <laughs> I knew something like that was coming. And All right. 20 pieces smelt into one iron bloom. Five units of iron bloom. I don't know what that means. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Wait, so does it work differently from other ores? Yeah, yeah. It's actually quite unexpected. Okay, we have so much iron. We have so much fucking iron, bro. Oh my god. Okay, so yeah. the smelting temperature is like nearly 1500 degrees Celsius. I think... Hmm. Okay, so what I think we do is we make two iron pickaxes and two... Oh wait, we can't. Fuck. Um, hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to figure this out. I'm trying to figure this out. Uh, let me just get this. Okay. 10, 12, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Um, so I think what happens now is we go. 
come on. Okay. There, and then there. And I think what I'm going to do is that, and then we're going to go down here. We're going to go into more ores. We are going to... Uh, I don't know, man. Um, never done this. The coop Probably. looks very good, and I'd like to take a closer look at it, but I would scare the chickens. What looks very good? The coop. Oh. 40. I happen to be over there. Let's see if we can't do 40 pieces into... Okay, so do I just like, come over here? And I, okay, yes. Okay, so oh, it can take oh 40 God. nuggets of hematite. Is that the most it can take, though? Because I, I, it feels like I should, I should be as efficient with this as possible. So let's just get you. I'm just curious. Okay, so how many can you take? Oh, you can take 120. Okay, so that's six. That's six iron blooms you can take. All right, that's good to know. And then, hmm, this is interesting because it says here black coal can't get hot enough for this, which is interesting. I think, however, it can in a bloomery? I have never actually done this. Before I ruin all this shit, hold on. I'm going to search Bloomery on the Vintage Story Wiki so I don't fuck everything up. Iron. Okay, that's what I want. Okay, Bloomery. Boom. In order to turn iron ore nuggets into iron blooms, the ore nuggets must be felted in a Bloomery created from fire clay bricks. The Bloomery must be loaded with the ore and then with an appropriate fuel, the Bloomery will burn for 10 hours, after which it must be broken open. Bloomeries are destroyed, so a new one must be made each time. Okay. And then iron blooms must further be worked on an anvil while hot to turn it into usable wrought iron ingots. This must be done manually or with an automated help hammer. Okay. Got it. Got it. Cool. I can do that. Oh, you only want six. Okay, that's good. All right. Um, sure. Let's do it. Let's make six iron ingots. Hopefully by the time they're done doing their bloomery thing, the fucking wind will be back. That would be nice. Okay. Really don't appreciate this zero wind power shit. Mm. Oh, hello. Rice porridge, my favorite. So I'm cooking some clay into hardened clay blocks right now. Uh huh. And in order to do that, because we once again have only one fire pit and it's a problem, I've made a fire pit out here. Mm -hmm. on top of like you know just a safe little basalt area here uh -huh. it's raining outside yeah. so every now and then the fire pit hisses yeah and it'll actually it'll actually um go out faster put it out. If, if you uh leave it out like this oh probably let me uh over it then okay let me get away from here and back inside Please, can I have some wind? Please. Please, can I have some fucking wind? Please, can you not do this to me right now? I hate you. Ugh. Mm. Oh. You got loads of wind when you first built the thing. I know, right? It's very convenient. And now it just is all like, above? Wind? What's that? Uh, little smoke particles rising up into the air. I hate it. The whole time I was building this thing, it was just happily doing its thing. And now it's all like, above? 
Yeah, but you were lucky in that, like when you first built it, you got wind immediately. Okay, so the Thus, wind power three percent, two percent. Yeah, that's that's not so it's not me it's just not doing anything it's just there's just no the wind. wind don't worry yeah it's not we'll me it's just there's no wind obnoxious okay the only important thing is i didn't fuck it up i know it works it just doesn't feel like working right now it'd um, be nice if we could also do water power yeah Thirty, forty, fifty liters. Oh wait, no, not fifty. There we go. Okay. And forty. So let's get forty lime, shall we? Oh, we don't have forty lime. Shit. Okay. Well. So I am going to need another pick. Uh, I have gathered so much cobble. <laughs> You have destroyed every pick I've given you. You need to understand, that's how this goes. <laughs> they are consumables. Oh my god. It is always going to be that way. 30. Okay. So that's 30. And that's 30. Alright, now. Okay. There we go. 32. Now, what can you take? 32. We have a lot of medium and small hides. Let's see if it can take 30. 32 medium hides. How about that? That'd be great. Guess not. Also not 16. 8. So 8. Fine. Just 8? No? Okay. 8. 8 it is. 8 it is. Fine. There you go. You win. 8. Ooh. Hear that? Yeah. Somebody's having fun. Somebody has a very noisy motorcycle. Four, five. God, this is so much better than running back and forth to Dead Wolf Lake. Okay. Now, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, I thought we had some. I thought we had some oak logs down here. Guess not. Okay. There we go. You might as well get started on the next helpings of weak tannin and strong tannin. There we go. Couldn't hurt. Now, you said you needed yet another. <laughs> yet always. Oh. I'm always going to need more picks. Okay. I kind of fucked up my pick too um i guess i could see myself making a couple more i am pretty sure that there are mods out there that add water power oh is someone asking that seems really oh abyss is saying oh hell yes water power 100 percent. water power would like be I, I bet i bet we can get that that seems like an inevitable thing okay. oh there are mods out there that add steam power i start and electrical i have no doubt at all There we go. Okay. And where are you? There you are. Another candle. Another candle? Cool. Now. It is sifting time. And let's just put oh, some nice here. chill sifting. You here. Hello? Do we really have absolutely zero firewood? That makes no sense. What? Are you serious? I, there is literally zero firewood. When I got here, this wow! I I must have taken it all for the pit. I I thought there was a bunch more left. I will. Okay, yeah, no, there's this this twenty. It's thirty two here. Yeah. Well, thank you. I'll go get more um, when I'm done sifting. Okay. Unless you need more immediately. No, not immediately. I was just it's shocked just because the there was list. like over a hundred and then suddenly it was all gone. Oh, well, I didn't take that many. Well, oh, wait, no, I did take a whole bunch. To yeah, turn I was about to say, I think you probably did. I'm planning to make a lot of labels is what I'm saying. Yes. 
I would really like to also make parchment to label the crates. Uh, annoyingly, you need soaked hides for that. So okay. that's something we're going to have to figure out. Well, I mean, I'm literally soaking a bunch of hides right now, so. Really? Any small hides? They have um, to be not small hides, small. they're medium. Yeah, yeah. Parchment has to be made from small hides, which is unreasonable. You'd think you could take a larger hide and, and cut, cut it, it down. Yeah, that does sound a little unreasonable, frankly. How you can't make sticks. Yeah. There are a lot of weird little choices this game makes. Why? Other places. Why? Mm -hmm. Goes on. The wind is still not blowing, and it's irritating me. Oh. See, Wailing Octopus earlier said, I saw the windmill stop seconds after you added the last block to the windmill tower, lol. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And all I needed was confirmation I didn't fuck it up somehow. Like, the, it's fine. It's yeah. just not, not, the wind isn't blowing right now. So. Ooh, high rift activity. Be careful out there. Okay, I will. Something moaning next to me. Yeah. Probably just... hanging around the uh, windmill, in fact. There we go. And we need a couple of pickaxes, I think. Entirely. Okay. Always, always pickaxes. There we go. There we go. Oh, I can't wait for an iron pickaxe. It's coming, don't worry. Yeah, are there any things we need to, like, harvest for that? Do you need any materials we don't have? For an iron pickaxe? No, I think we have everything. I mean, These well, are just going I mean, to be iron, iron pickaxes, not anything fancy. So oh, it's oh. not like they're going to be steel or meteoric iron or anything. Oh, yeah. Speaking of meteoric iron, I've got to scour my map to see where the hell I found that thing. There we go. I'm so fucking annoyed. I think it was somewhere to the north. Goddamn. Maybe it was, you know, through some translocator. This is no, so it's... obnoxious. This is so unbelievably obnoxious. Like, zero? Really? Really? Like, really? Ugh. Mm. So obnoxious. Well, that's why you need wind and solar. Yeah. Okay, how are we doing over here? Okay, good. Let me put all these skins away. I don't need these hanging around. There we go. So I've added like half of a room onto like the storage area in the basement. Uh huh. I've started putting some crates down there. Mm -hmm. Still not sure how I want to arrange them. Uh, like maybe I've got them just stacked against a wall. Yeah, they're now. looking pretty good so far. I could uh, I could instead put them um, like on shelves, kind of. Not sure though. Yeah. Like rows of stacks, like. Oh man, I hear him out there. Well, also, it might be nice to have like a museum of all the nice things we found, you know? Yeah, that's why I'm not touching that crystallized hematite. Yeah, and we can put them in. You need like a, like rows and rows of display cases. Yeah. God. This definitely sounds like rift activity medium out there. Mm. Oh, it's at high now. Oh, fantastic. Just what I felt like dealing with tonight. Yeah. Well, I have plenty of rocks to throw, so... Yeah, and honestly, they don't seem so scary these days. Yeah. I think we're getting better at this. We're getting better equipped. We're better nourished. Loads and loads of poultices. Mm-hmm. Oh, dang it. Ooh. Come on. Get back you here. Get into any trouble, let me know. Oh, please. <laughs> okay, fine. Copper spearhead. That's nice. Some silver nuggets. Uh, rough peridot. It's just nice to do, be able to do something about these little assholes. Yeah. So they're not just like licking the windows.
<laughs> They're just not all that concerning these days. Yeah. They're more annoying than anything. They are kind of like zombies, where it's just like one is fine, but if there were like five of them. Yeah. Where are you guys going? Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, I got no use for these rocks. I know you're down there. There you are. Ah. <laughs> gotcha. Anybody else? Looks like we only got one down there. Come on. Who's feeling brave? Nobody? That's cool. Put these away then. I guess I could. Do that. And da, da, da. I don't really need to be carrying this hammer around. I should take care of that. However, I should put the poultices like this. And the axe, shovel, pickaxe. There we go. Let's put the hammer away, though. There we go. Still not going. Oh my god. Nothing else out there, I don't think. I guess I could go out there and harvest what I killed. Definitely hear stuff. Hey, fellas. It's from underground. You got anything fun? Of course you don't. Speaking of such things. Oh, okay. I guess. I'll... Uh, they're in the berry patch. Ew. Acceptable. Okay. I think that's all the ones I got. Anything fun? It's doing that thing where it lags when I try to harvest them. Uh, oh, I heard a it? portal. Oh, yeah. Massive mat. Oh, I only got three hardened clay out of that? What the fuck? <laughs> Ooh. I think this is kind of an accident waiting to happen over here. I'm going to fix this walkway really quickly. Let's see. Of course, I don't know where you put anything anymore. Gonna have to. The damn portal is in the berry patch. Aww. I disapprove. Rot, birch, wooden trunk. This time. Ooh, there are a lot of them out here. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Need some help? There's one. I don't hey, think bitch. so. No, there's more of you over here. Yeah! Ooh. Squishing a lady up against her very own berry masher. Oh, you're stuck under my roof. That's Come on, harv it. Oh, Don't hello. fucking hit me, bitch. Okay. There we go. Of course, there's nothing. Of course, there's nothing, and... 
Come on. Yeah, I figured. Fair enough. Yeah, nothing but twine so yeah. far. I got one piece of twine. I think I've killed like six, five or six. Jesus. Yeah. So not worth it. So completely not worth it. Hello, darlings. I'm here to look at you. How are your eggs? Three days, one day. Okay. And in here. Four days. Oh, one strange thing that we never seem to find on them. And you'd think would be there. Rocks. Yeah. Where are they producing all of these rocks? Seriously. Hey. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> Whoop. <laughs> there we go. Nothing, right? Oh, never mind. I'm full of shit. Nice new temporal gear. Oh, hey, cool. Yeah. Definitely not nothing. Yeah, so that is worth all here. these fuckers. Um, gosh. We need to make some room. Let's go ahead and move that and put that there. And I will just have to find a place to put this shelf. Oh, uh, it's something very nearby. There we go. I don't even bother using arrows on these things. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And where are my sticks? Oh, I have no sticks. Gracious. It's time to go get some sticks. Let's just put this here. And Nice. Shears really do make a difference. What are you getting sticks? Yep. Woo, mama! <laughs> Didn't even see you there, buddy. Oh, hey, it's a party. Don't fucking. They all in the trench down there. Oh, hello. Well, I don't know where he thinks he's going. It's going to hell, Charlie. <laughs> Get to hell. Get him. Oop. Oh. Come on. All right. Now. Sticks. How many is that? Oh, ten. Not bad. Yeah, that'll be enough, I think. Oh, wow. Two pine cones. I'll have to plant those. Oh, you got one on you? Yeah. Now, where did those... There we go. Well, I guess you're full. Oh, no, I'm not. Oh. Uh, there. Oh, hey, I actually found two things on one drifter for the first time ever. You Thank go. you very much. Oh. Uh, yeah, one of them had both twine and a rusty gear. <gasps> Finally, the wind is going again. Thank fucking God. Oh, hey. Oh, and Charlie, yeah. that looks really good. Oh, hush. That looks really good. Stop that. Oh, okay. Let me go in, let me go in there. Oh, I want to see what it's oh, like on the boy. inside. Oh, boy. Okay. All right. And it looks like we're fucking oh, just in time to... Are you overflowing with bone meal or something? Nope. Oh, fuck. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Ow. Ooh, I'm about to die. Poultices. Where are the poultices? Hello, poultices. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh fuck. Uh, okay. No, hold on. Shit. Balls. Oh, come on. Oh, everything is holding me up. All right, where are you fuckers? Yep, you can't... Ah, uh, come here, come here, come here. Okay, all right, God damn it, where are you? There you are. Fix 
cool. Oh, dude. Oh my god, this is cool. Yeah. I might have wasted a little too much time, though. Why? What do you mean? Oh, uh, hold on. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Okay. Oh, I can't do it on that one. Fuck! Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Probably would have been faster to do it by hand. Hmm. Uh, so I see we have two temporal gears right now. Mm -hmm. This rate, uh, we'll be hoping to find a new um, yeah locator soon. <sighs> okay. You fucker. Uh, there we go. That's how I like it. Come on, keep up the pace. Ah, this iron is cooling in my hand. I'm gonna have to make a second bronze hand anvil so I can do one wow. while that this is happening. So it takes eight pieces of clay to make one hardened clay block. That's yeah. not ideal. Loads of clay out there. Ooh, sunrise! He turned on God rays yet? No. You are denying all of your viewers <laughs> the beauty of this sunrise. Okay. Oh, hey, I think charcoal's done. Okay. That's if I didn't good. fuck this up, let's find out. Ugh. There we go. Too cold to work. Ah! God, I love the sound that charcoal makes. second bronze anvil so I can work it by second hand bronze anvil really yeah so I can work it by hand while the tin br while the health hammer also works it uh I can't work it on the on the anvil that's copper okay I'm gonna cut down some trees should I cut down the trees near to the house or do you like these for their decorative value you can cut down the trees near the house okay I should go eat. I'm gonna go have something real quick. Oh. <laughs> 
Abyss just said, and then Spike learned why people do four windmills. Oh god, I, I couldn't, I couldn't. The aesthetic. Like, I, I just, what's wrong with the I, aesthetic? It just looks like fucking goofball Netherlands. shit. I've seen those corny ass things where people have like fifty bajillion. No, no, man, no. Have some fucking decorum. <laughs> It's getting there. Looks like I got to them when they were pretty cold. Down trees is a lot better with a bronze axe. Yeah, it is. Not having to constantly make new axes. At least we have some iron ingots now. Ah, oh, good, good, good. We have, we're about to have our second here. Hmm. Still medium rift activity, and I can see a rift right in front of me. Fantastic. Apparently, I guess I saw something that made me think that whether or not rifts are visible is a setting in this game. Maybe. That's kind of interesting. Heck, like the idea of them being invisible, but you can still hear them. And when you get close to their position, you know, your your gear starts spinning. That's that's kind of cool. Hmm. I can actually see why they'd go with the invisible option. But it would be better if they were invisible, but you have to figure out where they are so that you can do something about them. Uh -huh. Like, you know, build an obelisk on that spot to, like, keep things from spawning there or something. At what point can we be said to be in the Iron Age, you think? Um, when we are making tools out of just iron and not like saying, oh, we better not waste iron on this. We've got all, we, we should we just use bronze or copper instead. Mm -hmm. And I think we're like there already, right? Because we've got a shit ton of iron and there's more to gather at like any time easily. Okay. Well, we now have two, count them, two iron ingots. Rad. Pretty cool. Pretty happy about that. I'm just fucking grateful this goddamn thing is even doing anything. Hmm. Seriously, even if it's slow, the fact that it can work, you know, just all the time, yeah. as long as there's as long as there's wind, you know, without you having to worry about it, that that will make it immensely powerful. Yeah. Burning through some of the coal getting this stuff going, but it's fine. Hmm. Where the hell do we get coal from? I don't even remember. Uh, I believe we go through the third translocator, and there is a big seam right there. I go and mine like a oh. stack whenever we need it. Come on, buddy. Okay, so that's come along fine. Hmm. There we go. <laughs> Riveting, I know. But hey, we are in the Iron Age. Yeah, this is a big session. This is extreme. It's kind of wacky how long we languished in the Copper Age and like we're desperate to get in the Bronze Age and then we uh -huh. immediately rocketed into the Iron Age. No, we did not spend a lot of time in Bronze. No. It's kind of wacky, honestly. But hey, um... Now that we have a bronze, now that we have iron ingots, that basically means we can make an iron pickaxe. And now that we have an, and when we get an iron pickaxe, you can go mine that meteoric iron. Yeah. Yeah, I've got to figure out where the hell it is. Got it marked, but well, I've got a lot of things marked. Uh, 
Okay, that's iron ingot number three. Dude. Okay, I'm going to turn all these maple and birch logs into firewood. Go for it. Maple and birch are ugly. It's kind of this game to make the processing of stuff into firewood instantaneous. I know that is not its inclination. <laughs> yeah, seriously. I know. It likes to punish you and make things complicated. In case you couldn't tell by, you know, what it takes for me to get iron bars here. Hmm. But hey, it works. I did this. I made this fucking windmill and it works, right? There we go. 293 firewood. Good. Look, look at this fucking windmill I made, everybody. It works. The windmill does rule. The I'm going to go get some uh, clay. It's wholly functional. It's doing what it's supposed to do as we speak. Pretty oh, okay. Sweet. There's the meteoric iron. All right. That's not even hard to find. Good. I marked it with a red star instead of like a pickaxe, like every other mineable thing. Good. Oh my god, I have to babysit this. I am truly a, oh, sorry, everyone. It just, it literally has to happen. I have to make another bronze anvil because then I could like work them too. And then this would go literally twice as fast. Hold on. Still lots of rifts out here. There we go. That's it. Ooh. Come on, buddy. You can do it. Ooh. I believe in you. This terrain effect is nice. Mm -hmm. Come on, bro. Penteliers earlier said, uh, can you work it at the same time? I don't think so. I mean, we can try. Let's see. I am willing to experiment. Let's get the hammer and see what we can do. Can I? Oh, I can. I think. Oh, so you're helping out the health hammer? Yeah. That's cool. What the hell? Why is there still ice? Oh, I can. You're so smart. Thank you, pencil ears. Cool. I I, I did not think I didn't think that to. would work either. Suggestion. Thank you. Oh, that. Oh, thank you. No need to create two. Yeah. I didn't know that. Oh. Oh, this is so cool. This is going to save so much time. Thank you. This is literally going to save so much time. Yeah, good point. Since it's possible to have multiple held hammers working on the same thing. Yeah. Yeah, that does make sense. No, oh, let's just put this one. Oop. <laughs> Come on. There we go. All right. And that's Four. Let's get you. You'll be up next. So glad you said something, pencil ears. Thank you. Mm. See, now I'm afraid. I'm going to just let it keep doing it, its thing here, but... Okay, so... Are you just, like, removing bits now? I don't know. You're not... You don't appear to be doing anything.
cool. I'm gonna help again. That's so cool. I learned something today. Oh my god, I didn't <laughs> know I could help it. That's so cool. Need. I help. God, that's way more efficient. God, I can't believe we've gone from like, oh my god, maybe one day we'll enter the Iron Age to having six ingots. <laughs> Anytime you want to make an iron pick, I can go after that meteoric iron. Cool. I, I don't really know what is so great about meteoric iron. I think it's just harder. So, like, is that only useful for, like, making weapons or what? Maybe. Or will will a tool made out will like any kind of tool made out of just last a really long time? Okay, so that's six iron ingots, bro. Let me just go ahead and very very disengage cool. the clutch. Okay. So does iron take a lot longer to turn into an ingot? Is that what you're uh, finding out here? Uh, iron has just a different sort of deal. You, you have to... Like a whole different process? Yes. Like, oh. I don't have to form the ingots of any other metal. I just pour them oh. into the metal, the ingot molds. Yeah. Whereas... Whereas we... iron, you have to uh, hammer. Yeah. Of course. Let, let me just Kenton take Johnson a look at the just iron showed up huh? and said, uh, I forget it's Sunday all evening and show up to the house to the house fixed and the Iron Age entered. Dang, look at you two go. Yes. Yeah, this yes. has been a good session. Oh, you have God, I have two. Made I'm some gonna, achievements I'm going to plant here. some pine trees. Now, I'll celebrate entering the Iron Age by planting a couple of pine trees. Let's see. That's yeah. interesting. One there. And... Carlos Monolith says meteoric, meteoric iron tool, tools are a bit more durable slash effective. Plus, the meteoric iron comes out of the bloomery as an ingot already. Oh, nice. Inside those, you have to work them on an iron anvil. Yeah, okay, that's. Iron anvil. That's. Okay. Yeah, okay, so it's going to be a little while before we're in the meteoric age. Um, yeah. But that's fine. Uh, there's definitely no rush for that. I'm just thrilled that we've got iron. Okay, so yeah, our precious six iron ingots here. Of course, the thing is, now I'm pretty sure we have to heat them up and then work them on the bronze anvil. So, yeah, let me just go get it, I guess, and I'll put it back later. Oh, you need to pull the anvil out of the windmill in order to, uh, like, actually smith things on it. Yeah. Yeah, so we are going to need more anvils. Oh, uh, we definitely have enough iron to make an iron anvil. Okay, well, what I'm thinking of right now, though... Yeah, the hunt for borax! Because we can head for the Steel Age. What I am thinking of right now, though, is I think we both want, what, an iron pickaxe and what else? Um, uh, well, iron pickaxe, box? obviously, is always the most important thing. But frankly, it'd be nice to have, like, an axe, a shovel, a knife. Um, I can do four. I mean, I guess foxes should really... Oh, God, you know what? We oh. should make armor. Charlie, I'm, why don't we have any armor? We should make armor, but I'm going to make us a pickaxe and a fox blade each first. How's that? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. But I'm I'm realizing. Oh man. Yeah. Yeah, we've been neglecting armor completely. I know. Completely for a long time. There we go. Oh, get up there. All right, and then we Correct. can make an iron. We can make an iron anvil pretty pretty easily. 
Although, I think, do we cast it? I, I think so. I'm not sure. Okay, so you're heating up, right? And I have my hammer, right? Okay. okay. Now, everything seems to be going okay. I can't believe we're coming up on the berries again. I'm going to die. I can't <laughs> do it again. I can't do it again. Hold on, let me see. What's my nutrition like? Oh, pretty good, actually. My nutrition's pretty fucking stellar, to be honest. Yeah, I'm thinking that might be a big part of why uh, monsters don't seem so scary right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think I will go and take a peek -see on the bees. See how they're doing? Okay, so empty, large... Empty, empty. Oh, this Three. rain is just not ending. Okay, so wow, the app, the trees are apple trees are absolutely establishing themselves. Wow, freaking wild just to see it. Like the trunks are getting so thick. We're gonna have apples next year. Like the house is so this... goofy looking, but it's I have worked so hard. <laughs> the house is great. You could... It's so goofy. Good. Right. Anyway, this just said hell hammers also make plates. Yeah, these they are do. much easier to use to make chain for armor. Iron padlock, iron cleaver. Let's make an iron. Ooh, short sword head. A steady and reliable weapon. So I think a short sword is better than. Okay, uh, shit. I am just going to make a pickaxe first, and everyone can tell me what the fuck. Like, do I have to do uh, special things to make an iron short sword? Like, please enlighten me before I fuck up. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Um, there is that special iron sword that only blackguards can make. Mm -hmm. But we are not doing yeah. classes here. We're both commoners. Yes. You want to maybe unlock the special items so that we can get them. I suppose we could, but I, I want Otherwise, we'd never get yeah. to play with them. That might be, that, that might make sense, yeah. But like, yeah, if anybody, it's like to make the iron short sword, I need to make sure I'm not about to like make one part and then fuck myself because it's half a part mm. and I won't be able to make the other part. I think a short sword might be better than a false. So, you know. Um, huh. But wait, there's. I'm a little confused right now. What? What's wrong? Um, What's oh, that? okay. So there's the. So you are talking about. Yeah, so the short sword is the blackguard weapon. Is it? Yeah. Okay, so we can't make it. There's just Falks's and blackguard short swords. The iron short sword head that you can make is an ingredient for the blackguard weapon. So we should not As do far that. as I know, because I'm not seeing any... I search for sword, and all I'm finding is blackguard short sword, iron short sword head, and then every flavor of Falks. Okay, so Falks's it is. Oh, yeah, Abyss just said short sword is the base for blagger blade. So we can't make that, so we should leave that alone. Well, I think you can unlock the ability to make it. It's just iron short sword head, piece of charcoal, and a stick. <laughs> I don't know if it's at all better than an iron falks, though. I think it might Not just a be clue. Yeah, easier to make or something. Doesn't seem easier. Cause you still need an iron blade either way. That is true. Well, it's got to have some Wait. kind of benefit. Um, are silver weapons and gold weapons better than iron? I don't think so. Are they? Yeah, iron fox is attack tier two. So is it's, it's, it's. I mean, attack tier uh, four and range two point five. Okay, so I'm making an they're, iron they're fox right four. now. Last and chance to tell me not. Oh, and anvil iron top. Oh, cool. Uh, shit. Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, wait, no. Shit. Oh, okay. The silver that. and gold falxes are technically oh, that's... steel. Oh, that's what. The... Oh, I, I but, regret. What... I regret everything. What happened. Need help. Oh, I regret everything. <laughs> uh, I didn't know it was gonna be like that. All right. I was wondering how you make an iron anvil, and oh, I was. I was humbled terribly. 
Okay. What is it? It's terribly expensive. What's going no, on? It's just you can't not make it once you decide to do it, and I wish I hadn't decided to do it. Oh, yeah. are we stuck now? Uh, the the yeah. um the ingot itself is stuck now, so. Okay. <laughs> there we go. That was a nasty, nasty surprise. Hmm. There we go. Ooh. And. Oh, okay. I don't suppose you can hear that. Turtle? Oh, hell yeah. No, I mean, my Skype alerts. No, no, I can't hear okay. your Skype alerts. Thank God. <laughs> Uh, that would be driving me insane. Where people are fucking, like, I, that is absolutely a work Skype. Just FYI, I only use Skype for work. So just go ahead, take a look at the time, and see what time I am getting work Skype. Ah, uh, yeah, it is 11.05 here in Chicago, folks. Yeah, and that, that's, that is when I am getting work Skypes. 11.05 on, on a tough day. Yeah. On a long weekend. That is, that is the kind of business you are in. You are not in a nine to five job. No, I am not. On a long weekend, this is. This is hmm. nope. <laughs> Which, now, another business you might think, oh, maybe it's important. Maybe this is something urgent. <laughs> but I'm, I'm actually not too concerned about that. Yeah. I think it is probably like some normal shit it is some normal shit. i'm hoping like, that it is there is nothing unusual about me being skyped about work or otherwise contacted about work at 11 p.m on a sunday yeah <laughs> i think that is how it goes i mean i used to make this joke on twitter that was all like the pros of working for uh, of working for yourself you make your own hours the cons of making working for yourself there will be 16 of them today <laughs> it's like yeah pretty it's much. entirely your fault yeah you yeah. made these hours yeah. you were the one who decided to be working at all times yeah i mean it's i can't really say shit this is a life i literally chose i went way out of my fucking way to be all like give me some of that don bluth shit let me i'm, I'm gonna make <laughs> what, give me some of that banjo the woodpile cat shit we're gonna do that we're gonna do that I'm just going to fucking, why not? I'm just going to do that thing that like hardly any, anybody fucking does. I'm just going to fucking participate in the remaking of goddamn animation. I'm going to do that. I'm going to, oh, hey, a uh, new so, paradigm of animation production. I think I'll do that. Just let's do that. So people other than me can indeed hear the Skype alerts because oh, uh, they're listening to you over OBS while mm -hmm. I'm listening to you over Discord. Oh, well. Sorry. So they can hear that just like they can hear me. That's work. I'm ignoring it's it. It's another right app now. on your machine. It can literally wait. It's it's 11 p.m. on a Sunday before Memorial Day. It can wait. Yeah. But yeah, that's work. <laughs> Please shoot me. It do be like that sometimes. It do be like that many times. Okay. Oh, okay. Ooh, look at so that windmill go. I, I fucked up super bad, and I only made one Falx blade. Would you like it, or do you want me to keep it? Um, I if you want to have your your your, your Falx blade, you can have it. Okay, I will uh, have my Falx blade. Would you like my old bronze Falx blade? Um, this one will break eventually. Yes, I am joining you now outside. Oh, uh, where are you? Where'd you go? Oh, you're far away. Yeah, I'm just uh, gathering some blocks. What you doing up here? Gathering blocks. Okay. Just go. thinking I might want um, like actual solid stone blocks to do things. And uh, that is yours too. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Always good to have an extra. And now, folks, check it out. Iron pickaxe, tool tier 4, durability 1,000 out of 1,000. Let's compare that to the tin bronze, 450. So this is twice as durable. Breaks rocks with ease. Okay, so that's where we're at. We're in the Iron Age. Nice and tight oh, yeah. in the Iron Age. 
Pretty exciting stuff. Let's eat some rice porridge with cranberries to celebrate. Wow, hardly any left. Okay, let's make some more food then. You know what? I don't need to take this with me everywhere. There we go. Ooh, I have not left the homestead at all. I guess I could eat some of these. God knows we'll have a lot in a minute. There we go. Hello, bees. How are you doing? There we are. And actually, I'm going to go check on those pear trees. See if we can't get some pears off of them. Shout out to pears. No one gets that. I don't care, though. I'm glad I said it. Shout out to pears. Shout out to pears. Is that from? Is that from a thing? Uh, there was, like, some dude getting interviewed. I think he was, like, a DJ or a rapper or something. He was talking about, yeah, I'm trying to eat better these days. I'm eating a lot of pears. Shout out to pears. Huh? <laughs> Oh, it was just, it was a very, very minor meme for a while. Shout out to Paris. You know what, I'm going to go and get that um, uh, meteoric iron now. Why not, right? Okay, so it says here tree state fruiting. So how does one fucking gather? How do, how do you defruit it? How do you defruit it, everyone? I don't, surely I don't just do like... You beat the shit out. How do you harvest its bounty? How do I harvest these? I do not punch it, do I? Surely I do not punch it. If anyone wants to tell me how to do it, I would well, be happy Well, you right-click berry bushes. Yeah. I'm gonna... Requires tier stone one to... I don't want to break it, bro. How do I... It says fruiting. Surely I don't just smash them. Does right-clicking work? Ripe in 1.1. Oh, ripe in about one days. Thank you. Oh, it's not well, done. then. I didn't even see yeah, that. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Thank you. I fucking don't read nothing. Look at me. Thank you. Uh, I so love how often you complain about how no one reads anything. Shut up. And when you put out, like, a Kickstarter update or something, you have to put it in bullet points, all bold, and use very short sentences. Well, it's true. Because no one reads. Best. Nobody does read anything. Yeah. I have literally had people on Twitter going, just so you know, I've been very disappointed in the lack of updates, like literally the day after I posted an update. And I'm all like, did you see yesterday's update? And they're like, no. I'm like, yeah. do, you, no, that's, like uh... do you get the emails when I make an update? And they're like, I turned those off. <laughs> it's like, I don't know what to fucking say to people like that. Like, mm. you make it so that you don't know when I update, that you physically do not know when I update, and then you get angry when you miss an update. I don't know what to fucking say to you. Oh! What? What? Uh, oh, drifters, I just saw them, like, drop out of nowhere. I do not want to fight them right now. I want to fight them. Where are you? I am south. South and a little west. South by Southwest, yeah. South and a little west. You, you're much farther away than that. I can't even see you on the map. Hell yeah. I'm going to go and get the meteoric iron. Oh, okay. May it sound like I could go beat up some drifters and they aren't even here. No. Break my heart. You know how I am. I'm always running off. Oh, wow. Look at all these parsnips stunted due to heat. Hey there, mature carrots. Still ten of you. Okay. Oh, um, uh, pencil beers just brought up. They probably want you to update via Twitter. That reminds me of a thing. Um, apparently, Twitter has a rule against having multiple Twitter accounts. That cannot be true. Uh, apparently, it is. Which seems idiotic. Untenable. Yeah. Like. You, you need different accounts for separate purposes. Oh, fucking goddammit, Jesus! Holy shit, what's up? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> There's a fucking drifter in the cellar. Really? Yeah. I put down rocks on shit. Oh, wait, no, you've got the part of the cellar that's not a uh, path. Oh, that scared the goddamn shit out of oh. me. Woo. Seemed very dramatic. Well, it just, you know, I don't have any control over what I say when I'm, like, screaming. 
Unfinished uh, anvil top. Yes, I know. Animals. What does he do? I just sort of start, you know, saying stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It scared me. Okay. I'm anyway. Let's just destroy this, I guess. Blue okay. fired clay shingles. That's a thing we can get. That seems like that might look really nice. Honey nuggets. Smelting temperature. Yeah, smelts into one iron ingot. Okay. Well, we'll take care of you later. More doors. There we go. Let's just go ahead and put you away. God, we have so much iron now. Jesus Christ. Hmm. Make sure all the doors are closed, because god, they can just fucking waltz in anywhere, I guess. Okay, so that's kind of long. I gotta take care of that chest down there. There's something splashing in water near me. <laughs> I hope it's drifters. It's I mean, um, there could be bears out I here. See bears, I am still scared of. To eat my goddamn food. Where are my rocks? This rabbit's going to die. Oh, it's so quiet out here after the rain stopped. Damn it! Oh, damn it! Damn it! Ah, uh, there it is. I'm never gonna hit that thing. Oh, there they are. Hey, babies. Where are you going? Don't leave. Bitch. There we go. I gotta say, my sanity is doing a lot better now that I've got Twitter off my phone. I can understand that. You know what really improved it for me, Penciliers? When I installed like a bunch of plugins that basically so because like, all right, here's the thing. I'm sure this is not news for anybody. We all know this, but Twitter right now is being basically manipulated to cause maximum carnage, like maximum anxiety and maximum argumentativeness and just maximum nonsense. That's what, because that is, what they call, you know, fucking engagement. Okay. And it makes you miserable. Okay. And it's the kind of thing where it's like the engagement, like the fucking program, it's programmed to make you incredibly unhappy because it's programmed to show you things that make you want to argue because things that want make you want to argue are considered engagement because you were on Twitter longer. And they don't really care how they get you to stay on Twitter longer as long as you do. And the same way rage clicks kind of govern everything they're trying to just keep you incredibly upset all the time that's like the mm -hmm. current state of twitter right Probably now gotten, it got does the meteoric not, iron now oh good right now that doesn't like work on me super well primarily because of all the shit i have installed to counteract it like i need to use twitter for professional purposes and to make twitter bearable i no longer see trending topics I no longer see a for you page. I no longer see blue check people. Like I just don't see them. So honestly, Twitter is very pared down right now for me. And that's the only way to make it bearable. And it's kind of fucking sad, ah, you bitch. It's kind of fucking sad that I have to do that. That like I have to literally fight the program so that I can bear to be on it. But such is the state of the fucking world. If I'm the used to anything, I'm used to the thing, world not being built to accommodate me. Trust me. You know, yeah. so I figure it out for myself. And, um, yeah, I can see how just literally pulling it off your phone will make you a much happier person. That makes all the sense mm. in the world to me. Although I have to say I've been enjoying Blue Sky so far. Yeah, there's no reason to expect that it's not going to turn into exactly the oh, same thing. it's going to turn into I, an absolute shit show because Jack is a fucking moron. Um, it's, basically, it's going to be pre-Musk Twitter. 
Yeah, it's gonna be Primo Squitter. Like, I, I should note here, I say this to Matt all the time, I don't like Jack. Like, I viscerally don't like Jack. And part of that is because of what it took for him to understand not all speech is harmless. Just because it's not a knife in a hand does not make speech harmless. And yeah, I think you're... Uh, no, you're, he's an idiot. Well, you're underestimating how much this stuff that he disliked but didn't feel okay about removing from the platform bothered him. Because I saw an, an interview with him where he just seemed harrowed. I don't give a shit about running. Jack's feelings. I give a shit about Jack's actions. And he didn't do anything yeah, yeah, that entirely. makes me think he would but do anything point, different. The point is, like, this was clearly a journey for him. I hate him. You can hate him. <laughs> That's fine. He is every solutionist tech bro I have ever seen. Some guy who, <laughs> who fucking thinks that the answer to every problem can be found in code. That is Jack. I don't like him. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't, I don't think that's actually not true about him. I think he's a horrible person. I think he just straight From up doesn't care I about saw. marginalized people. I mean, it took literally no i think i think doesn't care is the wrong angle because no. i i from what is he he seemed to care from what i saw we shall fucking see i the i point just, was yeah I, i'm not saying he's going to be any different no i don't think he will be remotely this time different. Around. And, and that is why i talk about i don't give a shit about his feelings it's his actions that matter you, you can't say you don't care about his feelings and then make statements about his feelings though okay Fair so enough. you don't don't say don't care. Fair enough. Say didn't do anything for. I don't think his that's, feelings that's will affect position. his behavior. I think he will shed a perfect crystalline tear while he fucks up Blue Sky the same way he fucked up Twitter. Yeah, well that that I won't argue with. And again, his fucking feelings when he there is no change in his behavior are goddamn irrelevant. How about that? That's entirely fair. Yeah. Also, I found another um, temporal gear. Oh, holy shit. Well, then we can find a uh, translocator anytime. Yes, we can. Yes. Oh, fuck. The berries are coming in. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, God, please. Please, God. Return please. of the berries. God, please. No, please. Oh. Okay, so I now have four pieces of meteoric iron, which nice. I think is enough for two uh, meteoric iron ingots. Nice. So, you know, it's not world changing, but uh, we could make a couple really nice... Um, something out of them. Yeah, we could. Like swords. Yeah. Perhaps swords. Perhaps. <laughs> to be honest, the nice thing about oh. Mastodon is that you run it on your own server on your own website. Like, the big instances aren't like this, but if you want to run your own page and post whatever you want, it's nice. Yeah, Pencil is... I tried out Mastodon, and Mastodon... The best way to put it is I do not think it is a bad thing. I do not think it is conducive to how I need to use social media. It feels, I, I still feel like giving it a chance. No, I mean, you should totally give it a chance. Is, you should totally time give it a is chance. an issue. But here's the thing. I use social media for self-promotion and promotion of Iron Circus. And mm. I don't think that that angle is particularly well served by Mastodon. I, yeah, think, I think Mastodon, Mastodon is on... good for like, hey, everybody, you know, let's all post our art in here. Let's all do this. Let's all right. do that. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. that's what Mastodon is great for, for like, you know, maybe two dozen people who share the same interests and are trying to coordinate, like, their con trip or something. I think that makes mm -hmm. perfect sense. But I don't think Mastodon is particularly useful to someone like me. Yeah, Mastodon is good for, like, if there is a scene on there that you want to be part of. Exactly. You don't, it, it's not going to be, it's, I mean, I don't think it's ever going to be the platform with the largest share of the market, you know? Yeah. But like a whole bunch of people with some stuff relevant to you mm -hmm. going on like that, that seems like that could be very possible. Like there, like there is a role playing game scene there, you know, that's relevant to me. So I should probably fucking check it out already. Yeah. Maybe it'll be the new Google Garrelous, Plus. Who knows? Garrulous Monolith is saying Mastodon seems more like a Discord replacer than a Twitter replacer. It feels that way to me, too. Uh, see, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. yeah, I think Blue Sky is taking off like it is just because it basically is a Twitter clone. It's just pre Musk Twitter. It's pre Musk Twitter. It will have it's all the problems that it clone. did in all likelihood. Yeah, and, no, I've not I mean, heard I, any. I, I haven't been looking I think it'll it. collapse because I'm not like these people that expect it to be permanent. 
I re- I'm really not. I don't think that it will be perfect. No, I baby, think nothing is. There are always going to be like these sort of shifting, like priorities and shifting popularities and all that other shit, and uh-huh. that's just kind of how it's going to be. And you know, Twitter won't last forever, and Blue Sky won't last forever, and Facebook won't last forever. The same way newspapers won't last forever, and. Uh-huh we'll figure something out when the time comes simply be- by na- the nature of people will need something so something will happen yep that's kind of my this opinion this too and shall I, pass i don't yeah this too shall pass i just i don't think it's worth oh god oh twitter's being ruined yeah a lot of things get ruined you know <laughs> a lot of things get don't ruined. expect and to it's stick worth with noting anything too forever. that twitter is being ruined under very sp- specific circumstances it's being ruined specifically by one dude who's ruining it in a very specific way that is not sort of Mm -hmm. like the nature of the beast that is the machinations of a sociopath this is an accident of history depending entirely on one person having too much money exactly and if anything i hope this like it's one of those things where i'm just like let this radicalize you that's like a thing i hear a lot like let this radicalize you this is what we're talking about this is when we're talking about when it's like it's possible for a person to have a literal dangerous amount of money if he's doing this to your social media platform imagine what he's doing to your congressman let this radicalize Mm -hmm. you anyway just saying that's the fucking truth right there there's food. Is there food? Um, there should be some cooked meat in the storage jars downstairs. Oh, okay, cool. Do we have any extra lime? We do. Let's just get this ground up. Oh, God, I love it. I mean, whatever's closest to being rotten. Yep. There we go. Come on, you're fine. There we go. So you said you found some candles. Yeah, it's on a, a bedroom table upstairs. Okay. I would like to add as many candles to the bunch of candles as we can. Oh, okay. I just want to see well, now how we've many got candles these. is too many candles for the bunch of candles. Hmm. <laughs> what, is the, what, is the, what is the maximum for the bunch of candles? I thought you would want to make a, a lantern out of it. Uh, I can do that. I mean, I can make a lantern any old time. Hmm. Well, I'm still carrying around uh, an oil lamp, so I, I could use a lantern. Oh, okay. I don't want to take any lanterns off the wall because yes. that might result in more uh, surprise drifters. Yeah, that sucks. I can definitely make us some, some copper lanterns. They're, they're no big deal now. But, okay, hmm. so this is prepared and prepared. So these are prepared hides. I am still, We, by the way, just FYI, we do have like 28 pieces of leather. So I'm going to go ahead right now. I'm going to see what a, oop, okay. I'm going to see what a body leather jerkin costs. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 13, 14. So 14. So it's 14 for a leather jerkin. Let's do that. Let's see if we can't make ourselves the little tiniest bit. Oh, we can both have a leather jerkin. Leather jerkin would be good, but we can make metal armor at this point, can't we? Yes, but we Get need a jerkin to constant. attach the leather to. Oh, the, uh, okay. Yeah, I forgot to about the that armor. kind of process. Okay, ah, so. cool, cool, cool. Oh, uh-oh. Oh, I thought this would work. Oh, it, it does. Okay. So, that's two leather jerkins we have now made. And if I'm not mistaken... Oh, already. Nice. Um, armor. Leather body armor. We have a leather jerkin. If I'm not mistaken, we can go ahead and use plate body armor, copper, plate body armor, bronze. Plate body armor, bronze. Seems like a good idea. Um, what we would need is... Huh. Plate body armor, chain bronze, chain body armor. Okay, never mind. Let's see this. Chain body armor, tin bronze. Okay, so to make chain body armor, we need a booty leather jerkin. How do we do that? Okay, so I guess that's what we've made. We've made a leather jerkin there. And then we need to add tin bronze chain to it. And... 
It looks like we make that with two ingots. So two, four, six, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty. So twenty-two ingots is what we need to make one chain body armor. That seems like a lot, bro. Is this really correct? Like we can't just go straight to plate body armor? We can't? We absolutely can't? Wow. Seems kind of wacky, but... No. That seems like a hell of a sink. But I guess we don't have a choice. Sounds like vintage story, though. Yeah, sounds like vintage story. But yeah, um, I guess we need to smelt <laughs> a whole shitload of tin bronze, then. Hmm. Maybe, oh, let me know if you need anything harvested for the purpose. Yeah, maybe, maybe next time. That seems like a very intense thing. Oh yeah, that, that doesn't sound like something to do this session. I should definitely learn to keep these doors closed. This is a bad plan. Okay. But at least we have this cool self-grinding thing now. God, there are a lot of little beasties out there. I can hear them. Hmm. I'm gonna go look. Hope they don't knock me off my little walkway. There they are. Hey, fellas. Uh huh. Oh, now they're hitting each other. That's funny. Where are you going, dickhead? And there they go. Now, how are we doing? Not bad. Okay, so we can just use a few more. Oh, what was that? Okay. But I am carrying an oil lamp. I should figure out where to put that. Maybe down here? Sure, why not? Sure. Okay. But now, what is my nutrition looking like? Vegetable and protein. Okay. So, that'll be easy. 6 plus 6 equals 12. And... 11... Twelve. Time for mutton and carrot stew. What are you doing down there, by the way? You've gone all quiet. Oh, I'm just working on the storage area. Okay. Now that I've got a pick and I've got loads of cobble, now I finally fill these in. There we go. And... All right. So lunch is cooking. I think I may give the... Oh, look at those fuckers just hanging out out there. I think I'll go give them a taste of my brand new iron folks. Hey, bitch. Mm. There we go. That's enough out of you. Where's my knife? Oh, I might make myself a little iron knife. That might be nice. Of course, there's nothing on you. Oh, God, that's right. The berries. No, Lord, please, no. No, Lord, Lord, please. I'm not strong. Is it berry picking time? I'm not strong enough, Lord, please. I think it might be berry picking time. Oh, well, that's oh. good. No. Oh, God, the cranberries. Please, Lord, please! Not the cranberries, Lord. Not the blackberries, Lord, please! Not the red curves. So much. So many berries! So what's down here? Oh god, even the bushes are starting to change. It's starting to get cold. It feels like it just got warm, dude. Oh, really? It's getting yeah. cold? Well, oh, it's geez. just that the, the, the trees are starting to take on that autumn tinge. 
Oh no. Oh yes. I like that. Not a lot we can do about it. This is where we chose to settle in. Can't move now. Hmm. Oh hello. You're dead. I don't remember killing you. Oh, let's see if you got anything worthwhile. What is your life amounted to? Let's find out. Nothing. Hmm. Okay. Now, just for fun. Let's head downstairs. Let's see what the juice situation is looking like. So this is 38 liters of blackcurrant juice. This is wine, this is wine. This is wine, this is wine, this is wine. And this is juice. Okay. So. Boop, boop. All right. Might as well. Oh. Can I drink juice? Yes, I can. Two. Three. There we are. And you know what? I might actually go so far as to just go ahead and make another few barrels. God, I can't face another round of berries. But hey, oh, what the fuck, bro? Come here. Get the fuck off my land. Gross. Of course there's nothing on you. Okay. God! Go away! Don't you fucking throw rocks at me. They're everywhere! Gross! Okay. At least that one dropped some twine. I'm gonna go check on that pear tree. It says ripe in a day. It's been a day, right? Let's see. Mm. I want pears. I want pears and not one of you can fucking stop me. I deserve pears. Oh. Point 0.8 days, point 0.7 days. You're stupid. I'll be back. Woo! Almost killed myself. I'll be back tomorrow. I demand pears. This is nonsense. Also, I am like deeply offended. I am trying. I've been trying to grow that pear tree in the fucking greenhouse for a thousand years, and it just refuses to work. Mm. Look at that. Look, everyone. See, it almost, it still looks like shit. It still looks like shit, and I'm going to fix it, but it looks better, right? Like, it, it doesn't have to look that bad, and I should be ashamed, but I, and I am. Don't worry, I am. I will fix it. But it doesn't look as bad as it used to. I can These aged crates are different from the others. Really? Unusual, yeah. Like, different sizes, or they've got like... Oh, is this what you're up to? Yeah. By the way, I'm going to go make some parchment really quick, so you can get some... Uh... Parchment would be extremely helpful. Yeah, I'm. you said small, only small... Um, yeah, if you, so if you soak a small hide, and then scrape it, and then, um, I don't know, you cut it with... Um, Shears, I think. Okay. Yeah, that's. How that's... many would you say you need? Um, we've got enough wall space down here for twenty-four crates. Twenty. Um, I'm not sure how many crates we've got. Basically, it's any of these you can make. I mean, you're, you're using small hides for anything else? Um, not really. No. Previously, we have so. twenty-two small hides, I think. Yeah. So I'll just more. use those. Yeah, just twenty-two small hides. Okay, well, let's see what we got here. Other thing that I need to do is start labeling these trunks. Fifty-five. OK. 
Okay, and now I'm not sure what the right way to do because you can't actually put labels on trunks. Mm -hmm. If I slap a sign on the wall next to it, I figured that ought to work. Okay. I have sealed the 22 rod hides away and they are, they are, cool. they are curing right now. So another time we will be able to uh, yes. the parchment's going. We have to figure this house out. Like It looks better than it did. It's still kind of like, what the fuck though. I mean, it's better than it was. It's not like an absolute hmm. piece of shit, but you know. Disengage the clutch. I mean, this is not a bad looking place, but. Still. It's not. It's not. I mean, it's gross, but it's not like terrible. Well, all right. I think. It, be it beats the fucking hovel we started with, certainly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, it, it beats a lot of the stuff that we've been through. Yeah. I think I might be. How much? Let me. I'm gonna figure out how many ingots we need to make the iron anvil and then see what I need to do about that. Let me just eat some of this first. Okay. What you doing out here? Oh, you're not out here. Huh? Oh. You disappear so quickly. I'm down in the basement again. Oh, okay. I can't help it. I'm gonna go check on the chickens. Hello, darlings. Oh. Okay. Still one day. Why aren't you sitting on this? Ten hours. Okay, that's good. Hello. What's going on in here? Let me let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Come on. Alright. Three days. Okay, I'll take that. Okay, so pretty soon we will have Generation 3, which will be nice. But first, let me get some more more flax into these chickens. Because they refuse to finish their lays. It's weird. Finish laying. And this can go with the other eggs. We can have a whole big onions and scrambled eggs thing later. At least these keep longer than meat. Hmm. Gotta see what you're up to down here. The curiosity's killing. Yeah, me. this, is, so well, this is kind of still a um, clearly concentrating. It was that. So this is kind of a work in progress here. I'm mm -hmm. not sure if we're gonna go with it. Kind of a pain in the ass to look at the signs over here, but you can't put signs directly on. Well, actually, well, let's let me see if I'm even right about that. Maybe I can put a sign directly on these things. I and think also, you need to break it and then put it in your. Oh, or you can do that. That might. Be acceptable. Can I it, it'll it? be I can more visible it. that way. Yeah. Yeah. That works fine by me. Can't open it if you click the sign. Um, so anyway, this is going to be like the deep storage for like single item types. Yeah. As you can, like, look over here. We've actually got more than a full crate of the salt stone. I'm not surprised. Um, so if you ever want to make anything with stones, yeah. I know, might that, have that to. There. Yeah, I've got a lot of plans for stuff in the future. What is 
Okay, so everything's fine here. Oh, hey! Our pickled ca our pickled carrots are done. Cool. Fresh for 2.3 years. That's what I like <laughs> to see. I'm so excited. We already have a ton of carrots, though. I'm just hoping, you know what, oh, while I'm waiting, while I'm chilling out, while I'm just sort of hanging out, waiting to be able to pick those pears, I'm going to go look for some sheep. And I'm going to check on the fucking pumpkins. Why haven't you made a pumpkin the entire goddamn time? Why? Pumpkins seem to be a real problem. They're annoying. This does keep coming Just when out. I think things are going well, they're like, like, no, never mind, I don't make pumpkins anymore. It's so stupid. Anyway, where's my knife? I'm fully expecting to run into a shitload of wolves over here. Oh, interesting. This says metal armor is very intense. That's why I usually stick with the cloth armor. It's defense 2, which is 85% of monsters. And the tailored gambeson looks cool. Hmm. That pig is looking at me. I don't think I like its face. Whoa, where are you going, buddy? Holy, I thought you were going to attack me. Bah! Oh, dang it. Not for sure. I could get that pig to attack me. Oh. I don't suppose Bro over here has restocked anything interesting. Might as well see what Leo's up to. Hello, Leo. What you got for me? Okay, saltpeter, which I have tons of. Linen, which I don't need anymore. Alum chunk. That's not bad. Bismuthonite. Eight pieces of charcoal, 16 pieces. Okay, so mostly crap. Thanks, Leo. Thanks for wasting my time. Thanks for ruining my day. Thanks. Hmm. <gasps> Hello, sheeps. Okay, so that's a boy's sheep. Oh, and that's a pig. Hi, pig. I might just give you a smack. Oh, you're running now? Let's do it. Oh, come on. That was such a... Fuck off. Okay, so here are some... Oh, wow. Look at all those. Okay, so... Found the sheep. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try and domesticate. This is going to be a grotesque fucking... Uh, oh, it's gonna be... This is gonna be bad. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Alright, I'm gonna try and do something here. Where are they? What if... I hit this sheep. <gasps> Yay! <laughs> you okay there? I don't know. I just gave it a little smack. <laughs> Whoop! Whoop! Are you still? <gasps> oh! Are, are you having a rough time with sheep? <laughs> Not expecting this to be so troublesome. <laughs> oh my! Oh. Uh, uh, okay. Oh, he was so mad. <laughs> <laughs> oh. He was mad. <laughs> okay. Oh, another session with no deaths. So far. Well, you it? say so far, but I think we're about done here. It's yeah, damn near are. midnight. Hold we on. have achieved a lot. Ugh. I think we should probably log off real soon. Yes, we should. Oh, okay. Poultices, poultices, poultices. 
Okay, you and before we do that, though, I want to get going on this sheep domestication. <laughs> oh, have Woo! you got the sheep uh, in a place? Uh, I, I I made him chase me, so now if I could just find uh Have you got him right where you want him? Shut up. But <laughs> Let's see, is it one, two, three, four, five? Yes, large trough. That's what I want. Okay, that can go there, and now I just need some hay. Where's my knife? Perfect. Okay. Hello. All right, there we go. All right. Hey, Mr. Mr. Sheep. Mr. Sheep. <laughs> I am so sorry about our disagreement. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, can you believe I was so fucking rude? Can you believe how rude? Okay, there we go. I'm all healed up now. Hey, Mr. Sheep! I'm gonna hit you with a stick. Hey, Mr. Sheep! Where are all your girlfriends, Mr. Sheep? <laughs> I spanked him. <laughs> I spanked a dude. Okay. All right. Uh, okay. Do I have to spank him again, I think? Hi. Yes, come here. Come here. Hi. Yes, it's me. It's me. I hit you. I'll hit you again. Come here. I'll hit you again. I'm right here. I'm right here. He's stupid. <laughs> Ooh. Living on the edge. It's me. It's me. I hit you. I hit you with a rock. <laughs> okay. So I have now dragged over a male. I'm hoping the females follow him. It is possible. I'm not seeing any, but I'm just using grass. So what is that? Oh, it's just the head of a pig sticking through the fence. Okay. <laughs> Come on, sheep. Okay. Okay, he seems to be working his way over. So this is this is a tried and true technique, just giving the sheep a little smack, a little smack on the butt, mm -hmm. and then dragging mm -hmm. him over here. I think I'll have to do that a little more often. Whoa, whoa, what are we doing here? I'm no, I'm just noticing a whole lot of missing a uh, whole lot of missing chests. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm moving that downstairs. Okay. There will be sufficient room now. Where is this idiot going? I will throw a rock at you. Hi. Did you not see the deliciousness I lay down for you? Over here, stupid. <laughs> Yes. Yes. So, I'm wondering, like, if it seems like a pain in the ass mm -hmm. to uh, go downstairs to put things in a chest, uh -huh. we could put ducts up on the surface, I'm chutes, sh yeah. that siphon stuff down to specific chests. They will not sort. It they does not appear not, to no. be a way to get it to sort. Chutes but, could be you know, nice. They, put but stuff shoots, in the right chute, it'll go in the right chest. also sound extremely expensive. Well, they take some metal. Yeah. Upper, I think. Yes, indeed. Um, so anyway, we've got more space here. We can so we can put more shelving and such. Oh, I really want to do more display cases. Get some kind of museum situation going on. Uh huh. Man, that sheep is just swimming around over there. I don't know if it'll come on land. Uh, do you need any help with these sheep? No, I'm good so far. I'm, I'm like happy with the storage for now. No, um, 
basically I'm being very haphazard about it, so if I wanted help, I would definitely try and do it in such a way that I wouldn't waste your fucking time, like I'm currently doing. Mm -hmm. Basically what I want to do is I want to smack them with a stick or throw a rock at the male sheep, because then the female sheep will follow them. And I want to do it without getting myself killed. And I'm looking for the sheep that... Did he drown himself like a fucking moron? Oh, it's right here. Look. Where is he? Oh. Over in the tree. Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah, um... So... Oh. So, shit. Okay. Ow. Yeah, Motherfucker. That don't actually hurt. Don't hit him. Don't hit him. Don't hit him. Get out of his way. Get out of his way. Get out of his All way. All right. Well, yeah, what's the, the plan here? Yeah, the whole idea is... Let's go Have across the way on you? and let's find more sheep and let's try and drag more of them over here. Hmm. And we'll do that by like throwing a rock specifically at the males. Don't worry about the females. Throw rocks at the males or hit them with like a stick. Don't do anything that'll do them actual damage. You know what I mean? Hmm. And I then... actually do not have any rocks on me right now. I, I put some. them all in the giant chest full of stones. Where are you? Here you go. I'm behind you. Um, right here, right here, right here. Turn around. What? Oh, all right. Cool, I get there it. That'll be more than you should. That's need. plenty. That's more than you'll ever need. Okay, so let's just get right over here and look for some sheep, and we will just like smack them gently on the butt with a stick, or we'll throw a rock at them, and we'll encourage them to chase us, and we'll jump in the water and try and swim them over to where the other sheep currently is. Okay. Okay, so we see a couple males here, right? Again, the females will follow them, so we're only worried about the males right now, okay? Okay. So what I'm going to do right now... All right, so you can pick a sheep and throw a rock and then tear ass for the lake. Yep, yeah, yeah. Hello, right here. Whoa, I'm don't running. chase me! I didn't do I'm it! I'm running. I'm <laughs> oh, hey, there's another one on the way back. Is he chasing me uh, or you? No, that that is, that is a wolf. That is a wolf. Get into the water. Same answer for both. Um, oh, oh, come on. Now's back. the time you freeze. Okay. Oh, stop chasing me. I think I might have to deal with the wolf. Okay. Um, that. I'm not. It's not. A, it's not attacking, but... I think if I mean, we've got a wolf running around where we're trying to play yeah, with these sheep. Yeah, I understand sheep, what you mean. It's going to be an issue. Yeah, we can kill it. Hello? Ooh, now it's coming for me. Whoa, it jumped through me into the water where it is. Oh, Charlie, careful. I know, I know what I'm doing. Oh, no, you don't. Okay, you almost well, got did killed. did you get hurt? Because I didn't. No, but I almost hit you. Yikes! Oh, you're a, you're a sow. Okay. I, I just... Don't worry about it. I can... Okay, so I found a, a, a ram, and I'm uh, going to just throw a rock at him. Those are pigs. Okay. Okay, he's coming. He's running. Nah, he lost interest. In you? I'll bother him. In me? You. Oh. Unless, unless you're talking about a different ram. No. Hello, I am the one who threw the rock. <laughs> it is me. I am the motherfucker. <laughs> yes. Yes, hello. No, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Hello. Ooh, I found some copper. Okay. Come get me, come get me. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Come get me, motherfucker. Come on. <laughs> Sheep. Sheep, hello. Hey, <laughs> I have to punch you. Right in your butt. Ow. <laughs> Careful now. Oh, it's bad. Oh, I'm going to die. I'm going to get sheep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no! Whoa, whoa! There were more wolves, as it turns out. I see. That. So, it has been this many sessions since one of us died. Yes. Zero. Respawn. Oh, I'm coming. Uh, to wherever that went down, North Lake. Oh my goodness. Something hit me, and I can't figure out what. It took out half There of is another wolf around there, at least one. Uh -huh. Probably just one. I gotta go get back and get my shit. Fair enough. 
grass. Yeah, we gotta de-wolf the area before we can yeah. uh, go playing games with the sheep. Fair enough. Now, where is all my stuff? I'm gonna go see if that ram is Perhaps really right there underneath that fucking wolf? Is that where my stuff is? Okay, so... That ram's where we left him. I need some poultices. I picked up two of your arrows, for what it's worth. Okay, that's cool. I don't know what her gave me. Okay, there's there's a sheep that's right at the edge of the water. I'm gonna throw a rock at it. I legit don't know where my stuff is. Oh no. It can't have gotten far. Yeah, it's somewhere that it's here's the wolf or a wolf. So um, mm -hmm. careful. That away, like right just north of us here. There is a wolf in there. Oh, I think I see him. Now, I was in... Yeah, he's right here. Interesting looking one. See, I'm looking right at him. Okay, well, your stuff is over here. Oh, okay. Uh, Thank there's... you. Oh, wow, I thought it would be in the water. Okay, that's a pig. I guess I got knocked out of my socks and I fell in the water. Yeah. Alright, well, this wolf is about to die. Bitch! I'm gonna fuck uh, you. Come here. You can't have gotten far. We, we gotta chase it down. Yeah. We can't have a, just a wolf like chilling out around here. Oh, we, we got business there to do. There he is. Come here. Come here. Let me kiss you. Let me kiss you. Let me kiss you. Come here. Let me kiss you. I wanna give you a kiss. Give you a kiss, 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 kiss. Come here. 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 Oh, right into the water? That's a smart move. Come here. <laughs> come here, baby. You have entered our domain. Bye -bye. Nice. Okay, now let's go ahead real quick and just chop you up. Okay, and I'm going to get back to looking for sheep. Yeah, and throwing things at them, hopefully. Cool. Raw bush meat in my inventory. Thanks. Oh, it's because I killed another wolf. Yeah. Okay, sheep. Where are my rocks? I'm going to throw some rocks at sheep. Now, there was a sheep at the water's edge earlier. Mm -hmm. Let's see if we can find that same one. Ram, I should point out. Yes. Rams are good because for. we are trying to get the ewes to follow the rams. Yeah, there weren't any ewes around, though. I think this is the one that already followed us. No, that one's on the other side of the lake right now. It's oh, like... really? We've got two over there now? No, we have one over there now. Okay, so yeah, so I'm... Okay, I got some pigs here. Pigs do not matter. Yeah, I'm talking about the one who was following me earlier. Okay. Pigs again. Lots More pigs. pigs. Where are they? I know there were some. Yeah, there certainly were. Oh, I heard a wolf. Wolf, wolf, wolf. wolf. Where is it? Where the fuck? Right here. Yeah, I saw it. I got low health. I probably should not do this. Oh, he's running. Well, I got arrows. Ugh. Shit. There he goes. Yeah. You see him? In the water? He's over here. Into the water like an idiot. Come here, buddy. That will never save you from us. There we go. Got him. Oh, watch out for the Mariana oh, Trench here. Okay. Okay. Now, if All the wolves rubbed. are done... Yes. Now, let's go back to throwing rocks at sheep. <laughs> if we can find some. There they are. There we go. Okay, I'm going to get on the other side of him. Okay. There we go. And this one's got a girl near him, so that's good. So let me just yeah. really quickly so maybe they orient will... myself so I can run straight for the water. Yeah. yeah. Okay, that is not correct. All right, straight for the water. Oh, wow, we are so far north. Okay. Um, where'd he go? Oh, there he goes. Girl. There he is. Okay. 
Oh, wolf! He did. Okay, never mind. We'll, we'll deal with the wolf. Oh, he's after me now. Fucker. <laughs> it ain't me go through it, asshole. <laughs> All right, where's that wolf though? We should be more worried about that. Oh, oh! Oh, he's still following you. Yes. I thought we had to rebother him. Okay, cool. Okay. <laughs> He's scared me. He's still after you. Oh, I know he is. He is moving. <laughs> oh, oh, no, he just stopped following. Oh, yeah? I'll rock him. Hello. All yes, right. your mare is not over. <laughs> now, don't Hello. hurt him too much. Come on. Remember, we need him Yeah, to I'm a little us. worried about that, actually. I don't know how many rocks these things can take. Basically, if he turns around and runs away, we've done it too much. Hmm. He's mad enough now, now that maybe we don't have to. Oh, shit. Oh, there we go. Is he following okay, come you? Come on. Uh, he is. Not quickly, because he's in the water. That's okay. But he'll be fast when he's on land. <gasps> Fuck Jesus God! Wolf. Oh no, it's just I, I got too close. Got him to right here, I got him here. Yeah, bring him close to me. Okay. Because over here is where the the food is. Ah. Okay. Where is he? Is he Okay, there he is on, on land. Hello? Hello? Do you not want to hurt me? Hello? Not anymore, Come on, let's fight. Come get me, come get me. He's walking towards the food, so that's good. Yeah, I don't wanna I don't wanna hit him again. I don't think we need to. Because he's been hit a few times. Okay. So yeah. Let's just leave Buddy. those two guys Look, here. Look, there's food. Look. You Look. need to not get too close to them. Whoa, yeah, I don't wanna get stuck between them. Yeah. Okay, so that's two male uh uh, rams, I guess. Yeah, and the ewes did not follow them the at all. The ewes did not follow them, but they may they may be here in a minute. We'll have to see. It may take them a while. Do you think they have any idea where these two are? Um, we m could go and rock the ewes. I think they might attack us too. So yeah, no, no, they'll they'll attack. I don't know if they'll chase the same way, mm -hmm. but it's worth a try. Yeah, but anyway, it is what time now? It is uh, midnight. It Holy is midnight oh seven. Oh my god, y'all. Um, look. <laughs> we got a lot done tonight, even though it doesn't feel like Hell we got yes. a lot done. I swear we did. Oh yes, we did. We fixed up the the windmill. We have entered the Iron Age. We have our first iron weapons and iron tools. We have cleaned up and reorganized down here. See? And look, like now it's not completely asinine how one gets into the windmill area. And we are preparing for another berry harvest, which I'm literally dreading. Oh, the berries. Yeah. The berries. So I think yeah. now would be a good time to go. Okay. I'm going to go and drink some alcohol. And uh, I think I'm going to call it an evening if that's cool with everybody. Because it's, okay. it's Memorial Day. Yay, yay, yay. Let me put that away. And I drink to your health. Let's see. With cranberry wine. Cranberry wine. I drink to your health with cranberry wine. Now, I think that's, what is it? Is it F12 that does it? No, that's that's not it. Is it F five? Oh, oh dear. Yes, it is F five. There, <laughs> it's me, and I drink to your health, everyone. And again, and again. <laughs> now I'm a little wobbly. Let's get some more. Let's. Oops. All right. Hold on. F five. There we go. <laughs> Let's get some the more. Slurp. Everyone, I, I, I drink to your health. Drink to your health again. Drink to your health a sixth time. Am I you wobbling? Are, yeah, no, you are drifting. Oof. Leaning. <laughs> and I'm full. You're full. I am, I oh, I'm wobbling away. And this is this is me thanking you all for, for coming in. We know y'all have things that you have important things to do in your evenings. And it's always nice oh when you choose to say to to spend that time with us. So
So yeah. yeah. Um, and once again, much. I'd like to thank everybody for watching us. I know you all don't have to. Uh, it's fun to play this game for you all, even if I bore the shit out of you by just building a windmill for like 90% of the stream. I hope you found the conversation at least interesting. And uh, our kamikaze of fucking <laughs> sheep will we'll open the next stream. And yeah, yeah um, streak over. If you're American, oh, hi, Jay Brooks, by the way. If you're American, um, you know, enjoy Memorial Day to the, to the extent that you are capable of it. I know I'll be taking tomorrow hey, off. Day off is always appreciated. Yeah. And thank you again so much. Oh, and thank you. Yeah, thank you, Susan. Yeah, yeah thanks, thanks for Susan. getting Wine Coast funded, everyone. It's I'm still incredibly committed to publishing weird fucking books, and Wine Ghost is definitely a weird fucking book. And I'm really yeah. I'm just really pleased that everybody that came really through fun. and kind of reasserted the Iron Circus mission statement, which can kind of get get lost in the sauce sometimes, you know, I, I, I still want to be the person out there publishing weird shit, you know, and I know there are a lot of other the, people that publish the, weird the shit too. It's not like categories of stuff. We know will make lots of money. Yeah. <laughs> the, the strange and amazing is still what it's really yeah, all about. Strange and amazing. Even the shit that is our fucking, our showboat properties are still pretty fucking strange. I, I take pride in saying. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah. Okay. Thank you everyone. Y'all are legends. Have a good Memorial day. Goodbye. Good night, everybody.